Let's see. You had to eat and you don't like to eat on stream? Yeah. I know I might have a few snacks here and there on stream. But, uh, yeah, I... I like to kind of pig out, you know, when I eat. <laughs> Especially when it's Taco Bell. Oh, yeah. What'd you get Taco Bell? I got Taco Bell a couple weeks ago. I'd been craving it for a long time. It's got some... Couple crunchy tacos and a spicy beef. Not spicy beef. Spicy potato. Uh, soft taco. It's good. So this should hopefully we'll I th think uh I think we got everything resolved as far as how things are looking. You've been craving Taco Bell for two months. Good evening. Evening, Arthur. Yeah. I don't I don't eat much fast food, but you okay? Sometimes when you're craving it, you know. You crave it. Um what do you like to get? The Taco Bell. I always love in this game the stories they tell around the campfires. But I hope you're doing well, G Man, Z Man. I was eleven. First time I shot a man. His hope you all had a good Thanksgiving. <laughs> we all think that all the time. I thought God himself would come down and take vengeance on me for what I had done, but and I love the graphics. Cheesy Gordita Crunch. Point. Hell yeah. Well, I guess we'll be all right. I guess we'll be we all right. Dutch. We got Dutch. We got Cheesy Gordita Crunch. Convince good old St. Peter he got it wrong. It's Dutch. <laughs> <laughs> oh. We weren't that bad. Come on. Let us in. Yeah, let, let us, us in. in. Talking about going to pearly, pearly gates. So, uh, what should we do? Where were we? Okay, that's right. We have missions. Missions. We had to do missions for, uh, what's his name? Uh, we gotta go collect money from some folks. We got Mr. Robale, Chick Matthews, and Billy Millet. All right, well. Let's uh let's go hmm get reacquainted with uh everything we're at. We can play poker. We can uh we can go to sleep. Nine sixteen at night. Maybe we should sleep. Yeah, cheesy gordita crunches tasty. Let's take a look at the old Oh, I was looking Hi there. I guess once you do these Next three missions, you can. I think that's where you, when you can start upgrading the camp. But uh, let's see. So well, we got a hundred over a hundred bucks. Yeah, was, you all right? We don't need to give all our money away. Right, we gotta buy stuff too. All right. Yeah. Let's go to our. Uh, let's go. Hey, Dilly. Always good to see. Tilly's awesome. You sweetheart. Evening. Uh huh. Uh huh. <laughs> Go. Maybe we'll sleep through the night. Get up in the morning. See how's are they're looking. A little scruffy. Maybe use some hair pomade, and then we can maybe shave. <laughs> Let's see, we're gonna sleep till morning. We're gonna get a good night's sleep, nine hours. Hope everyone's having a good weekend. Uh, some of you, yeah. It's probably the end of a four day weekend for some of you. I hope it's been a good one. I had a good Thanksgiving. Lots to be thankful for. I try to be thankful every day, not just on Thanksgiving. And I Good and I morning, typically Mark. am. So we found the O'Driscoll's hideout, but no sign of comb. Well, so long as we're hitting them before they hit us. 
Oh, that Kieran? He's all right now. Yep, Kieran saved our life. We didn't like him, but he saved our lives, so he's part of the gang now. Let's take a look here. Okay, our hair's already slicked back. We let's uh go clean it up a little bit. Look a little more. See, so your son goes back to school tomorrow. I figured a five-day weekend. You're both ready and not. <laughs> yeah, I hear ya. Well then, shit, Christmas right around the corner. Yeah, and the holidays are always, for me, like my sister's birthday is tomorrow. We had Thanksgiving. My mom's birthday is right in between Christmas and New Year's, and then my dad's birthday is in January. So a lot, a lot going on. This time of year, typically. Oh, Morning, Arthur. Well, you know what? I'm gonna do some chores here, cause uh, well, we haven't maxed out our stats, and it's gonna help us out. Is your son excited going back to school? Oh no. I know. Yeah, growing up. I like to school because I get to go hang out with my friends, you know. Remember, lift from the knees. Lift from the knees. That's right. Lifts with your back in a quick, twisting, jerking motion. <laughs> that ought to do it. So you're honestly not sure you like school, but also likes to be home. Yeah, kind of a double-edged sword there. Like, yeah. It's, uh... It's nice to mix it up, though. Because, like, when I wasn't working for a long time there, I, uh... Of course, I enjoyed sleeping in every day if I wanted to, but then... The days kind of started blurring together, and... So now that I have a job, it's really nice, so... It's really nice to have a job I enjoy going to, but I do enjoy my days off for sure, because I like being at home as well. A little bit of ebb and flow with everything, you know? Ooh, chop some wood here. Come on, yeah! Let me upgrade that axe. No. <laughs> I think that's the last piece of wood here. <laughs> Yeah, nice. One clean, one clean sweep with that. We'll feed the horses. Where's the Where's the hay? Good morning, Arthur. He's for horses. Sometimes cows. What does that say? Examine the American Inferno. The American Infer Inferno. By Evelyn Miller. Oh, wow. I don't know if we're going to read all that right now. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> Morning, Arthur. We'll catch up on that later. We can play dominoes. But we're going to go... We're going to finish feeding... Feeding the animals. Got to move some stuff around. Pick up this sack of maze. You have to get a new SD card for your Switch because the one you got while downloading it corrupted it. Oh no. He's American. He can't read. <laughs> well, that's a bummer, Z Man. I hope it didn't. So, is that going to screw up all your saves? I hope not. <laughs> Yo, what up, Bowser? You seem chipper. Good to see you, buddy. How you doing, Bowser? Always a pleasure, my friend. So, uh, G-Man, since you've been playing the new Pokemon, I'm wondering, how's this game, how's the game holding up for you? Is it crashing a lot or anything? I've heard it's, uh, been having some issues. Bowser, hope you're having a good weekend, my friend. Hope you, uh, had a good Thanksgiving. Hi. If you see a little break. 
All right, what are we doing here? We're gonna, where's the hay? Oh, that's right. We gotta get water. Moved around. If I only had one crash since you started playing, that's not bad from what I've been hearing. But I'm no expert. See, it was an off-brand SD card. No. Oh, yeah, their games got corrupted. And you deleted what you had. Redownloaded them to be safe. That's good. That would suck to lose all your save games. It's not bad, Bowser. Did I just make it to the camp? Uh, we made it to this camp last stream, and I did, uh, I don't know, two or three missions. Um, my next missions I have in front of me are uh, the Strauss missions, where I go collect some money. It comes down to how quickly you try to do things, G-Man, and Pokemon. You were moving very fast and think the system just couldn't keep up. Gotcha. You spent 17 bucks for 512 gigabytes. Nice. Oh, did you get a Black Friday deal there, partner? Pick up this hay bale. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I should get a better, bigger SD card for my Switch, because... Well, I don't play it a lot, but it's like it's over half full already. I, I didn't get a huge one. Or well, the old Black Friday. I, well, maybe I'll just ask for one for Christmas. For That's right, Jack. He is for horses. <laughs> The, that's full price, but at least it didn't been upwards of 80 plus bucks. Yeah. Pretty amazing, though, when you think about Danger. it. Hello. You okay? You okay? I'm bored. I'm bored. Well, go find some mischief to get up to. Let me know if you find candy. Okay. That's right. Some of the... Some of the fellows want... Stuff. Jack wants candy. Okay, so that's all the that's all the chores we do, got done. It's pretty amazing how much information like we store in our phone and how we <laughs> look at this. Lenny, Lenny, where are you at Boa? <laughs> Where at you, boo? What up, Lenny? What up, Indy Capo? How you doing, man? Good to see ya. It's good to see ya. You too. You too, Liddy. 404. LP. The old LP. Indy Capo, I hope you're doing well. Those you, Liddy. Loading personality. AKA loading personality. And you keep, are you working today to get, uh, you know, the weekend off? Hope you're doing good. Open your mind. Andy Capo. Working? Gotcha. Open your mind. Well, you're doing good. You went to the office today, lady? I'm glad you're doing great. All right, let's go get on our horse. Go do one of these missions here. To the office today. Yeah, I hope it went quick for you. They brought new plants. Nice. Always nice to have a little change of scenery. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna. Uh, I took a strand of Christmas lights to work yesterday. I, I didn't have time to really set them up, but I'm gonna put some Christmas lights around my. On my desk and stuff. How's Arthur doing? He's doing good. Bit of a change, nice, definitely. And then, uh, because uh, I got my own, we kind of shifted desks around. Well, we didn't shift any furniture around, but rotated people, so I'm at the front counter and, uh, got a lot more space, got my own space that I can customize. I'm doing a good karma run here, lady. Celebrating Christmas supposed to be special. Yeah, well, I just I like Christmas lights and <laughs> I like the holiday. I'm not. 
I'm not uh, yeah. religious, not to, you know, that's fine if you are. But I celebrate it more of just the tradition of it. And Oh, I'm just putting up Christmas lights, like strands. No, no, I don't. Have, we don't have a tree, a Christmas tree at work. Well, we, what's going on over here? Heard shooting. I saw a knife. But yeah. yeah. Uh, <laughs> God damn it! Hey, Who's the bad guys? Are they all bad guys? Yeah. Get him. Shit. Never know what you're gonna come again. Come across in these. Where's he hiding? Oh, he's right here. Why is he red? Does Santa Claus visit people in the desert? Well, he asked my mom. She said she would say yes. Santa Claus visits every, every, even if you're bad, you get it's coal in your stocking. <laughs> so this guy on the little mini maps that's in the cage is red, like he's hostile. Is that, did I accidentally shoot him, or is he a bad guy? I don't know, we're gonna get these old Driscolls there first, so... Damn, I took down the horse, too. You guys are ruthless. But yeah, I was talking to my I was telling my mom, I get to personalize my space, and she reminded me... <laughs> at one of my old jobs, I had... Uh, I had bought a picture frame at the store that had a sample picture in it of like the, it was like this cute lady, and I put that on my desk. And if anyone asked, "Oh, is that your wife or is that your girlfriend?" I'd be like, "No, that just came with the picture frame." You wish Santa Claus could drop you off an RTX 3080. That'd be nice. I'm right, gonna shoot this lock. You shoot that lock. I won't tell the law on you. Stand back. I won't tell the law on you. So yeah, I want to do that I again. I ride with Driscoll, you fool. So why? I don't get it. Why do Driscolls? Oh, they must have been trying to rescue this guy. That's right. <laughs> headshot! Boom! Headshot! Alright. <laughs> but yeah, I, I don't know if I still have that picture frame with the that came with the picture with that came with the frame. I'm gonna have to look. Let's go to the farthest spot first. I don't remember if you do all th you can do all three of these in a row, or you have to do it and then go back to the camp after each one. Well, get, get down off this hill here. You love the Arabian horse? Yeah, I don't know. It's all right, girl. What kind of horse we have here? What kind of the breed we have where you live? Yeah. What's Gibby? No info. Thoroughbred. This is your main horn. Uh, okay. What kind of horse is it? We can't feed the horse yet. Yeah, that's one thing I love about this game. All the, the detail with all the different animals. and Especially they did a lot, lot of attention to detail with the horses. The Arabian horses are elegant and extremely arrogant. <laughs> Yeah, there's one horse I got. It's not the best horse you can get, but... Uh, there's one horse I got that... 
And I should have thee. That I saved for the rest of the game. Really have to assert dominance over those Arabian horses. Help a blind guy. man. There you go, partner. Have this. Never treat him badly, because they'll never forgive you. Oh. Make your final moments your best moments, sir. No glory and forget about shame. Okay. I ain't too sure what to make of that. Hmm. That's cool. Your uncle had hawks for hunting? That's awesome. So with the hawks... What, would he like send the hawks out and they spot... He was trained to like spot whatever they're hunting, your uncle's hunting, and... That's wild. That's cool. I, I never knew that was even... Oh, they go hunting for a rabbit and bring it back to you. I had no idea that was a thing. That's awesome. See, you learn something every day. Let's see. Ah, oh, Kentucky bourbon, chewing tobacco. That'll go pocket watch. Hawks are super smart. Yeah, some birds are. They train hawks to race, too? Whoa, I did not know that. I'm gonna go ahead and drink our Kentucky bourbon, too. Where is that? Bitters. Okay, it's gonna be in this slot, I think. Yeah, I know. Like, I like uh, crows. are really cool birds, too. The, uh, those, they actually uh, can recognize human faces. I remember reading uh, about this one guy. He had hawks come around his house a lot. Not hawks, I'm sorry. Crows. <laughs> and he would leave little like seeds for him or something yeah. every day. And then after a while, they'd start leaving little gifts in return. Like, you know, something shiny. Yeah, some birds are really smart. Pretty amazing. Pretty cool. But yeah, and then there's some crows that hang around my work. and I Try to be nice to them. I was thinking it'd be cool if I found a little spot. Leave some seeds for them or something. I don't know. I'll have yep. to look up and see what they like. Yeah, that's that's really cool, lady. Thanks for letting me know. I did I did I had no idea people trained hawks for hunting and racing. I mean I guess it's it was just impressive. But yeah, they're uh we're gonna go get some money. Get some money, honey. Emerald Ranch. Oh, I remember there's some funny shit that happens in this place. Not this mission. You're amazed as well, I know. Some animals are pretty amazing. Let's see. Who do we gotta talk to around here? You can speak to people in the area to find out where the debtor is. Question is, who thought of doing that? Like training animals and how do they know how to? He or she? Yeah. Lily Millet. She's a ranch maid here. You know who she is? Don't know where she is now, but she's probably with Cooper. Cooper. Yeah, like how training a hawk? How would you even do that? Or taming a bull? I know. <laughs> that is wild. That is pretty wild, yeah. I mean, obviously, it, I don't know. I would think maybe it'd start from early days where it was just some type of symbiotic relationship with you know where animals. Is? She's with Cooper over by the store. Over by the store. You have any idea of the hole I'm in? Oh, 
Oh. Why is it always gotta be such a goddamn performance with you? Now I told you I'd get you the money next week, and I'll get it. If you didn't make it this week, who's to say you'll make it next? I think this Don't is you need take to that tone with me. I thought you said you loved I me. I do. I do. But what I get paid ain't enough for one. Do I know who the first smartass was that decided to drink now. from a cow? The only problem I got is this bleating <laughs> going on in my ear. Now lay off it, Lily. God damn it, Lily. Where's our money? <laughs> What? That loan you took. It's payday. I'm sorry. I don't have it right now. Well, then. I guess we got a big problem, don't we? Cooper, give him what you've got. I ain't giving him nothing except a lesson in damn murder. Son of a bitch. Oh. Oh, swing and a miss. You want to know who, yeah, how to figure out which mushrooms are poisonous, which weren't. Well, I would imagine at first, you know, uh, trial and arrow, yes, and then also they'd see what animals would eat. He has all my money. I gave it all to him. Just take everything that you find on him and let's see. Let's see what the animals eat, and they're like, "Well, if the animals eat those. They must be good." You've got your money. Leave me alone. I you know what I do to thieves? What do you oh, want? I, I didn't steal that. Me. It's a debt. Oh, damn it. Ain't my concern Maybe no you should think about the kinds of men you're friendly with, miss. You've got your money. I don't have to listen to your wisdom, all right? Shh. So long. You're grateful to live such peaceful times, despite everything? Yeah. I mean, yeah, there's a lot of crazy shit, bad things that go on in the world, but... Can you imagine living in the Dark Ages? When healthcare and hygiene hygiene didn't even exist? And antibiotics? <laughs> no, we're wanted man. Yeah, there was... Imagine it's 7 yep. p.m., no lights, yeah. It's in, when you think of it in the grand scheme of things, it wasn't very long ago either. Could you imagine living during a time that had no fight? I know. It's like, I mean, you would have, back in these days, in the 1800s, you'd have lanterns, like kerosene lanterns, and fire, but... Oh, absolute dark at seven, and then you see hundreds of torches approaching, screaming, Valhalla! <laughs> that would be scary. All right, uh, we're going to go back to camp. I th think that's what we have to do. Valhalla! That would be scary as shit. <laughs> be doomed. Let's wait till the one end level goes away. Okay. Okay, so no, I don't have to go back to camp. I can go collect these debts and then go back to camp. That would be scary, man. Especially with... Just saw thousands of torches approaching. Can you imagine how loud... You'd, like, feel the rumble. <laughs> All the footsteps. Oh, horse is agitated by a predator. Must have saw a snake. Okay, girl, come on, come on down, come on down. Come on down. Light a torch and try to blend in with them, just yelling, Yeah, let's get them. <laughs> now you're thinking. Now you're thinking. You're looking all dirty there. The pleasure is all well, mine. I've seen you around here before. You chick? I was told I could find a chick Matthews up here. Chick Matthews? Mm, you might want to talk to that feller over there. Now nah, I'm just here to work for the season. Talk to this feller. Okay. <laughs> this game is so good. 
little slow pace, but I enjoy it. Just really let you take in the atmosphere, you know. Dietrich Matthews. Oh no, no, not me, sir. Uh, uh that's the greenhorn over there. Oh, and there he goes. Oh. So long, long shark. <laughs> he tried to trick us. Hey, get back here. You owe us money. Yeah. Two dollars. I want my two dollars. Yeah. <laughs> Gotta be careful. All right, let's pull up the old lasso. Let's see, the Celtics raided some of the villages neighboring the Roman Empire. Oh, Galloway! You make me go much further, I'll get more than a dead off you. <laughs> Let's see. Alright. Look, look, I got the money, but it's hidden. Untie me and I'll tell you where it is. God damn treasure hunt? You're uh, lucky I ain't taking your teeth as well. <laughs> look, I ain't taking Holy your teeth. Moses. So we got a map now. Aren't you gonna untie me? Let's see. People fled. We're dying in hunger, and they weren't allowed to be inside the walls, so they the traded map. their kids Do for the dog meat. Thing. Whoa. That's crazy. All right, so where's this m map? John, one, two, three. I don't know what those... Those Roman numerals? One, two, three. Hmm. Well, then there's that square with the X in it. Is that his house? What should happen to me? Where worldly possessions are stored here. Hmm. Nothing on the back side. Put him on the track? <laughs> we could. Come on, man. I don't know if I want to do that. He owes us money, but he's not a not an evil person. I'll go ahead and let him go. Yeah. You'll yeah. find it there. Everything. I promise. Better not be joking. No. It's there. Yeah. Howdy, partner. What's up, gentlemen, Drew? Welcome to hell on again. Hope you're doing well. I'm gonna find us treasure up in here. Just <laughs> the highlight area to find the debt. Use the treasure map to help identify the location. It's that tree with the hole in it. Not much, you're just having dinner? Alright. Hope you're having something good. Yeah, nice to see. Oh, there it is, right there. Gotta be up in here somewhere. Chick's debt money. In the first game, you remember getting off your horse and the damn thing ran up on the track. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> oh. The train got it? Oh, no. That sucks. <laughs> that kind of shit could happen, though. Come you on, never know. Feeling something good for dinner there, Jim and Drew? No, I just don't like All right, so we have a bounty here. Let's take a peek here. the other debt and then that is donate to the camp okay well, let's go get this debt 
this last debt, then we'll head back to camp, talk to Strauss, and we'll throw in some money. Jube steak, corn, and rice. Oh my gosh, that sounds really yeah. good. I still have a little bit of Thanksgiving leftovers. That's what I'm having for dinner tonight. Jube steak, corn, rice. That sounds delicious. Oh, oh shoot. What's going on? What's going on over here? Yeah. Ah. Oh, oh, you there. Would you be interested in some friendly competition? Oh, yes, I would. Uh... I've come all the way north from Mexico to challenge a real American gunslinger. You him? Perhaps. I'll accept your wager. Me? Hey, real gunslinger? <laughs> Let's find out. Okay, man. That's what I like to hear. Look, man, rules are simple, okay? Whoever shoots more of these bottles wins. Oh, okay. Just draw your gun and aim when you're ready, all right? <laughs> Shoot! Whoops, uh, excuse me, did I? A little cheating. Cut it all! How the hell did you beat me, huh? Because oh. I got dead eye. Shot, I suppose. Well, I suppose. Oh, that didn't make me happy at all. How about we raise the stakes, huh? You shot this guy when he beat you. Raise the stakes? Come on. Cube uh, stakes? Aha, we'll uh -huh. that's a good call, amigo. Okay. Whoever shoots four birds out of the sky first wins. Simple enough. Can you catch me off guard, huh? Oh shit! I went too early. You're a trick. Oh, man, stupid, stupid. Ah. So you can shoot, huh? I can oh, shoot. Here it is, okay? Man of my word. Yeah, well, nice shooting, amigo, but I got a hand up on it. Take that ten dollars. Appreciate it. Sure. Unlock new <laughs> reinforced equipment at the trapper visit. Watch Pearson. on next time. You'll see. Good deal, yeah. All right. Well. I don't want all these animal carcasses going to waste here, so. Oh, these ones you can't skin, so we'll take these. Oh, we'll just put them in my satchel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, now ten bucks means nothing. I can get you a burger and fries. That's about it. Not much. Back then, I was like, I don't know. See, your currency sucks. So we they? Yeah, we'll just put that bird in my satchel. Oh, this one we can pluck. Get some feathers so we can craft some arrows. What's this uh, companion? What, what is, we, is this? The Western Raven can be found in a variety of habitats across the states. As omnivores, their diet consists of grains and seeds, but they prefer to scavenge for carrion and eggs of other nesting birds. A bow with small game arrows can be used to kill or wound a bird of this size. Raven feathers can be used for crafting. Their meat can be used for cooking. Like $200 for some chicken sandwich over there? Oh, shit. Yeah. The uh, skinner plucking that only take meat from the carcass to cook and eat this meat at a campfire. Yes, yeah. That's one thing we're gonna have to do next time we go back to camp too is uh, cook up some meat and do some crafting. Cause I still haven't done any. Uh, Made any split point bullets? What are they call them? The split head bullets. Split head. 
But yeah, 200, 200 for chicken sandwich. God dang. Oh, prairie chicken. What is this? Old prairie chicken. That looks like a big quail, kind of. It's not. It's prairie chicken. We don't need to read the whole encyclopedia on the animals right now. Come on, girl. Come on, girl. All right, let's get our dead eye up a little bit. Just in case something goes down, you know what I'm saying? All right. Let's go collect yeah. that last dead. <laughs> Man, I love this game. I haven't played online mode in a while. But on online mode, I got Moonshine Shack. Got the Bounty Hunter license. I have all the licenses. I just haven't upgraded everything. But yeah, it's just it's been so long since I played through the story. It's like, you know what? I want to do that again. But Actually, we can go, uh, let's do the old autopilot mode, get a little more cinematic looking here. Yeah, right now, to the west, into the sun. <laughs> this game's gorgeous. Whoa, dead deer. Whoa! What was that dead deer doing there? Yeah. I didn't get a good enough look, was it? Oh, it's not showing up on the mini map, must be. Oh, yeah, it's been dead a while. Let's go, girl. Let's go, girl. Easy, girl. Let's see, and what's our. Our, uh. I have to get off the horse to check when our horse level is here. Uh, about half. Oh, my Mr. Merv name covering that up. Show info. Yeah, you can see there in the lower left where it has the. The horse stats, the uh, circle around the horse head's like half full. Girl? You know, still. Okay, girl. Isn't, that's right. That's the fastest way to build up your relationship with your horse. Just oh, keep it. Oh. You son of a bitch. Ah! Get him! Good thing I, uh... Oh, what? Oh. I didn't want to shoot the horse. Oh, man. Jeez! They came out of nowhere! Mess with the best, die like the rest. <laughs> Let's see, what kind of guns? What kind of gun you got up over here? Well, that's the same kind of repeater I have. It was an ambush, yep. I think, I think I'm... To see it isn't a zombie. Hey, zombie! Hi, zombie! On this hat, huh? Nice looking hat. Eh. Hope you're doing well, zombie. Yeah. It's good to see ya. Hey, whoa. Hey, whoa. I think the first time I played this game with, I got that ambush. It was at nighttime. Riding around with lanterns was lit up. It looked really cool. Good to see me too. Oh, thanks. But, uh. 
Glad you had a good Thanksgiving. I know you've been busy all weekend, doing all working and stuff, but always a pleasure to see you, my friend. I've been playing a little bit of uh, Let's Build a Zoo. Good game, good game. Good game. I haven't gotten very far. <laughs> You're so exhausted, yeah. New Year. New game is best game? It is fun. Brush the horse. We'll give the horse a little bit of food, too. Here you go, horsey. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that game's good. Yeah, good girl. It's very... It's one of those games that's easy yeah. to get sucked into and just... Next thing you know, an hour's gone by and like, I feel like I've only been playing for about 20 minutes. I really like the music in that game too. We're out here riding in the Great Plains and New Hanover to go get... Oh shit! We just ran over a fox. Poor little guy. Well, I'm not gonna let you go to waste. Get the pelt, get some meat. Look away. Oh, I can't. Skinning an animal, we also take meat. That's right. Hope I had a good week. I did. I had Thursday off for the holiday. Had a nice time with uh, my immediate family. Went to my mom's house. My dad was there. My sister and brother-in-law. Had and a good turkey dinner and a few leftovers. Work's been going well. It was nice. Friday and Saturday it was kind of mellow. Um, and then, yeah, because I know when I go back, Tuesdays can be real busy. But it was great. You love that for me? Yeah. Yeah, thanks, Zombie. I, I feel very fortunate with how the job's going. And like I was thinking Saturday morning, yesterday morning when I was getting up, getting ready for work. I was just like, man, it's nice to... I kind of be looking forward to work. You wish you had tomorrow off and you could sleep all day. <laughs> yeah, you, yeah, you've been busy, busy, busy. Yeah, my old job towards the end, I, I'd get up at the morning. It was like, fuck, man, I don't want to go to work. It was like that every day. It was nice to not feel like that. You're running around like a crazy little Italian lady? <laughs> Are you cooking right now? I you said you were wanting to cook earlier. Get out of here, ducks. You got taco? Yeah, G-Man got taco bell. Today you're relaxing, you just meant this week. Oh, gotcha. Whoa. Watch where you're going, feller. Taco Bell is the cheese, yes. I had Taco Bell oh, a few weeks ago. Alright, here's the last debt we gotta collect for this mission. Yeah, Taco Bell, the Taco Bell in town here, it's right next to my favorite pizza place, so I usually end up getting pizza when I'm right next to Taco Bell. Knock, knock, Mr. Robe. What are you doing? God my hand? damn it. English? Uh, you me, speak English? Me? Uh, um, English, motherfucker? Yeah, do you I'll speak it? I'm here for money. You borrow from a German man? 
Aha, German. Uh, um, uh, mein Herr, uh, uh, sprechen das... We will converse uh, in the this, language uh, of the uh, Kaiser I don't yeah. speak German neither. I'm here for money. Money. That you borrowed from Leopold Strauss. Uh-huh. 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 Leopold Strauss. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah. You know that. So it's time to pay. Where is it? Oh, well, no, I have nothing. It's very bad winter. We've all had a bad winter, pal. <laughs> Where is it? Oh, oh, no. No, no, no. Now, you remember where you're keeping that silver? Give me time, I won't get the money. Oh, no. Nope. Still don't understand you. <laughs> God damn it, you have a debt to Herr Strauss. Pay up. Stop. You steam, I'm shiwi. Stop, I'm spent, he says. You steam, I'm shiwi. Uh, no, 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 uh, no, please no, uh, no have money, but, but to have this. Oh, he's got something else, huh? It's, it's good, it's good, it's valuable, it's, it's Varsava, yes. What is it? I have your things, okay? I have anything in here or out there? Yes. Let's see. Loot the house. All right. Let's uh, get to looting. You got any Taco Bell in this cabinet? Matter I get. See, silver earring. Not good yet. One earring. We're gonna need more than that, partner. Filler. I'm gonna tell you what. We can go to this cabinet over here. Don't even speak English. Let's see what we got over here. Oh, right, take everything. Some fine brandy. Yes, 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 yes. He's all mad we took his brandy. <laughs> all right, we, what else we got? Antique one. Debt successfully okay. recovered. That should about cover things. Uh, what else we got? Well, he's he's got we got enough. What you got behind there? So, uh, mm -hmm. move aside. Oh, he's hiding something here. What do we have here? Gold we wedding ring. Just keep quiet. Can't carry any more of those cigarettes. Twelve dollars. Another buck fifty-two. You me me real mad when <laughs> we find this Taco Bell. <laughs> we search the rest of the house since we're here. I mean, he wasn't paying up. We just didn't know. Yeah, maybe if I got some snake oil. <laughs> Where's the Taco Bell? Where's goddamn Taco Bell? Mm, I got some crackers. I'll take those. <laughs> uh, yeah. I hope everyone's doing good. Thanks for hanging out. I appreciate it very much. You know, well, we got we might have Taco Bell in here somewhere. He's hiding it. I know it. Ain't got the Taco Bell. If he doesn't have it, shoot him in the leg. <laughs> Man, we can buy some Taco Bell if he doesn't have it. <laughs> you can buy... In the bars, you can buy food. I'll have Taco Bell, though. Ooh, candy. We'll take that. Jack, little Jack was asking for some candy. We'll give that to Jack when we get back to, the, back to camp. And last but not least, we'll search this chest. Stolen Taco Bell's the best. <laughs> Ooh, got some gun oil, nice. Okay, some cover scent lotion, all right. Excellent. 
Jeez, we can fight him if we want. I think uh, he got the message. Yeah. No Taco Bell. Oh, see, you're looking a little dirty there. I like how they're, the horse's ears kind of perk up when you pet it, hey, when you okay, brush him. You okay, girl? So yeah, we that's this way to get horse bonding leveled up is just keep patting the horse <laughs> when you're riding it around. Good, good horsey, good horsey. <laughs> Keep patting the horsey. <laughs> Ooh. Heard something. I'm shooting. Get our dead eye up in case some shit goes down. A little chewing tobacco. Okay. Yep. Yep. Yeehaw. Yep. Finding increased. Nice. There, girl. Let's head back to camp. I remember too playing through here. Sometimes there would be a cougar that spawns in this area. Wacky tobacky. I don't think they have that in this game. They should. Oh, I just heard it. Or one of them mountain lions. I want to. Uh, Dark out here. Let's get some light. Uh, you're too old for cougars. <laughs> well, they do have wacky tobacco in the wild. Ooh. Hey, nice Lenny. underwear, Lenny. Hey, Arthur. Uh, I don't have any. You're kidding. No, that'd be good. I wonder if they do. I don't think they do. They might, though. Because it does grow wild in some areas. Alright, let's go eat some food, and then we'll put the money, the debt, back in the old the camp coffers. Get some stew here. Give me the Give me some food, please. What time is it here? Let's see. Why can't I can't get food. 3.04 a.m. Is it too late to eat food? Give me stew, please. I'm hungry. Arthur's hungry. I don't know. It's not... Hmm. Is it just glitching out? Try it again. Walk a little, where is it? Walk a little slow. Sneak up on it. <laughs> yeah, I think it may be too late to eat. All right. I know you lot just laugh at me behind my back. I know what you say. But it's not easy. It's not easy at all. Being the camp joke. Oh, just because I have standards, huh? And manners. I was talking to somebody. Manners, manners is everything. Hang up. Hold up. Hold up. Oh, you lot ain't got no manners. Just look at you. Bunch of cow herders, the lot of you. Yes. Miss. Hi there, Arthur. Managing to keep everyone in line? I'm doing my best. Any troublemakers, you let me know. Sounds good, Mr. Morgan. Uh, somebody was... In one of my friend's discords, they were talking about how they went to... I think it was a wedding. And they were talking to some lady there, just chit-chatting. And the lady's a voice actress. Voice actor. And, uh... 
she said her name to the guy who was talking to her, and he's like, yeah, I don't, I don't know if I've played any games you do voice acting in. And she's like, well, I was Miss Grimshaw in Red Dead Redemption 2, and he was like, what? <laughs> he got his picture taken with her. I thought that was really cool. Receive a cut of each recovered debt you donate. Turn debt $38.58. My share, $4.41. Okay. Sweet. Making some money. Now we have the ledger. Now we can upgrade specific things in the camp. Front page of the ledger shows recent contributions to the camp funds from all companions. But yeah, see what these people are donating. Bill. A poor muskie. Javier, silver chain bracelet. Arthur, 15 bucks cash. Everyone else, everything they're donating is like... The biggest one's from Javier, five bucks. Y'all ain't pulling your weight. No. Uh, let's see. Stress's medicine wagon increases total supplies, including snake oil to restore dead eye and bitters to restore stamina. Uh, twenty-four dollars. We're gonna upgrade a bunch of camp shit here. Uh, purchase. Quantity and quality of tonics available at the medical wagon has increased. You can pay to resupply the medical wagon when stocks are low. Got us some. How did you get on, Herr Morgan? Fine. Our accounts are up to date. Side sacks, a lot of them. Good, very good. My pleasure. Uh, well, if it's pleasure you're after, there is one other. This farmer preacher fellow I met in Valentine, Mr. Downs. This opinionated little do-gooder? <laughs> yeah, I know the one. I certainly know the type. Thank you, Herr Morgan. There's no need to thank me. Like you said, it's pleasure I'm after. He's more slippery than he seems. I've tried being polite. Don't take any nonsense. Nonsense? Me? If he doesn't have the money, beat him. Well, I usually do. <laughs> I know. I know. Alright, so we gotta go get Emmett Granger. Oh, now I can eat stew. I guess I couldn't eat stew before when I got back to camp because it was still, uh... I was still finishing up the mission. Let's see, look at that stew. Mmm. Yum, yum, yum. Yum, 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 yum. Arthur eats fast. Mmm, <laughs> that was tasty. I do say so myself. Alright. But go forward with hope and dreams. Seriously. Yeah, you. There's some of the coolest conversations around the camp. All right, let's see what else we can upgrade up in here. Let's get upgrade the uh, something with a kick tonic, some premium liquor. We can do fresh fruit and basic canned goods for provisions. We can do ammunition, repeater ammo and arrows. Oop, what was that? Lodging. Dutch wants something comfier. $176. Jeez, that's all like almost that's a lot of money. Horse station, chicken coo. Ooh. Other tools. If we get Pierce and better tools, he can make extra gear. Let's buy that. Having fun, Murray? What up, Dragoon Knight? I am having fun. Hope you're well. It's nice to see ya. Hope you're having a nice weekend. And... But yeah, I love this game. Alright, I need to put more money in the camp here. I've got $386. The camp's got three. I just spent all the money the camp had pretty much to upgrade that shit. Contribute. We're going to contribute. Let's do 100 bucks. Or actually, let's see what items we have. We've got five, so yeah, we'll donate a couple of these. Hope you did. How you doing, Dragoon Knight? Donate 
couple of these. Because I can only carry five maximum of each of these right now. Oh, I upgrade my satchel. We'll get these down to where I have three of each. Okay. Yeah, that's, that's, that was almost 50 bucks. That was like four. They have 43. So that was like 46 bucks worth of stuff right there. And let's throw in some money. Let's throw in about fifty fifty one dollar ninety ninety eight cents. <laughs> uh, okay. I don't want to go too overboard. Uh, fifty three dollars. That'll work. Yeah. Got more karma. What's that? What is that? This mission. A letter has arrived for me. Okay, we'll go read our letter. What else? What other missions we got? Javier Escuela. One for Mike Bell. Oh, that's Thomas Downs. That's the guy we got to get money from for... Uh... Strauss. That's his name, Strauss. We got a mission for Hosea. These ones that are the white circles... These are like, uh, they're not like story missions that progress the story. I kind of, I like doing these. They're like side missions. We got a few of them. Look at that. Look at that. Flaco Hernandez. We got Black Bell. Oh, these are the, uh, these are the gunslingers. That guy who's writing the book about gunslingers wanted me to go. Get some info from them. So we'll do those. The one with uh, Black Bell, that's my favorite out of the four gunslingers. She's Black Bell's awesome character. I love her. Let's read our letter here. What do we got here? Dear Arthur, I've written this letter a hundred times or more, and I cannot get it right. It's me. You know it's me from the bad handwriting. I know I said when we last spoke and I was going off to get married that we would not speak again. I know I said a lot of things and I meant them, I suppose, at the time, but I'm not so proud as to not speak to people who care for me or cared for me. I've been in Valentine for a couple of months. I had some bad luck and, well, it's a long story and not an interesting one. But I am here for now. I saw a couple of the girls, or whatever the polite term is for them, that ran with you and your associates in town, and I heard tell of a man who sounded like you. I would love to see you again if you could spare me a little bit of your time. I'm renting a room at Chadwick Farm, just north of Valentine. Yours, Mary Linton. Oh, Mary Linton. I like the writing, the cursive in this game. Oh, Mary Linton. Look at this photograph. <laughs> Who's that? Uh... Oh, that's Arthur's mom. That's right. We looked at that last time. Well, what time is it in the game? It's not telling me. It's telling me I have a bounty of $5. Let's go pay my... So, we have to go to the post office to pay off our bounty. Wow. Game's great. Oh, I think I remember that. Okay. Um. Well, since we're so close to Emmett Granger, let's go hit up Emmett Granger. And then uh, we'll come back to camp, maybe do some chores. And uh, where's my horse? My horse is this way. Then we're going to go from there. Plus, I got this, uh... 
I got this fox pelt. We can go sell that. Maybe we should go to town. Let's get you looking good. Let's get you looking good. <laughs> All right, girl. All right, girl. You know what? I realized chat voted to name this horse Gibby when we got this horse, and the horse is a female. I don't know if Gibby's best name. I don't think we could rename our horse. Maybe we can. I don't know. I can't remember. Because I never tried to rename my horses. I named them once and I was that. Gibby could be a name for a man or a woman, I suppose. Gideon. Yesterday at work, uh, somebody brought, whoa, brought some homemade ban chocolate chip banana bread. Pretty good. I like regular banana bread. I just heard gunshot that way. Oh, someone needs help. Also, if you double tap, tab, you little, do little, do little, I don't hardly know what to say. Thanks, I guess. You done me a What up, geeks? Hey, look, the stage company's gonna write this off as a robbery anyway. If you can get in that lockbox, you can take what you want from it. But ain't stealing if it's already stolen. Got that right. Got that right. How's the Wild West going? Good, geeks. I hope you're doing well, my friend. Good to see you. As always. How are you, man? A good holiday? If you, uh... You celebrate Thanksgiving? I hope you had a good one. I just hope you're doing well. In general. Need a lock breaker. What's a lock breaker? I uh, doing well. We're back to work tomorrow. Yeah. That's my lock breaker. Oh no! Shit. No, I don't want to get in the passenger carriage. Shit. Okay, at least they didn't keep going. I just startled him a little bit. Oh, we got some. Oh, oh, you know what I forgot to do at camp is. Peter cartridges. We're already full on those. I forgot to craft some stuff and cook some things. Yeah, work tomorrow. So now with the strangers, if I loot the strangers, I get bad karma. We're not gonna loot the stranger. Geeks, that was a pleasure, my friend. Have a good, uh, good weekend, I hope. Take it easy. Take it easy. Well done, girl. So let's, let's keep patting the horse. Best way to build up the bonding level. <laughs> we're just gonna sit here until we get get it to level four. No, we're not. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> it's good to see you, geeks. Head still rolling from the road. Head still rolling from the road? What the hell's that supposed to mean there, feller? Yeah. <laughs> I love this game. Alright, we're gonna go meet up with. Uh... Good to see me too? Thanks, man. Emmett Granger. This is one of the gunslingers the guy's writing a book about. Let's, uh... Oh, I remember this. Yep, Geek's always a pleasure, dude. Oh, 
Always a pleasure, my friend. Uh, yeah, I'm doing good. I had a nice Thanksgiving. Looking forward to playing this today. Don't like the look of it. Don't like the look of it? Uh, I don't like the look of your attitude there, mister. Hey, you. What do you want? Howdy. You Granger? That's my name. My occupation, too, if you hadn't noticed. Weren't always like that, though, were you? Used to be a quick draw guy. You mm -hmm. knew Jim Boy Calloway? Used to be is correct. Them days are long over. And who might you be? Don't matter. I need you to tell me about Jim Boy. Just a quote for a book. A book about Jim Boy? <laughs> well, shit. I can't talk to you now. Look at me. A knee deep in hog crap. Well, don't mind me. We can talk while you work. <laughs> I ain't talking and shoveling. Besides, young man like you get it done in half the time. I don't know about that. Hey, you want What's me to, to shovel know? shit? You interested in the old days? If you shovel this shit, I tell you some stories. You keep your hands clean, I don't give you squat. So a bitch. <laughs> These better be some stories. You been playing a few games well, there, geeks? One of them's the new... Got to work. Well, get out of here and stop wasting my time. The, the new God of War, I imagine. Right. Ragnarok. Shovel your damn shit. How's Jim that been going? Nothing, you know. Me? I killed men, women, and children, too. Animals. I even killed rocks. And I killed them good. Did he say I he kills rocks, them. too? Stabbed folks. Skinned folks. I scalped some. <laughs> Boy. <sighs> They scream when you scalp them. Hey, let me work. <laughs> Don't know what's got into these hogs, but Go I know they're coming out of them. <laughs> Go wrestle them hogs. <laughs> Butchered folks. I burned folks alive. Buried folks alive. Jeez. One time, I... Yeah, I get it, all right? You're me. What about Callaway? You have no idea, girly. By a feminine type like you, I'd probably have chopped your head off, stuffed you. This guy's talking some shit. Eating you like a sausage. No doubt. I don't think Arthur's gonna take kindly to the way. Now it's clean enough to eat off. Uh, I guess I'm done. Get that barrel to the shit pile, and I suppose you is. Alright. No shortage of shit round here. Comes from hungry hogs and no hands. Uh, hell, uh, stinks. Thanks. <laughs> okay, I cleaned up your mess. Go on. Tell me about Callaway. I said I'd tell you stories. I didn't say they'd be about him. Don't trifle with me, old man. Uh -oh. You knew him. Just give me something. Anything. You making a book? You should make it about me. They're just words, is all. Give me something to say, and I'll leave you alone. You owe me that. Hey, you be careful. <sighs> Killer like me, it don't take much to end up on the end of my knife. One time, hey, you know I... what? I don't think you were anything at all. Just a crazy old man. I yep. ain't a killer. Well, you'd already be hog feed. I hadn't made a deal with the Federals got this far. This is your last chance, Mr. Yep. Granger. Give me a quote for the book. Hey, hey, you don't know, hit no man of peace, no government witness. <laughs> <laughs> Callaway said you was full of piss, but he didn't tell me the half of it. I'm itching to drop you, girly. Only you ain't worth my time. I, I got too much to lose. Too much to lose? Well, seeing as I cleaned up this pig's die, I figure I'm in my rights to wreck it. Let's see. You don't want to do that? You walk away right now. Well, well. All I wanted was a quote. You don't know who you're trifling with. That's my stick! Place dynamite on the manure store. Oh. Yep, all we wanted was a quote for the buck. And, uh... Talk shit, so do calling bullshit. No. Or in this case, pig shit. No, no, <laughs> no! You did not. <laughs> you just took yourself a regular shit shower, Mr. Granger. Too oh, bad, Mr. Mr. Granger. You earned yourself a killer, and I'm going to enjoy it now. Draw. It's going to be the last thing you do. 
Oh, he wants me to draw a hole. That's fill the meter. Well, that's a crappy situation. <laughs> We'll only tab, press R to open the item wheel. What do we... Oh. Oh, that's right. We have to take a picture of him. We did. Yep. Now we can, we can even do selfies in this. Look at that. <laughs> All right. Well, there, partner... Get a better shot. Uh, that's right. You can take the uh, their guns too. Back up just a little. There we go. Right here. Right here. Oh, I gotta be facing the right way. So a bitch. Now we're fine. There's your old gunslinger there for the book. Uh, and it was zoom, take photo. Mission complete. I'm a Granger. Alright, drop double action roll for Granger's revolver. Yes. There we go. Now we have Granger's revolver. Hey, look at this. You lurking there, geeks? Thank you for the lurk, my friend. All right. Rare Cattleman Revolver with a dark metal finish covered in custom engravings. Previously owned by the late gunslinger Emmett Granger. Defeated in a duel near Flat Neck Station. This gun has an ammo capacity of six rounds. Can use regular high-velocity split-point express and explosive revolver ammo. Nice. Our sales new gun. Ooh, we can rest it. We can do a little crafting and cooking by the fire here too. Uh, I guess while we're here, we'll loot this guy. Let's check inside his shack. See if there's anything good to get. Fifty-five cents and a silver pocket watch. See what we got up in here. Hmm. Hmm. Search that little dresser. We got some stuff here. Oh, I forgot. Oh, I was gonna say I forgot to give Jack some candy when we get back to camp, but uh, it was middle of the night, so he was sleeping. We'll give Jack some candy when we get back to camp. Not much in here. See anything else glowing? Okay. It's all right. <laughs> what are these hogs? Can we inspect? Zoom study. Study the hog. Perkshire pig. Compendium updated. Anything else around here we can get? Any goodies? I, I think we're good. Oh, there's chickens. Mm. Dominique. Chicken. <laughs> Alright, um... I want to see what I can craft here. This doesn't have a grill, though. I think the fire at camp might have a grill. Or we can cook more. We can craft more with the grill. That's it, girl. Pat the horse. There you go, girl. Good horsey. Good horsey. All right, girl. <laughs> uh... Alright, yeah, let's head back to camp and do some shit there. And then... 
Maybe we'll go get the rest of the gunslingers and get that side mission done. That sounds good. Pshaw! So, yeah. so, yeah, that's the plan. Let's plan up in here. Get out of here, turkey. I gotta be careful for them cliffs, though. Gotta be careful of them cliffs. Ooh. Big jump, big jump. Yeah. Alright. <laughs> nice up in here. Yeah, you're all right, Take a quick you're all right. look at the map, because I'm thinking once we're finished to camp. I guess we go... I do want to pay off my bounty. We go to Valentine. Ooh, we can even get a bounty poster and do a bounty mission. Uh, We need a post office. We could go to Emerald Station, pay off our bounty, and then... We head to Black Bell or... Billy Midnight. That's what I'm thinking. We'll hitch our horse here. Morning, this mister. Get away. This is more romantic than a curse. Prince turned into a toad. Lovers into stones. Entire country turned into morons. Curses everywhere. <laughs> What's Valentine's curse? Well, I didn't quite understand what the woman was saying. Kind of her being a bit of an idiot. But some about a massacre. And about a, a massacre. Mass surviving Indian cursing the county. Well, if they massacred people, then they deserve to be cursed. Of course. Of course. You believe in curses, Arthur? No. I believe in bullets. And not too much else. Believe in bullets. You soulless wretch. <laughs> what wow. Was it? What was it? Just bad luck or bad weather or something else? I'm kind of curious about, about this. Or an owl. A grave site. Some I kind of curse? It. Valentine? Hmm. Good morning, Arthur. Oh, there's... I gotta say about light. Hey, Tilly. Oh, you're too far away. You can't say hello. <laughs> it's all right. Just out here doing chores. You're fucking me too, Arthur. You talking crazy, about? Dutch. Well, I've always been crazy, Arthur. You know that. Can you hear the game okay? You are starting to unnerve me, friend. I don't, I don't think you want me any more unnerved than I already am. Man, you need to chill, buddy. Take a chill pill. If you are dying, how do you plan to repay me? You are a heartless little swine. Give me a chance, will you? You really are. There's always so much going on at the camp between the characters. I love it. All right, let's go uh, pour the water where we got to pour it. Who's whistling? You're making a, a racket over here, Pearson. Uh, yeah, we we fucking missed the barrel. <laughs> we got a, like 10% of that water bucket into the barrel. That's, that's all they needed, though. We're good to go. <laughs> There's still water in the bucket. What are you doing? <laughs> Make a big pot. I'm starving. Yeah, make a big pot of food there, buddy. Make it a good one today. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. What up, Lenny? Lenny. Hey. What's up, buddy? Keep working hard like you have been. Of course. You'll go a long way. Okay, Arthur. Okay, Arthur. <laughs> All right. Um, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Morgan, you're quite a sight. Okay. You're revolting, and you'll get all of us sick. Come with me. Ooh. Whoa! 
I'm sort of busy right now. <laughs> I wasn't asking. I'm telling my camp my rules. Come on. What, am I dirty? Get. Oh, I guess so. I mean, wash up. Yeah, I know. I know, Drew. She's, uh, she's not fucking around, is she? <laughs> That's funny. Hey, here's some money for your troubles. Why, thank you, kind sir. All right, yep. If you haven't taken a bath for a while, Miss Grimshaw will insist that you wash yourself. I actually don't remember that in my first playthrough. I don't know if that ever happened. Maybe because I was too busy taking getting baths in town all the time. <laughs> no, I'm, kidding. I'm just kidding. I don't remember that though. Hello. Hi there. <clears throat> Let's go chop some wood up in here. For the old campfire in that time. What kind of wood is that? That uh, looks like pine. Pine's pretty sappy. I mean, that's what this tree is behind me, and those are. Those look like pine trees to me. This is straight logs. If it was oak, it'd be all gnarly and twisted. Yeah, this looks like pine wood. Uh, we'll chop, chop a broccoli. Yeah. <laughs> Love how this game takes its time. I know that's one thing some people don't like about it, but I like it personally. Oh, big swing! Yeah. Pia. <laughs> All right, here we go. Another big swing. Man. Look at the guns on Arthur. <laughs> uh, let's see. We're going to do a little, more, a little more something or other here. Morning, Take a look. Hey, good morning. Hello, Miss O'Shea. Miss O'Shea. Watch the wind doesn't change. Oh, shut up, Arthur. Wouldn't want that face to freeze. Whatever you say. Oh, man. Take a look here. What can we upgrade? I kind of want to upgrade uh, so we can get some ammo. Do that. Uh, $48. Now we can get some munitions there. You know, I haven't cleaned any of my guns yet, either. Uh, throwing knives, shotgun, and rifle ammo. Let's do that. Oh, I don't want... And then I'm going to have to contribute more. We're fine, though. Quality, quality and quantity of ammunition available. Arthur's tent's been increased. Okay, I got to give him... I got to donate more money to camp here. Up in here. Okay, uh, what do we have item-wise? Five of these silver pocket watches. Let's donate some of these. Eight dollars a pop, that's nice. Um, okay. And we'll donate some money. I've got, what, 317. Let's donate... Um, money. Give money. Donate like 60 bucks. So, 69. There we go. $69. At least we get 248 100 camp. Because I think it was 78 for the next ammo upgrade. Uh, let's see. 88. God dang. Fire bottles and high velocity repeater ammo. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, yeah. There we go. Nice. We're going to get some good ammo. We're going to have lots of it. Uh, let's go ahead and donate about 50 more dollars to the camp. So 
Nobody's complaining that the camp funds are too low. They get a little, they get a little, uh, they get a little, ink, a little antsy. So, there we go, $49, that'll work. Alright, let's go get some ammo. We're gonna, let's see, the stew's not ready yet. Yeah, stew's not ready. We'll get some ammo, some good ammo. Look at this. High velocity pistol cartridges. We're gonna get regular. We're gonna craft split point bullets if I can. What an awful morning. Reverend. Crazy. Man, we're gonna have like a small uh we're gonna have enough ammo for a small army here. Okay, I can't take any of those. Where's them? Oh, here's some arrows. Take these arrows. Throwing knives. 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 Stabbing weapons. Uzi 9mm. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. Oh, yeah. Shotgun shell. Ooh, we got some mol molotovs here. Oh, that's just a waste of whiskey. No, it's, I don't think it's whiskey in there. It's probably like kerosene or gasoline. Or, well, they wouldn't have gasoline. Well, they might have. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, how's that food coming along there, Mr. Pearson? Okay, so we're stocked up on ammo. Uh, already read that. All right. Um, I've lost my mind, Mr. Morgan. Lost it entirely. Nice to see you too. Nice to see you too. I used to be an intellectual. Now I'm just a fool. Well. <laughs> I've always been happy as a fool. <laughs> you all just laugh at me. I know you do. You're always high high on drugs okay, and you're drunk as fuck. Then. I don't care. So we're up for one day for one morning. <laughs> Chill out. <laughs> uh, he does have some problems, though. Hey, y'all. Morning. Morning. What up, Uncle? Morning, Arthur. Morning. Morning. Tilly. Hey, Tilly. Hey. You're a good worker. Thank you, Arthur. Don't let me disturb you. Sure, Arthur. All right, let's go. Whoa, what up, Quip Park? Happy Sunday. Happy Sunday to you. Hope you're doing well, my friend. Hope you had a nice... Weekend, and if you uh, celebrate the old Thanksgiving, hope you had a nice one. I expect you'll betray me in the end, Arthur. You're the type. That's so. You tell me. Good to see you, buddy. This is a great game. I know it's one of my favorites of all time. I uh, I decided to do another playthrough of it. I've played through it once, the story once before. It's been a while. I played a little bit of Red Dead Online. But, uh, yeah. What was it a couple weeks ago? Or a few weeks, three weeks ago. I was like, I really want to play the story of Red Dead again, too. I've never played the first one. <clears throat> I'd love to. But, yeah. So, uh. <clears throat> you never read? Yeah, I love this game. It's so good. How are you doing, Quip Ark? Hope you're well, man. I want to see the ghost. Bark, bark, bark. What up, ghostess? The ghostess hostess with the mostess, everybody. 24 ghosts is here. 24 ghosts, I'm glad you had a good Thanksgiving. Uh, sorry to hear your power went out. 
the other day and all your leftovers are no longer around. That's a shame. That sucks. But it's good to see ya. Alright, you were able to get more, thankfully. Nice. Hey there. You're only getting more. Excellent. Excellent. We're gonna feed them horses up in here. <laughs> but yeah, I know some of you too. You probably had a long weekend. It's getting towards the end of it, but appreciate you being here. Spending your time. Hanging out. Be a nice, relaxing stream. Besides all the gun shooting and action, but just running around doing some chores right here. Oh, I need to uh, go find Jack and give him some candy. Little Jack was asking for candy and we found some. So after I drop this hay, let's go. While I'm thinking of it, we'll find little Jack. And then, uh. You have no way of sending the sound clip you want? I'm sure we could figure something out, Ghostess. Is it a sound clip you're, like, recording on your phone? Um, also, depending on the file type it is, the file size, I mean, we can, we can figure something out. Um, yeah. Let me know. Yeah. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Thank you. Don't worry about it, Reverend. I made a fool of myself again. We've all done that. Mm. I'm bitterly ashamed. Really. Don't be so hard on yourself, Reverend, here. Anyway, I won't disturb you. But I yeah, if can. it's something on your phone. I mean, Ghostess, I, I'm friends with you enough. I'd be willing to... Give you my phone number you could text it to me or i can give you an email you could send it to wasn't able to troubleshoot it in three seconds so you thought you could figure it out together yeah i'm i'm totally down to uh working with you on that what we got here swanson's bible this is reverend's bible let's see what it says is this a regular bible or is this uh curious Look at that. Goddamn Reverend Swanson. No wonder you're always fucking freaking out, man. You gotta lay off that shit. Phone number would be easiest for you and your email goes wonky, but totally up to me. Alright, yeah, we can... We'll message each other about it. We'll figure something out, but yeah, I wouldn't mind. Don't give out my phone number to... To a lot of folks, but I'd give We're it to free. you. We are alive, and we are free. So enjoy yourselves. Does the game sound loud enough? Life is good. Oh, life is good. You hear that, Mr. Pearson? Let me see what it. Very good, sir. Very good indeed. So all of you, keep busy, and stay out of the worst. Of trouble out there. Thank you. Game sounds we good. Thank it. you. Thank you. Appreciate that. All right. So we've done all the chores. Where's Jack at? I'm give him some candy. I found. Uh. There's Molly O'Shea. There's Pearson. There's Strauss. Uncle. The Reverend. Dutch. Sometimes they're... They all... That's one thing I like is they kind of do all the... Okay, here's uh, Abigail. Miss Roberts. Hello. Oh, there's Jack. Is the boy behaving himself? For the most part. Okay, I'll leave you two to it then. Yeah, goodbye. Goodbye. Hey, Jack, what's Hi, up? Jack. Hello, Arthur. You're a good kid. Thanks, Uncle Arthur. 
Anyway, I'll leave you to it. Okay. How do I give him candy? I found candy. Uh, what just happened? Discard, eat. No, I don't want to eat the candy. You're going to lurk there, gentlemen? Thanks for hanging out, man. Appreciate it. Hope you have a good rest of your day or evening and uh, appreciate you hanging out. I can smell you. Stinky. Oh. Uh, sorry, my mind was elsewhere. You think you're funny. Chubas odors of noodles. Doodles. Welcome on in, Judos. It's good to see ya. Hope you're doing well. Judos. Yeah. Good to see you, Drew. Have a good rest of your day. Nah. Yeah, I'll be playing this. Judos coming in, hugging everybody up in here. Everybody up in here. <laughs> Judo's good to see ya. Hope you're doing well. Happy weekend. You'll work it out, Dutch. You'll um. Hello, Arthur. Oh. Always appreciate you having around. It's always good to see you, Judo's. Whether no matter where it is, whether it's here or in your streams or my streams or any stream. <laughs> uh, you having a good weekend? Hell yeah, that's what I like to hear. Am I? I'm having a great weekend. Today is my Saturday. I slept in. I woke up at five, and I was like, not that tired. And I almost got up. Or no, I'm sorry, not five, six. I was almost like, hmm, maybe I should get up. But I did. I I got up for like ten minutes, and I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna go lay down. And then I slept till like 8.30. Normally I get up at 6.30 and I had like crazy dream, but it was pretty awesome. And uh, yeah, uh, Sunday's streaming day for me, so I was looking forward to it. And uh, it's been going good. It's going great. Going fantastic. Crazy awesome dreams. Yeah, like when I I was at some wedding that was outdoors, and then there were like uh, it was like the cooks or I don't know. In my dream, like everyone had already eaten, and I went and talked. I was like looking for food, and <laughs> the cooks had all this weird exotic food that they wanted me to eat. That looked good, and I ate one thing, and then I woke up, and I was like, that's kind of weird. And then, yes, my sister's birthday's tomorrow. She wants to go to a Mexican restaurant. So, it's going to be awesome. Yeah, and then we're just playing cowboy game right now. We're playing a... I don't know. I really just like the... This game's so good. We're gonna pet the horse. This is gonna be the rest of the stream right here. Pat the horse. No. We're gonna brush the horse. We're gonna feed the horse. <laughs> Won't take long. Won't take long. <laughs> feed the horse. Mm hmm. There you go. Uh, and then, actually, I'm, I've got a bounty of $5 on my head. I'm going to go pay that off. Then we're going to go these uh, Billy Midnight, Black Bell, and this one up here, Flaco Hernandez. These are gunslingers that uh, this one guy's writing a book about. We're going to go visit the gunslingers. Um, so my next plan of action, where's that one guy, where's that one, Black Bell, Billy Midnight, let's see, should I go down to Billy Midnight, or should I go up to Flaco Hernandez, you know what I'm gonna do, 
We're gonna ride into the town of Valentine. I'm gonna go to the post office, pay off my bounty. Can even do a bounty hunting mission there too. But we're gonna pay off our bounty and then go from there. Uh, getting ready to play Among Us with some friends. Awesome. Go to the gunslinger. <laughs> actually, in that case, I was actually getting ready to take a tiny little break too. We're gonna go pay off our bounty at this post office. Then we're gonna go go either see Black Bell or Billy Midnight. But yeah, that's awesome. I've never played Among Us, but I imagine that'd be a lot of fun with friends. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna take a five minute break. It's been two hours. I've been streaming for two hours, so I'm right about that that time, the old break time. So, uh, if you don't mind, oh, yeah, it'll go stretch here, stretch and drink. You are all weirdos. <laughs> Bunch of weirdos up in here. Right. Doodles, good to see you. Enjoy the music from Bill Kiley and the old train footage. I'll be right back, folks. Give me about five minutes. Thank you for being here. I care about you.
have returned. Thanks for the, uh, I'll call you out, Jules. Your, uh, your disco email, I love. It's one of my favorites. I use it a lot. Um, man, it's good to have everybody here. Always a pleasure. Get right back to it. Hit the hit the trails there, partner. Uh yes, yes. Team riding first person. Oh no, I I usually only switch to first person sometimes during gunfights, but Yeah. Oh well, it looks good. Well them deer get out of the room. Calm down, calm down. Oh, it was dead deer. That same dead deer that was there. Alright, let's go pay off our bounty. Did I already. Yeah, there was a hidden chest under that. That wagon up a wood here. Yeah. Yup. Yup. That there was. Ooh, what are we going here? Campfire. Is this? Yeah, it's funny because these are kind of random. Just what in the hell are you doing here? What in the hell are you doing? You better leave. You don't like visitors, huh? All right, all right. Calm down, calm down. <laughs> Some people are friendly. Most of the time, they're like, "What? What are you doing here? Get on, get, go on, get." Get out! Get, get out of here! <laughs> uh, yes. Yeah, but everything's looking all right this time around. Whoa! Was there a snake back there? I think there was a snake back there. Right, let's go to the train station. Post office pay off that bounty. And go check out one of the gunslingers up in here. Yeah. I heard a turkey. Or Thanksgiving green turkey over there. That's it. Yep. Good good horsey. <laughs> All right, let's check this out up in here. Emerald Station. What the hell is wrong with you? Get out! Oh, I, I thought that was the front door, sir. Pardon me. Pardon me, sir. Happy to help you start over. Yep, let's pay off this bounty. I'll let the people in New Hanover know. Yep, you let them know so them bounty hunters don't come after me. Have a good one. You too, you too there, partner. Uh, I don't have any mail. Okay. We can play dominoes. I don't feel like playing dominoes, though, right now. Yep. We're gonna go get uh, one of them gunslingers up in here. Black Bells. We're closer to Black Bell. That one's... That one's really good. Bet the horsey. <laughs> yep. yep. We gotta go this way. And then once we unlock the fence, we can even. Oh shit! <laughs> At least we didn't kill him. That was my bad. <laughs> <That wasn't... laughs> that was my bad there. <laughs> yeah. I haven't been down to this area yet. What's up in here? What's up over here? What's up there? Bill. 
Whoa. They got the wrong man. They got my brother Petey. Petey's always been in trouble. So this guy's asking for help. Should we try and help him or should we... They called you a woman killer, not a turncoat. Your own brother? Taking this one in. Stay out of our way. Whoa. Somebody help me. Uh... Stay back. back or you'll be sorry. Looking for his brother. Whoa. Oh, I missed. <laughs> uh, I should probably have my gun out. Now. I'm not trying to lasso these folks. Wait, get back here. Hey, stuck on this horse. Hopefully we're not making a bad decision. Can't you get me off this thing? Let's see. All right, stranger. Hey, friend. Why you carrying me, huh? Well, let's hey, go. Untie me, damn it. I just saved your ass. Don't be so demanding there, partner. Jesus, thank you. you. Had me mixed up with my brother. Okay. There's a high rolling poker game above the Saint Denis gunsmith. Ooh. Hopefully. That high rolling it. poker game. Got a robbery tip here. Nice. Take a look at that. Uh, oh, I still have some treasures I can try and find. A home robbery? A shop robbery? Shit, we got all kinds of stuff we can do. Rumor has it the gunsmith in Saint Denis is running a profitable gambling operation. Look around at the shop to investigate. Okay, what about home robbery? An old lady who lives alone north of Strawberry is rumored to be sitting on some valuables. Okay. Record a map that is said to show the location of the notorious Jack Hall gang's lost treasure. And then dinosaur bones. Deborah McGinnis has requested your help in finding dinosaur bones. The location of each bone can be mailed back to Deborah from any post office. Um, what's this, Jim Boy? Oh, this is the mission we're working on. Where. The biographer Theodore Levin asked for help completing his book about legendary gunslinger Jim Boy Calloway. So we're going to that's what we're doing is we're gonna go talk to the old gunslingers to see if they have stories or a quote for old Jim Boy Calloway. See because I'm not Getting bad karma from killing these guys tells me we did save the right guy. Yeah, he's a bounty hunter. Whoa, all oh, Judals, you're too kind. Judals, it's always good to see you. I enjoy your streams. It's always fun hanging out in your streams. And also, this is pretty cool. If you double tap the weapon, uh, the button that. Put your gun away. You do a little twirly whirl. You enjoy my company? I enjoy yours too. Look at this gun we got. Oh wait, that's right. How do I... Maintain. Look at this. Look at this gun. Look how pretty she is. Uh... It's always good to see ya. Well, and then your streams are fun too, because you always got cool music playing and it's fun to be around. Uh, how do you? There's a way to flip your gun. All right, we're fine. 
the wrong button. All right. You gonna make your eyes leak? Oh. We've been spotted. Nearby civilian Caesar, here's something suspicious that we have come to investigate. Oh, you son of a bitch. Uh, sir, that wasn't called for. We have to, uh... He shot first. He shot first. What's in the... What in the tar face? <laughs> he started it. I'm gonna lose some, car some karma for this, but... That's alright. Oh, actually, yeah, I did lose a little karma for it. That's all right. We're going to go see uh, BRB. You got to be non-sussy alien thingy up. in this game. Oh, yeah, yeah, in Among Us. You lurk with the most love. Oh. Well, have fun playing Among Us. And uh, watch out for all them, the other sussy players <laughs> no have a blast with your friends in among us thank you for lurking and saying hi i appreciate you even if your friends are suspicious well in among us they are everyone is uh they're probably great people but not in that game you gotta watch watch out for all of them we're gonna pick some of those plants up here. But no, have a blast. Thank you for saying hi. It's always a pleasure. Judos, have fun playing Among Us. I'm gonna pick me some, uh, some herbs up in here. You'll come back once you're dead. <laughs> yeah, come back whenever you feel like it. You're always welcome, of course. Little 420 herbs up in here. We got some hummingbird sage. What else we got up in here? There ain't wacky tobacco up in here. Maybe there's wacky tobacco over here. Take an examine. What do we got up here? Mmm. Carrots. No, that's ginseng. <laughs> no. Have a blast, Judos. I'll see you around. You, uh, yeah. You do what you want to do and, uh. Let me see you around, my friend. Keep your eyes peeled for them sussy. There's no sussy. music. They can't dance. <laughs> Mags can't dance. It's good to see ya. Hello. Yep, Judos, thank you. Don't trust anyone in that game. Mags can't, Mags can't dance. Hope you're doing well. It's good to see my friend. Did you have a good turkey day? Thanksgiving, if you celebrate. How's the garden going? I know winter's gonna affect that. But yeah, it's always, always good to see you, Mags. Mags, Joodles, everybody. Is this some more ginseng? Yeah. Oh, I have too much, but I can eat it. You're doing good. Thanksgiving was good. The garden's under snow. Ooh, gotcha. I'm glad you had a good Thanksgiving. Yep, we all have lots to be thankful for. I I try and take a moment every day to be thankful for what I have. I uh, even when it's not Thanksgiving. Most of the time I do. Uh, for me it's important to Yeah, you know, take a Take a moment each day and like really think about like wow, really am 
fortunate and have a lot to be thankful for. Oh, there's more. More uh, plants we can pick up over here. Okay, these are carrots. Wild carrots for a horsey. I like to use these to give them to the horse. Of course. Mm-hmm. Yep. Stuff them in that satchel there, Arthur. Any back there? Any more plants to pick? Oh, I think we're good. Megs, it's a pleasure to see ya. How's, uh, Daisy going for ya? Have you been playing some of that? Recently, good game, good game. You know, last night I was talking this. There's somebody I was watching him stream, and the game Escape from Tarkov came up, and they're like, "I think I'd like that game. I'm not gonna spend sixty bucks on it." And it's on sale this weekend, and I looked up on their website. I wanted to see what the sale price was. And I must have been, like, half asleep. Get away from me now. Oh, shit. No. So when you tell... You were yeeted from the ladder in the vault? Oh, shit. Is that in Livonia, the, the vault you're talking about? No matter how powerful the wind is, he's limited to the number of spells you can cast each day. What up, ghosty? Good luck with it. Good to see you. Oh, in Deer Isle, you got yeeted. <laughs> Did, was it pretty funny, or was it... Well, I'm sure it was annoying, but... Great ghosty, it's good to see you. Hope you're well. It was funny. Yeah, sometimes when games glitch out like that, or just like shoot you in the air, like a mile, couple miles high, <laughs> or something like that. Alright, we're gonna stow this. We're gonna get meat and the pelt off this other wolf. Uh, maybe I should go sell this ship. I don't know. It's nine at night here in game. So the butcher's going to be closed in town. Maybe we'll go finish this. I don't know. I kind of want to. Hmm. What should I do? Where are we at? We are out in the middle of nowhere, kind of. Yeah, we have a long way to go there. Um, maybe we'll go ahead and ride it all the way to Valentine. Sleep at the hotel and then check the butcher in the morning. And we'll do that. You did get an awesome revenge kill on Winter Is Tech. Nice. That's cool, girl. Yeah. Yeah. I've been my. I want been wanting to play some DayZ. Uh. My friend's been playing it, but I'm when he's been playing it, it's like right before I'm getting ready to go to bed. It's like I don't want to play DayZ just for a half hour, you know. With my buddy. <laughs> That's the kind of game you yep. need at least a couple hours. It's usually a good couple hours to get a, a nice session in. But, uh, yeah. that's going well for you. You have fun with it. Hope you had a nice weekend. 
always nice to see ya. Oh, I remember that house. We'll come there later. That's, uh... That's the house I'm thinking of. There's some shady stuff going on up over there. <laughs> Animals attract. Tash to my horse will decompose. Sell them before this happens. Okay. All right, girl. All right, girl. So yeah, let's go sell right, these girl. animals. Sell this wolf, Curtis. Yep. Before uh, he decomposes. Wolf, uh, yeah. Uh, nasty. We're just cutting through everything. We're not. Uh, this is just like Grand Theft Auto, where it shows you the shortest route if you're hanging, sticking to the main roads. Beautiful game. Oh, I know. I love it. It's so good looking. Look at what you just look at by it. There you go, Steve. It's good to see you. Look at this tree. Gravestone. Yeah. I know this area. We'll, we'll be back to it. Go ahead and get haul, boot, haul some booty to Valentine. Very good looking. Look at that. Would you just look at it? Uh, yeah. I hope everyone's having a nice weekend. I know I am. Oh. Horses running out of energy core. Did sign up for a few events for DayZ in December. Nice. Hell yeah. Um, what kind of events like uh, that sounds fun, Max. How was Thanksgiving? Thanksgiving was good for me. Great ghosty. I hope you had a nice one. I. I went to my mom's house, and my dad was there, my sister and brother-in-law. Had a good dinner, and it was good family time. It was really nice. What was yours, man? Hope you had a nice one. Oh, uh, yeah. Alright, so we're gonna go to the hotel... Take a bath, get a bath, and, uh... Oh, what's he complaining about? <laughs> sell the wolf. Yeah, I want to sell the wolf. The butcher won't be open till the morning, though. Beats me? Sure don't look like the... What are they smoking? Come on, open here. I am gloriously fuddled now. I feel so light and heavy. Like they're smoking opium. <laughs> Have I told you what an amazing woman you are? Oh, I'm losing karma while spying on him. Let us be free. And wild. <laughs> what the and hell? Bad, my dear. Well, it eight. Let us some expensive steak, and you got a little tipsy. Nice. That love has never been made before. Uh, uh, let me He's talking about getting all wild, and they're both like just passing out. That's funny. 
I don't remember coming across that before. Mm, steak sounds good. Well, I'm glad you, uh, you can hardly move right now. <laughs> I'm glad you had a good Thanksgiving there, ghosty. How do you do? How do you do? Oh, that's another thing. In Red Dead Online, I haven't checked, but around Christmas time for about a month in Red Dead Online, it snows almost everywhere on the whole map. And then the saloons, the pianos are playing like Christmas tunes. That's pretty cool. So if the new, uh, if it's not snowing everywhere... All that I am and all that I've done, you're questioning whether I am ready for what I'm about to do. Man, you're really not even close to where you need to be. <laughs> Try macho, man. So I wonder if in uh, on Red Dead Online, if it's snowing everywhere yet. I don't Hello, think it is. Let's see, we'll do a bath and then... I need a bath. That's okay. Can you organize? I got someone warming it up for you already. Just head down the corridor there. <laughs> yeah, look how dirty Arthur is. Got mud and shit all over his clothes. You dirty. Ah, that's nice. Grab a leg. <laughs> Scrub a dub dub. Oh, I gotta tap the button. Can I be of any assistance in there? Oh, assistance. A deluxe bath for 50 cents. Oh, oh my goodness. Sit back and relax, hon. Goodness gracious. <laughs> Hope the water's hot enough. Yeah, water's good, water's good. <laughs> On a rubber ducky. <laughs> You'll leave this place feeling brand new, you know. Hello, <laughs> Hey, <laughs> Razor. Happy ending? Maybe. Some parts of me probably ain't been this clean in months. Oh, I'm not sure what to make of that. Here, it's nice to see you. I hope you're well. So how's it going? How's it going? Good. Good. <laughs> um. Oh, I'm glad of this. It's been a hard few days. Oh, really? <laughs> And we're good. Boy, boy, boy. <laughs> All right, I think I'm good. <laughs> it was nice meeting you. Well, that's right. Kitsarito was showing shared a video where uh, Arthur was getting a bath, and somehow outside the room was catching on fire. So and then the fire came in the room, and the lady assisting with the bath. Gone on fire. <laughs> just like, how the hell did that happen? All right, let's rent a room. So when we get up, we can uh, sleep through the night, and the old butcher will be open in the morning. We can sell the the wolf carcass and the skins we have. She was being paid for harlot ways. <laughs> Time to sleep. Get these drawers closed. We're all clearly adults here, yes. Uh, sleep. Sleep, please, till... 
Well, it's 5.32 a.m. So I guess we're sleeping till noon. Then we'll go sell uh, the stuff we have on us. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> yeah, happy Sunday, everyone. Happy weekend. New journal entry. All right, let's go sell these this wolf carcass before it goes rotten. Then we'll read the journal. Cause uh Yeah. Hey mister. Hey, hey much game. Guess it wasn't your day today, huh? It ain't a competition, friend. Look oh, it's down. starting to lose value. Son of a bitch. Come on, ladies. This sirloin will put a smile on your man's face. Guaranteed. Been a while. All right, let's you see. Butcher, have you? <laughs> Sell. Move it. On the horse. Good wolf carcass. Sure, I'm buying. All right. All right, cool. Sold. Partner. Partner. Hey, right. horse, you're filthy. You're a little brushy, a little dusty there. Take it easy. Take it Welcome easy. Alright, we're gonna go... Since we're looking for the gunslingers... Closer to this one, we're gonna go check out uh, Flacco. Sir Flacco Hernandez. What's possessed you? Stay away from me! Oh, shit. He's we freaked that guy out. <laughs> if I remember correctly, I think this is the guy's way up in the snow. Oh, well, I mean the marker's pointing that way. That leads up to the mountains. Yeah. Uh wait, 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 wait. Oh. Let's just kind of stick to the main road down here. Whoa, shit! Damn! Damn! Poor horsey. You right there? You right there? Took a little bit of health hit, but. Come on. <laughs> you okay? You okay? It's all right. It was just uh. <laughs> It was a shortcut we weren't prepared for. <laughs> Whoa, what's that guy doing? You know, right there? Partner? That would have been a broken leg and a horse at, to the glue factory. We're not yeah. friends anymore. We're not. They won't forgive you. Uh -uh. They, they, they didn't forgive me. There is no forgiveness. None, friend. None. Mad preacher, huh? I, I know you want it. I can smell it on you. <laughs> well... It didn't happen. No, 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 no it guy? didn't. <laughs> that's why, that, that, that's why uh, I'm out here well away from them. <laughs> they come for me. Who's this guy? But I'm watching. Who's they? I, I never sleep. I never do. What a breath. This guy's not showering. Is he? This mad preacher here in the hanging out in the river. Good to see you, Rav. Hope you're well. Happy weekend. Hope you had a nice Thanksgiving. Uh Yes, hey buddy. Ravenous. Yes, yes. We did spy on a couple uh, they were smoking out of the pipe. 
think it was opium. Uh, we did take a bath and had some assistance. And now we're on our way to meet up uh, with one of the old gunslingers that might know something about another gunslinger that a guy is writing a book about. Do you remember? Not yet. Yeah. Good to see you, buddy. Man, this game looks so good. Love it. Alright, yeah. Some assistance, yes. Bathing assistance. Whoa, what's going on? Ladies and gentlemen, we got a hot raid coming in from Mr. Blitz Brom himself. Oh, Blitz, thanks for the raid, man. We're gonna shout out here, yeah, up in here. What's your raid? Thank you for the raid. Because I'm assuming their dad's not doing it. <laughs> I'll need some more. Huh? Huh? Need a couple more. Wax. Do you? Huh? So. <laughs> How was your stream, bud? Playing some Deep Rock, Rock Galactic. Nice. That game looks cool. Someone was being naughty. Help me! Oh. My horse died and I'm stuck here. Uh, you gotta help me, mister. How about we skip the small talk, eh? Oh, oh you son of a bitch. Nice try. Oh, he's dead. Have I considered anger management? <laughs> or has Blitz considered it? Lots of fun. Bowser Junior had it coming. Oh, in that clip, yeah, yeah. Uh, that's one thing I love about some of those encounters in this game. Someone actually needs help, or some people fake like it. Yeah, yeah. Deep Rock Galactic looks like it'd be a lot of fun with friends. Yeah. Thanks for the raid, buddy. Appreciate it. Yep. Wrecked, yes. He was messing with the wrong man. Now cold. While cold, your health core will drain faster. Change clothes to warm up. Good horse would let someone else ride away with it. Wood or wouldn't? Yeah, yeah. It would know, like, hey. Look at that moose. Oh, can we study it? Yes. Compendium updated. Western bull moose. Yeah, well, and horses are like, uh... I mean, especially with... They've got somebody that rides them all the time. They know. Animals are smart. We were talking about that earlier. Uh, Liddy 404, formerly Loading Personality LP, was talking about how his uncle used had like a trained hawk that would hunt rabbits for him, and how people train hawks to race. And we we're talking about how crows uh, recognize human faces. Pretty amazing. All right, we're getting close. Uh, I'm gonna uh, eat some chewing tobacco here. Get my dead eye up a little bit before we yeah. come across this. Uh... Easy. Okay. 
Oh, one thing too about running on ice. When you hit the brakes on the horse. <laughs> you slide a bit farther. And then if you get off and you walk slow on ice. The Arthur's walking a little more carefully. Whoops. Oh, oh, oh. Alright. Oh, I don't think this is the cabin we need to go in. But since we're here, we might as well get some of this stuff. What do we got here? Grave newspaper clipping. What that's in? Yeah. Let's read it. Let's see. Dreadful incident. Talented ice skater's career cut short in terrible accident. Well, it says. Hmm. Oh, there's another card on the table. All right, have fun. Time for you to head out, Mags. All right. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for saying hi. It's always a pleasure to see you, my friend. Have a good rest of your evening. Appreciate ya. And, uh, yeah. Just saying hi. Felix Holly, Red Rocket. What's that say at the bottom, very bottom under that? Cigarette Tobacco. World Champions packed in Red Rocket. Best smokers in chewing tobacco. Smoking and chewing tobacco. Collect all cards. Found a cigarette card. Some hobbyists consider these cards to be valuable collector's items. Keep an eye out for more. And it increased our dead eye a little bit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Megs can't dance. Appreciate you, my friend. Oh, I can't take the coffee out. Full. Full long coffee. Alright. Okay. Uh, yeah. I mean... I oh, found two favorite cards up in here. Yeah. What was the other one? What was the, the another one? Well, I don't know. I don't care. It's fine. Let's go find this gunslinger up in here. Uh, yeah, thanks for everybody for hanging out. <laughs> Appreciate ya. Hey girl. Don't yeah. get. It. Let's see, can I I'm trying to remember, can I change my clothes here? Yeah. Gunslinger outfit, custom outfit. Swap to gunslinger. I think that's the same of what I have going. Yeah, I, I don't have my heavy coat on. Oh, wait a second. Wait, wait. Hold up, hold up. See how it's got the sun symbol there? I think that means that's good for, like, hot weather. But uh, I think I'm wearing the same outfit no matter whether it's my custom or the gunslinger outfit. I think that's all I have right now. That's all right. Um, I love the snow effects in this game. So good. Let's go see uh, yeah. Sir Flacco. Sir Flacco Vato Super Loco bumping it up. That's actually a song. It's Flacco something or other we're meeting up with. There's a song okay, called then. Sir Flacco, where the lyrics go, Sir Flacco Vato Super Loco pumping it up. Sir Flacco Vato Super Loco pumping it up. Pumping it up. Pumping it up. <laughs> Got a friend named Sir Flacco. 
but I don't remember the rest. But it's a good song. Am I okay? Yes, I'm doing great. Uh, <laughs> trying to keep myself entertained. You care? I know. Do I do I not sound okay? Is that what's going on? Up, up in here? I sound a little weird all. How you can hear the uh, I call it. I'm just seeing funny shit, and the other <laughs> you were cracking up. Where's the goddamn old cowboy bug? Sir Flacco, Sir Flacco, what the super loco puppy get him? Yeah, I <laughs> got that cowboy bug running around on me on riding the horse out in the wilderness. Be now in the wilderness by yourself for a while. Just you and your horse, you know. You gotta, gotta try and keep yourself entertained. Whoa, look at that bunny rabbit. It's hauling ass. Well, I'm glad I'm... <laughs> glad you're all enjoying it. Uh... there the cabin is that where are we culture okay that's the town we came in at the very beginning of the game in the middle of the blizzard what is that corpse over there shit I want to check that out I want to check that out it's all the way back here I want to see what it is, though. We didn't kill anybody on the way here. So it might be something. There are times in this game where you see a corpse and it uh, might lead to a little loot spot or a treasure chest. So The funny thing is, though, I would have no idea this corpse is here unless I... If I didn't look on the map. Oh. Camp. Looks like some poor soul froze to death. But yeah, look at this snow. It's got the little sparkles. I mean, that looks pretty realistic to me. Oh, it's a couple. Note. What do we got here? We got up in here. What is this? Panoramic map. Uh, it's got like five lines. Hmm. Nighttime. Kind of cryptic. The shame that someone froze to death. I'll steal their shit. I know. There's a guy there. Oh, it's my shadow. <laughs> Whoa. That's pretty gruesome. That's all okay. I don't remember coming across this before. Come on, girl. Wait. I mean, they're already dead, so it's. Can we loot the corpses? Is there anything else on them? Nope. Okay. Oh, we've left tracks. All right, let's go see Fl Sir Flacco. Sir Flacco Vato Super Loco pumping it up. 
Let's see, it's this way. The road, uh, it's telling me the road's way down over there. But the grizzlies, gotta watch out for them bears. Hold out, it's getting night time. Son of a gun. Ooh, look at my health core, it's down pretty low. Let's, uh. Oh shit. Alright. Search the camp for Flaco Hernandez. Alright, let's, uh. We're gonna. Some tobacco here. Kettleman. Granger's revolver. We're gonna bust out the carbine repeater and. So Springfield rifle and double barrel shotgun. We need some tobacco. All right, before we head in, let's scout it out with the binox here. Let's see one, two, three behind that guy. Four. Happens. Uh, let's see. Do we, maybe we'll go. Yeah, let's go with rifle. But actually, let's talk first, and then they'll probably get hostile, and then we'll kill everybody. Is probably what's going to happen. I'm thinking. Hey, we need to hey, get out of this cold. Who's that? Who's You're that? in the wrong camp, stranger. Diffuse. I don't mean no harm, okay? Just want to speak to Hernandez. We don't like visitors up here. Kill this fool. Oh, you're, you're just like going straight on kill this fool out of the bat. Okay, so his shot is Among Us is not your game. <laughs> what happened out there? Someone's still alive. What happened in Among Us is Sir Flacco's getting suspicious. He just heard a gunshot. He just bored to death. Gotcha. Yeah, I mean, I've never played that game, so. Flacco Hernandez, you in there? I didn't want trouble, but I'm just here to speak with you about Boy Calloway. Put your weapons away, and I'll come out. Okay. You were falling asleep. Oh, no. Wow. That bad? No. If you if you don't like it, you don't like it. Nothing wrong with that. I just want to talk about Boy Callaway. Sure. Here's one of gunslingers. Draw. Here's your message. We got him. No, Toodles, I don't think that's bad. From what I've seen of uh, Among Us, it's it seems like one of those games that's just... Uh, like you try and trick the other people you're playing with. It's, it's, I don't know how to describe it. Because I've never played it, but... It's almost like playing, uh, you know, some other game where you just... <laughs> it's weird. Yeah, it looks weird. I mean, I, I could... 
I think I would only like it with friends, but I could also see from your perspective it might just be kind of boring. Ooh, we can get Flacco's revolver here. How do I do that? Doodles. You don't get it? Like, we're having fun and on Overwatch, and then Among Us is like, Okay, it's bedtime. <laughs> Ooh. We got Flacco's revolver. A rare Kettleman revolver featuring delicate engravings and a carved ivory handle. Pre previously owned by the late gunslinger Flacco. Gunslinger. Flaco Hernandez, get revolved, defeated in a duel at Karn Lake. This gun is an ammo capacity of six rounds. Use regular high velocity split point express and, and explosive revolver ammo. Yeah. Good old air razor saying hello. All right, let's loot this guy. Can I loot him? We got the photo of him. See, now, now I have Flacco's revolver. What about the other guy's, the other revolver I just dropped? Is that, will I ever get that back? Do I have to just pick one or the other? Because I don't have two holsters yet. Not sure. Ooh, a document. Trail map. What is that? Look. Jeez, we got treasure maps. We got to find treasures and everything still. My goodness. Can't carry any more cigar premium cigarettes. Let's smoke some. We're in them cigarettes. Premium cigarettes, hero. <laughs> now we can take him. Oh, we got another cigarette card, too. Who's this? William Schleicher. Hmm, oh, fancy. I'll take it. Uh, <laughs> well? I mean, based on your, uh, your recommendation, or no, <laughs> recommendation sounds like I won't be getting Among Us anytime soon. It did look like Conan O'Brien, Rav. I'm Conan O'Brien. <laughs> it does look like him. It does look like Conan O'Brien. Hydrate. Came out in Death Stranding and first, now this. <laughs> We didn't loot the rest of the all these guys. Just around camp too. Might be some more lootables. Um. Oh. Something over there. Grab some items over there. We can check. What's in here? Uh, canned salmon. Yo. Uh, that reminds me, there's new, a newer, that, what's that series Conan O'Brien does on his show? It's like the Clueless Gamer, I think it is. You are all weirdos. <laughs> Thank you, Joodles. You wish you had a play CD, uh, had a PC to play the role play version of this game. You're always clueless. Clueless Gamer. Yeah, there's a, a newer segment of that that came out, I think, within the last couple weeks I haven't watched. In You're in pain, angry, and almost murderous. I'm sorry to hear that air. But I'm glad. I always like having you around air. I wish for the best for you, my friend. P 
feel that on an emotional level, too. Something right now, a man in my position cannot be bored to look ridiculous at any time. When that comes from me, that says something. Very macho man. Comes from macho man. It says something. Uh, what's the another thing? Did I already loot this? I think I just did. Oh, this is the guy. You think you can help? Trudeau is very kind. Yeah, or if you need, you can always talk to. Hit us up. Gotta get you out of Canada. Would be great. At least you'd be further away from this pointing rage. Ah. Uh. Well, you can always. Always send me a DM if you need someone to talk to. Ooh, I want to check out this. Is there anything over here in this uh, wagon? No. Nope. Could marry someone to get the green card. Slippery out here on this ice. Whoosh. game. Easy, girl. You're okay. Stripey and you have joked about it. <laughs> That's funny. Let's see. Um. Okay, so we got this gunslinger taken care of. Oh, kind of sucks looking that gun there. I don't know. Uh, hmm. Well, I guess we can head back to camp. Because that's on the way to the next Gunslingers. We'll hit up Billy Midnight and Old Black Bale. Mm -hmm. Whoa, easy. Easy, yeah. easy. It's icy out here. I love how it even keeps your tracks from when you came in. They probably stick around for a certain amount of time. I'm not sure how that works, though. Or maybe I wouldn't be surprised if it's actually snowing, if it covers your tracks a lot quicker. Know what I mean? Know what I mean, man? Yeah. Yeah, let's get going. Savage punched up the oh. elbow. He got it. He got it. He nailed it. Macho Man has sacrificed another hamster for the cause. <laughs> that was good timing. Good, good job, Bear. I like that. <laughs> oh, jeez, that was funny. <laughs> All right, now get out of here. Go the road. I think they're down that way to my right. Stinking wolves. Okay. Let's bright out enough without this uh, lantern. It's almost a full moon on a snowy night. Thanks, you'll be fine. Just be that more. Much more to release when all hell breaks loose. Yeah. Yeah. No, we care about Jair. That's all. Uh, we apparently we're following this deer all the way to Ballantyne. <laughs> Uh, 
I forget. I think you can lasso animals, too, or at least some of them. But deer, that's that same deer still. I guess they don't have many. Well, because they're sticking to paths. The AI is sticking to paths, I imagine. If there's not somewhere off, they can run off and, you know. Oh, we're chasing another deer. It's a buck. Buck this time. Buck all night. <laughs> All right. Um, we're gonna head back to camp. Yep. yep. Head back to camp and uh, do a little cooking, maybe a little crafting, maybe. Um, go we'll get the other gunslingers we need for this mission. Man, it's crazy how long this. Game is especially if you do the side missions and stuff. And we haven't even uh, gotten Sean back yet. We haven't even gone fishing yet. There's a lot to it. And that's if you're sticking to missions. I am like kind of running between side missions and then. I'm doing like the random encounters that pop up. Cause you can't kind of just blow through that stuff and do just the story missions if you want. But I like doing all the other stuff too. And I'm in no hurry. I'm having a good time just hanging out. Riding the trails. Easy, whoa. We're gonna go yeah. this way, horsey. The old dusty trail, that's right, Jules. Okay, girl. Hey, you're okay, girl. Then we gotta pet our horse more. This gonna be the next... Next ten minutes right here. Good horsey. Good horsey. Good horsey. <laughs> oh. Yep. <laughs> Ride like the wind, bullseye. Come on now. Come on. Oh, something's going on over here. We got going over here. Title, you just seen I kept it. Yeah. Seemed too good to change. Appreciate you stepping in there. Those bastards been turning the screw on me from day one, saying I gotta pay them protection money. Protection money. To stick it, and well, I guess you just saw how that panned out. Yeah, they can stick it where the sun sun don't shine. You watch yourself, all right? Stay out of trouble. I'll try. <laughs> Yeah, these guys trying to. What happened to you two? Guys trying to strong arm them for protection money. There's a snake in his boot. Stop whining. <laughs> Stop whining. Come on. There is no bathroom. Oh, jeez, Arnold. Come on. I have to go, though. We're you are all weirdos. <laughs> There's a snake in the boot. We got us to put a new hat on if we won't. Savage perched up there in the elbow. He got it. He nailed him. He got him. He, he nailed him.
Well, let's see. Is he gonna be mad if I take with some of this, <laughs> some of this brandy? Time to stop. What a victory, the Impaler. Good to see ya. Hey, stop that. All right, all right. Okay, yeah, just because I saved your ass doesn't mean I can just steal your brandy. You're right, you're right. Vic, hope you're doing well. My friend, good to see you. Come on, girl. Come on, girl. <laughs> you know, I don't like that. We're switching back to Arthur's hat. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> like, just because you saved my life doesn't... Oh, wait, it's still... He's still showing up on the mini... Or is he gonna give me some money since I saved his life? Maybe. Let's go talk to him. Let's go talk to him. I never wanted to be here in the first place. Uh, I can't greet. I can antagonize him. I don't want to do that. Why is he still showing up? Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Don't let me keep you. Hey, where's my money? Poke the bear. <laughs> I don't know about that, Judo. This may not be the best idea I've ever heard up in here in these bars around here. We're all weirdos. <laughs> Poking them bears up in here. Bunch of weirdos up in here, man. They might go sideways on you. <laughs> Coming down. Yeah, I got I to gotta watch a machine that plays death metal music up in here. And it's like, what are you talking about? I think you're going sideways, fella. Oh, you fuckers. Alright, Let me introduce myself back. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I was watching a video, a uh, historian talking about this game, and she was talking about how. Oh, fuck, he got me. Weirds are redeemed made for Chudos. <laughs> Uh, that's all right. We're going to respawn. Um, she was talking about how it was similar to the movie The Patriot, where people would make bullet heads out of, like, uh... You are all who would melt down and stuff. <laughs> Shit. Where was I at? We just... We, gotta, we have to start the whole game over right now. I just lost. That's it. No, we aren't starting the whole game over. I'm being stupid and silly. Um, I did lose that loot from those guys that I killed before they got me. Son of a bitch. But uh, the, anyways, the historian, she was talking about how people did make like bullet heads out of uh, just stuff. So that uh, sometimes it wasn't ideal metals and stuff like that so yeah there was it is somewhat realistic like shoot somebody in this game and it doesn't do a lot of damage depending on what they're using but you know in this game you get the high velocity rounds you make the split point head bullets too late restart it Rav I know uh, the whole game from the beginning including the four hour intro to get to the open world part Actually, what time? You know, it's. I gotta, I gotta take a break real quick. <laughs> um, yeah, I'll be back in. Give me a few minutes here. Let me restart the whole game. The whole game here. No, oh, we got some entertainment in the meantime. Outer space. Yeah, I'll be right back, folks. Some tunes from Bill Kiley. Be right back.
you like the tunes? Yes, thank you, thank you. When somebody actually told me that this BRB scream is like their favorite they've seen on Twitch, just, ow, that's pretty. That's high praise right there. Uh, and I have been wanting to make another Be Right Back video. I think this game would be great to have, like, maybe just show different parts of the map, and then just stand there and record it and let the time lapse, and then throw in some ambient music from this game, and uh, maybe speed up the time in the videos. Who goes there? It's me, Arthur. Hope you had a good old time while I've been stuck standing here. Shut up, Williamson. That guy's name is Bill Williamson. So, bitch. All right, back to doing chores. <laughs> it's the horse. Morning, Arthur. Morning, Lenny. Shoot him. He's our buddy. At least for now. No. <laughs> So I've never played Red Dead Redemption. Oh, that chicken. Uh, this is a prequel to Red Dead Redemption. Ultimate War Machine. Hello! Welcome on in. Victor the Impaler. Amazing velvet smooth voice over Red Dead 2. Doesn't get much better. Aw, oh, thanks, Victor. And that's just kind of you to say. Very kind of you. I'm rare old room. Uh, <laughs> Ultimate more Mac. Welcome on in. Hope you're well. Hope everyone's doing well. It's good to see all of you. Um, it always makes me happy that you all uh, like to hang out. Whether it's just have me on in the background or whatever, I appreciate it. All right. Let's see. We're gonna upgrade some shite here. First, we're gonna restock our ammo. Okay, that was twelve dollars there. Uh, Dutch wants. Let's do fresh fruit, basic canned goods. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. If I'm happy, you happy. Nice. <laughs> I appreciate that, buddy. Quality and quantity of food available in the pantry is increased. Now resupply it. Uh. I mean, we're going to end up upgrading everything, so might as well. It's just going to make Valentine info into a hellhole real quick. <laughs> yeah. We'll get there. Alright, let's con contribute some monies. Give some items first. What do we have? What do we have? We have five platinum pocket watches worth twelve dollars pop. Donate a few of these. We're gonna donate a few silver emblem rings. And a couple of these gold pocket watches. Actually let's bring everything down to two. So contribute a silver silver clamp. Buckle, a gold plate buckle. $69 worth of items. Now let's contribute a little bit of money, a little bit of money. Uh, give money. Let's do about 30 bucks. Get it close to 100. 35, that's fine. Alright. Okay, let's go do some chores here. Uh, get our stats up. We need, yeah, and chop some broccoli. I mean, chop some woods. Woods. Come on, Arthur, put your back into it. 
<laughs> you only got six pieces of wood to display. They're good. BRB, uh. Comp mode in Overwatch 2. You're waking up late. Let's go. Yeah, go get them, Choodles. Get them in that Overwatch. Bill's been playing some Overwatch. Definitely, uh, you know, just like any other game, you keep playing it, keep improving. As long as you're having fun. That's what it's all about. Alright. Uh, what else we got going on up over here? I'm gonna talk to Pearson real quick. Morning, Arthur. Morning. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Everything okay? I guess. Bored. Well, we need to get you out on another job again soon. Yep. All right then. Bring me what can we? As soon as you can, Arthur. Donate. Yeah, I hear you. Uh, I will donate some animal fat. Many thanks. Let's donate it all because we get animal fat from a lot of stuff. We'll donate some big game meat. Uh, that's good for now. Thank you, Arthur. You're welcome. Crafting upgrades. What do Arthur, you got? Don't forget, I'm more than happy to craft you something if you bring me the right materials. Satchel, so, oh, perfect deer, okay, he needs perfect pelts. Deer pelt, bison pelt, raccoon, panther, elk, beaver, rabbit. Oh, damn. Perfect alligator skin, ram carcass, cougar pelt, boar pelt. A lot of stuff here. Well, what's John's lodging need? Four perfect, perfect boar pelts. Two perfect pronghorn hides. One perfect pronghorn carcass. Moose antler. Wolf carcass. Perfect snake skin. So to get a perfect skin, you need to kill the animals with a, the right weapon. Okay. Thank okay. you, Mr. Pearson. Thank you, Mr. Pearson. All right. Folks seem really happy now. Sure. This. Sure. This is everything. The whole world is in a smile, Arthur. <laughs> Remember that. Remember that. The whole world's in a smile. According to you. <laughs> Mr. Morgan. Oh, yes, yes. Can I ask you a favor? It, if it's convenient, I mean. Sure. What do you got? If you're out on your adventures and you see any herbs for seasoning, would you mind grabbing them for me? Season? Seasoning? <laughs> yes. Don't tell Mr. Pearson. <laughs> okay. I'll see what I can do. I think I have some herbs to give you there, Susan Grimshaw. So I, I mentioned it earlier. Okay, I'll catch you later then. Sure. Okay, give request. Here's those herbs you asked for. Those herbs. Ah, excellent, thank you. A little wacky tobacco. Pearson's pot when he's not looking. We'll slip them into Mr. Pearson's pot when he's Morgan not looking. Arthur. My goodness. Return your tent for a reward. Later, it said. There she is. Hang in there. We're on the up. I know. I'm fine. I know things have been hard. All right, Arthur. All right. Do some more chores. I know it's not the most exciting, but... I'm going to get them stats up. Plus, we got to deliver this maze. Give it to Pearson. Because he's focused on prepping dinner right now, and uh, I'll just help him out with the ingredients for right now. Things right there. 
Is he wearing Civil War pants? I wonder. What's going on? X2. Roots in Tootin Cowboy Saclutin. Yes, indeed. Root and Tootin Sack Cowboy Saclutin. X2. Thank you for the sub. Look at that. 12 months, one year already. Can you believe it? Howdy there. See the cute kitty cat in the box. <sighs> <laughs> Thanks for the sub, X. Good to see you, buddy. Oh, here's where everyone needs locked up. The face was as red as a lobster. I fell and broke my poor knobs. <laughs> this guy's hammered. Watch was Good to see you, X, buddy. What? I never get drunk no more. I don't think it's very fair. I'm resolved to try it. And mighty and above everyone that you think you are. Whatever you say. Chaos at the camp. He pretty well does. Of course. Of course he does. What exactly are we talking about? God, Dang this day it. is already a pain in my Damn mind. all you! You ain't so smart! You little trollop. Trollops! Whoa. Uh, X2, I hope you're going... Going well. Going good. Hope you're going place. No, I hope you're doing well. Uh, it's good to see you, my friend. Reverend's still hammered. Singing. Look at him. He's stumbling over there behind the tent. How you doing, buddy? Did you have a good weekend? Did you have a good holiday? Morning to you. And good morning. How are things? I got the Lord and others on my side. Uh, yeah. It is Sunday. If it ain't one thing, it's another. What do you mean there? There he is. You're good. Weekend was eventful. Need video right games here. to distract. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm doing right now. Let's see. Got to do a lot of action. Oh, I got into a lot of action. I robbed a dead frozen couple. <laughs> Watch an old guy breathe in a river. Yes. That was pretty. He was a little crazy, that guy in the river. I mean, did say it was a mad, uh, the mad preacher. Hi. Hi. <laughs> uh, but yeah, and then we've also, we've done, oh, and in the game, I've been pretty chill, though. That was, uh, today before I started playing the game, I got, I robbed a dead frozen couple and watched an old guy bathe in the river. And then I hit go live uh, about an hour after that. Easy. We're just gonna pour the water in between the barrels right there. Close enough. <laughs> He's talking about sharks on the when he was in the navy. Sharks. That's a holiday. Arthur, two splashes mark. Arriving in a new city. Hi. Both your parents newly dead. No one looking after you except some scumbags you meet on the street. Folks starving, people desperate. <sighs> how old were you? Nine. I always so love how you... Old, I've been living on my wits. <laughs> you learn a lot about the characters first. See that. Uh, Just from them talking in camp and yeah. stuff. Yes. I tell you, sharks are nothing compared to human beings. Well, now, maybe you're right. 
I guess all life is brutal in its own. Is that way. Mr. Marston? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah, it's John, all, just a miserable waste of time. Appalling. Yes, it is. Man, I I want to play the first Red Dead Redemption. I think it'd be awesome if they made a remake that would turn out well. Unlike the Grand Theft Auto remakes they came out with earlier this year. Know what I mean? Know what I mean? There's a little, little Jack. Hey. All right. I'm hungry this morning. You're hungry. You're a good kid. You're a good kid. Thanks, Uncle Arthur. <laughs> All right. Um. What is this? It's poppycock. Provisions over there. <clears throat> All right. So yeah, that's. Mr. Morgan, oh. you saved my life, and I'm. Well, I'm very grateful. Don't mention it, Reverend. I, I made a fool of myself. Oh, yes, you did. We've all done it. I just, I just, I get so confused and, and angry, and then I, I hear God laughing at me, and I get even angrier. And, well, I'm a real prized dolt. I know it. Don't be sorry on yourself. Well. Well. <laughs> All right, so we're going to go finish. Uh, we have two more gunslingers to go visit for that guy who's trying to write the book. Uh, happens to the best of us. Now, got to go, Reverend. We'll see you later. Uh, you weirdo. Now, we, we picked up his Bible and looked inside it, and uh, it was carved out and had uh, some type of... Syringe and drugs in it. So he's, uh, he's a little. Reverend's, uh, not doing so good. He's, he's got some problems. You are all weirdos! <laughs> uh, yes, Julius. We're all weirdos here, yep. but the good kind. Two wins and com comp under the belt. Going for three, hell yeah! Go Chudozy! You think you never found a single gunslinger in Red Art? Oh, really? Calm down, will you? Calm down, will you? Yeah, well, it is like a side mission next to you, so it's possible you. Did story missions in the meantime and whoa they're shooting maybe you did some story missions that made it so you couldn't do the gunslinger thing anymore D oh did I get the bottom of the artifacting issue yeah what I, what I did and uh, it's kind of an obvious fix in hindsight but uh, 16 bit and pointed out and he's like hey if you're only broadcasting in 720p maybe make your screen resolution to 720p and ever since i did that um seems to have no problems oh so, yeah i think we got her got her fingered out uh Dude here, corner. You didn't know that was possible, but that would explain it. Yeah, well, and it was weird, too, because the week prior to that, there was no problems at all. Going from bigger to smaller res can introduce compression to artifacts like 16 was saying. Oh, come on! Let me out of here! Ugh. All right, we're going to free this prisoner because uh, right before we killed please, these guys, we heard please, her say that, you. you know, he was beating on me and stuff. So it sounds like uh, maybe she... Somebody had a... Had something coming to him, and she uh, delivered justice. And... 
Thank God for that. I have no money to repay you, but I do have some information that might suit your skill set. My husband, may he rot. This town ain't big good enough for the boss of us. Doom, 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 doom. What up, Game Pro? It's a gathering place for low lives. Interesting. Thank you. Really. What up, Game Pro? Good to see you, buddy. Sure, sure, but you got a high tail. Trust me. Good to see you, Game Pro. Hope you're well, my friend. I've been wanting. Where'd you find that beard? Yeah. What up, Von Beardley? Look at this nerd. I know. There, girl. Uh, Shaw, Shaw, yo, Shaw, Shaw, Game Pro. How the hell are you? Good to see you, my friend. You're uh, you've had a good weekend. Oh, we just ran over something. I'm barely hope you're well, buddy. What's cracking? I wanted to play this story mode again. I haven't played it in a while, and one of my favorite games ever. Well, that's what we're doing. Um, and then, yeah. Had a nice Thanksgiving. Let's go, girl. You got terrible sleep today, yeah. Bon. That sucks. Oh, no. The law of sauce. You move one more time, I'll drop you. Don't let me Shit. Sorry to hear that, Vaughn. See, let's see if we can lose them in the trees a little bit. If we can't, then we'll retaliate against the cops here. But, uh... Oh, great. There's no cover here. This is right on the beach. We are getting out of their range, though. Yep. Oh shit! We tried to jump the ramp, the skateboard just <laughs> went out from under our feet. Girl. Sorry. Sorry there, girl. Shit, someone else needs help? What the hell is going on? I believe I can fly. You'll be sorry. I believe I can touch yeah, the sky. What the hell's going on over here? <laughs> Chaos. Outside the restaurant is on the stakeout. Order the food for takeout. Chaos outside the Spark Steakhouse. Oh, who's that guy? Is he trying to rob the train? He's trying to shoot at me. I don't like that. Uh. What's going on over there? Ah, uh, yep. Not dead. Shit. Oh, hey. Trying to jump to the train. God damn it. Here, I'll catch up in chat in a sec. This, yep. I gotta get. <laughs> I'm gonna run to a rock if I don't pay attention to what's going on here. Uh. <laughs> oh, this is a train stop. That's why they stopped. Uh, who is this guy shooting at me? Did I accidentally shoot at him or something prior? I was just a guard. But yeah, I must have done something to screw with him. Yeah, let's get out of here. We don't need to deal with this. I want it again? Come on. All right, let me go. Let me go hide in the behind some trees and read chat here. Oh. 
Let's see. Or let world leans on you. Somebody else needs help. Kill him. Big shot. Well, you weren't gonna rob the stream, but since you shot at me. <laughs> How high do we want our bounty to go, though? Uh, can we lose him? A show of hope for. Yeah. It is good to see all of you. All of us here, uh, Rev. Well, let's try and lose it through the trees a little bit. What did I do? He's chasing at you. Oh, uh, what up, Geek Random? Good to see you, man. Still an Apache helicopter? Oh, where are those? Where's the military base there? <laughs> uh, I, well, something happened where there was a, a guard on a train shooting at me, and I, I thought I was a bad guy, and I killed him, and then I hopped on the train, and... The wanted level did not like that. He had a massive allergy attack this morning. You thought you were dying? Coughing, wheezing, and dripping nose? God damn. No idea what it was, but Benadryl and nose spray fixed it. I'm glad you're feeling better, geeks versus geeks. You ran over in my horse thief? No. I just I just run over people with horses. Uh, I'm trying to play this as uh <laughs> with like high honor, not not be an asshole. <laughs> but you know, these little towns, me too. Uh, I'm trying to get away from. I want my wanted level to go away. We're gonna go ride this way a little bit. Then we're gonna ride into town, go to the post office, pay off my bounty. And then. We'll do the uh, gunslinger side mission. Hey there, fella. Okay there? Pardon? Pardon? Better like you. Knows how to carry himself. He's like, whoa. All right, then. <laughs> Be good. Can you imagine just fishing and some guy walks up to you? Oh, there. Looks like you've been a fellow that knows how to take care of themselves. Like, what are you talking about, dude? I'm just trying to fish for some bass right now. <laughs> you weirdo. I'm just throwing out some cast masters and uh, reeling them in. What are you talking about? <laughs> let me let me fish, please, sir. Please stop bothering me. That stranger walks away with that swagger. <laughs> yeah. He's like whistling for his horse as he's leaving. You're like, who the hell was that guy? Let's see if we can uh, find any items while we're here. Uh, you always gotta check the chimneys. Oh, we got a cigarette card. Who's this? Lawrence Dunn. Millicent cigarettes. Some weirdo. What was that line again? Save a horse, ride a cowboy. <laughs> Something like that. I think it was something like that. <laughs> hmm. Let's take some of this canned corned beef and canned strawberries. I've never had canned strawberries, I don't think. Definitely have had canned corned beef. Corned beef and cabbage. 
That's right, there's Arthur Morgan. And your dear horse's ass whisper. Well, somebody. Something went down here. Might as well take these bread rolls. Uh huh. <laughs> uh, there's some kind of. Hmm, interesting. See, I think I have the reflection set on low quality, and that still looks really good. That's impressive. Yeah, oh, my rabbit. They don't mind if I make a mess or. Well, frankly, they're dead. Okay. You might as well loot it while we're there. Let's, uh... Yeah. Oh, wait. Actually, a body I didn't loot inside. I want to see. Beer, yoink. Yep. Saw some beer in there. We got... Oh, wait. Dead body's outside. happen here come on now uh loot letter to Annette from Claude was this Annette I did not want to write this letter I thought it had been clear at the stable and clear again when you waited for me outside the general Harriet was still inside. She still could have seen you. It's a miracle she did not. Now I know I made a promise to you, and I know the time we had was good. But Harriet is my wife. If she's willing to give me another chance, I need to give her and myself that opportunity. I cannot know you any longer. Please stop looking for me in town. Please stop leaving me packages at the post office. Please, for the love of God, uh, do not approach Harriet. I do care about you, but I cannot have you in my life anymore. Leave me and my family alone. Ah. Somebody was cheating on somebody. Harriet and Claude. And then something went south there. Oh shit, the went full gold. Uh, gold uh. <laughs> yeah, some shit went down there, man. I think Harriet came and was like. I don't know. There's some dispute between the married couple and Harriet uh, that resulted in. All three of them dying. Uh, are we still going to the post office? Yes. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me. <laughs> Sixty dollar bounty. That's like six hundred bucks nowadays with inflation. No, I don't know what it is. I know it's more than sixty dollars. Recess is over. It's all right, girl. Hello. Hello. Give me a nice little brush before we start this mission Let's here. Get you good. Let's get you looking good. <laughs> it's funny. Sometimes I'll say something just kind of like self-narrating, and Arthur will st say a similar phrase. Uh, I want to go pay my, see if I can pay my bounty before I start this, uh, Billy Midnight mission. How do you do, sir? I am doing well, sir. How are you, sir? Don't rush me. I'll get to you. Don't rush me. I'll get to you. Okay. Uh, let me check this guy on the other side of the counter. 
What about this guy over With here? You in a moment. With me in a moment? Okay, let me see what's this other guy on the counter. Is he is this side faster? Hold on, I'll be right there. Hold on. Well hurry up. Hmm. We've got to stop meeting like this. <laughs> we gotta stop meeting like this. <laughs> oh shit, I got a twenty dollar bounty in New Hanover as well. Damn. All right, let's pay this shit Very off. Very good. I'll put the word out in Lemoyne. Okay, okay, you put that word out. Let's, uh, let me ask you about Billy Midnight. Hey, you there. A quick word. What can I do for you, sir? There's an old gunslinger I'm looking for. I heard he comes through here. Name of Midnight, Billy. Oh, that old soak? Yeah, he spends days on board these trains, but he's going nowhere but the gutter. I imagine you'll find him right in the next one through here. Either that or the next one. Try them both. Look in the bar car. Look in the bar car? Okay. Wait for the train to stop. Got it. Train's coming in. How do you do? I'm doing fine, fella. $60.19 is... Oh, did you just Google that? X? $60.1913 is about $1,820 for inflation. Cut. God damn. That's a lot. Right, 1899, but consumer price index only goes back to 19, 1913. Okay. Probably actually worth more back then, eh? Hey? Son of a gun. Well, I'll be. <laughs> All right, let's see what's going on up in here. Um, I guess we just talk to folk, talk to some folks. Stranger. Trains are moving, folks. All aboard. The trains are moving. You know what that means. Like uh, some of you know what that means. <laughs> I think that knows some of you up here. I don't know what that means. Here comes the train. Ah. Oh, wait, and then, uh, <laughs> last but not least, <laughs> uh, here it is. This is the one you're waiting for. Your girlfriend's dancing nice. <laughs> Dude, that still cracks me up how Gibson was saying ever since watching that and he even posted a video on his Discord of his son running <laughs> going kyon, kyon. <laughs> That is so funny. Kyon, kyon. <laughs> Oh, it's so good. Mr. Midnight? <laughs> Excuse me, I'm trying to drink. <laughs> Mr. Midnight, listen, this won't take a moment. Oh, I just my want to talk with you about your old days as a shooter. <laughs> <laughs> hey. I didn't shoot him in his sleep. No one's I saying it. I didn't shoot him in his sleep, and if I did, it was the only way. Not a problem. <laughs> I'm hearing about Jim Boy Calloway, and no one shot Ooh. him yet. I knew you'd come for me. Get away from me! Uh oh. Mr. Midnight! Oh, shit. Uh. Yeah, that's so. Here's me running going, kill, kill, kill. Let me jump you like, kill. I knew you'd come for me! It was my fault! I knew! Now, you don't know nothing, Mr. Midnight! 
I just want a quote for the book. Do something foolish. You come for me. Oh, he wants to draw. Oh, son of a bitch. Arthur while chasing and doing on train. Chugga 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 chugga. Uh, retry checkpoint. Let's do that. Since, I don't know. Oh, here we go. Here we go. I was just going to say. Light him up, Arthur. Fuck him up. Uh, yeah, because it happens so fast, I usually don't see... Gold plate engravings, black wood engrave. Uh, I like Flacco's gun better. Dad God, <laughs> gunslinger's pretty spry. <laughs> oh, that's funny. You're funny, my friend. All right, we'll get a picture of this. Dead guy. Alright, mission complete. He was pretty spry for, uh... Alright, shit. Uh, oh, our horse is still running along. Yeah! Ow! My leg! You off to work, Von Beardley? Alright, my friend, Von. I hope work goes smooth for you, buddy. Here. Um, yeah, take care of Vaughn. Oh, Hopefully work's going to be a little more chill because Thanksgiving just happened and be a little slower, perhaps. But it's always good to see you, my friend. Have a good, have a good night. Hope work goes smooth for you. See, that looked a lot cooler in Arthur's mind. Yes, it did. He was... He's like, dude, it's gonna be sick. I'm gonna jump onto my horse from the train. He just like fell and almost broke his leg. Whoops, I didn't actually mark that. Old black bale. She's the she's I'm saving the best gunslinger for the last. Black bell is awesome. And uh as with other aspects of this game, you can have different outcomes. But, uh... I don't want to really spoil anything. Yep. Uh... Shit. Bring it all. Oh wait, is this? Oh, you're fine. You're fine, dude. I r I remember riding through this area one time. I first played this, and I met this lady that wanted to race horses. <laughs> so my mind thought, oh, is that guy gonna want to race? But no. Oh wait. Whoa. That's another thing. The very first time you're playing through this game, a lot of these kind of random encounters that can happen, happen a lot. Not so much. Oh, you ain't gonna get nowhere with that hammer. Shut up. I know how to... What the... Why don't you mind your business and keep walking, huh? Don't have to tell me twice. We said get lost. Nay! All right, all right. Oh. It's a bowel movement. Whoa, it is a bowel movement. Run along now. <laughs> it is a bowel movement. It had to bounce off and hit me? You don't know what you're talking about. 
Let's see what happens. Sometime though. before I turned you old to spend it would be nice. I don't see you doing nothing except talking all manner of crap. Hey, I got the safe. And My I horse is over by those folks. I'm getting real sick of you right now. Yeah, oh, same for me. Twice more. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah! See? Well, look at that! I told you. Huh. Well, it took you long. Oh, to get they're opening up. Uh, oh, what do we got here? What kind mm, of yes, cast. sir. Oh, whiskey's on you. We told you once, damn it! Oh, they're pissed. Too damn close. That's the only gun I have on me. Hey, they started shooting first. They obviously stole something. Where'd the other guy go? Did he fuck off out of here? So. Alright. See that? Twenty five bucks? Wow. Well, Take a ride out of here. Yep. Giddy up. Whoa. Can't watch it. Slow it up. Slow it up. <laughs> yep. All right. Well, happens sometimes, you know. Oh, this horse is fast. Uh, let's see. You get a job blending in. Uh, a lot of ugly business here. You escape snowy mountains, high plains, wooded hills, canyonlands, and now swamp. Yeah, the swamp's yep. really good. They, they did a fantastic job with this game. Cough up payment. Uh, I'm done being kind. Last warning. Fine. Fine. I'm gonna surrender no and then pull out my gun. Move. You about to make a donation to the cause, brother? Hands up. Ah! Oh. Still another one alive. Okay, shit. All right, we got it. No biggie. Fools. Fools. That's what they are. <laughs> Try it. <laughs> See, a lot of this shit happens a lot more near, like. First playthrough, new to an area. When you've been, when you finish the whole game right around, Th they'll still happen, but not as often and as frequent. I've noticed. Come on, girl. Come on, girl. And then, uh, yeah, Arthur, the guy who does the acting for Arthur, had to redo voice for Arthur talking to the horses I remember seeing an interview where uh, he was talking about the rock star called him up and they're like we're gonna have to redo the oh boy <laughs> we're gonna have to redo your your lines talking with the horse he's like well why I mean we already did him they're like, yeah, after going back listening to him, they seem a little too suggestive sometimes. And he said, Lee, you listen to him, he's like, come on now, girl. And he's like, yeah, yeah, we should be sure. <laughs> well, B, it's Indy Capo. That's right. <laughs> but 
but I remember yeah. thinking that was funny. <laughs> there you go, girl. <laughs> and he's like, whoa, yeah, yeah, maybe we should re-record those lines. <laughs> Getting close to Black Bales. Maybe I should go ahead and maybe I should run ads because I take a break like almost every hour, hour and a half. I don't know. See, that's why I do pre rolls is because I figured. Someone just hit, gets ads right at the beginning, and then that's it. No more ads. Why oh, I stick with pre-rolls? And look how good the lighting and everything in this game is. Let's take a moment. Take a moment to appreciate it. There you go, horsey. Hey, watch it. Oh, I saw a video. You can actually, it'll take a number of shots, but you can shoot out the wooden wooden wheels on. Uh, Let's go, girl. <laughs> the fuck are the <laughs> The wagon, they're called wagons. I checked. I checked. They're called wagons. You can shoot out the wheels on the wagons. Judos, yes, they're all widows. We are all widows. But I would have it in no other way. Could you imagine if everyone here was quote unquote normal? But see, that's the thing too. Is what is normal? It doesn't. I don't think it necessarily exists. Still sweating over there? Doing some Overwatch 2? Overwatch Choodles? Choodles Watch 2? I'm still riding right on the horse. Oh, he's pooping. Yeah. He was pooping and I started running and the horse was pooping and running. Um, that is, uh... Easy. You good? You're not a fan of Overwatch? It's fine. Okay, here's Black Bells. Okay, this whole event is really cool. I gotta... I gotta go pour myself another drink. Pour myself another drink. It's three o'clock in the morning in game. At Cane Break Runner. We're gonna pet the horse for twenty minutes. Pet the horse for twenty minutes, and then we'll start the mission. <laughs> no. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna make a be right back straight and just petting the horse for the whole time. <laughs> well done. Yeah. There we go. There's a stream that used to go out basically only played over that used to go out that basically only played Overwatch. You were there for the streamer and not the game. The game was meh. Yeah, hey, it's all good. Sorry, girl. I do have to say the little bit I've played of Overwatch 2, I like the first one better. I like the bigger teams, but you know. Easy girl. It's all good. It's all good. I don't give a darn toot and heck yeah, if someone likes it or doesn't like it. It's fine either way. It's fine either way. I'm gonna take a break. I'm gonna take five. Um I have to after the run of the restroom, grab a drink. So, uh, watch, uh,
lit some underwater. Count, <laughs> <laughs> count. Leave you with the old count train on the way out. We are back, folks. <laughs> It's a radio, it's not a radio. This is it. Fuck it. It is what it is. We'll propel you through any situation. between you and me. With all that I am and all that I've done, you're questioning whether I am ready for what I'm about to do. Man, you're really not even close to where you need to be. System I'm playing this on. I'm playing this on PC. Kitsarito, it's nice to see you. Uh, Kitsarito, redeem. Tell Arnold to say, "Much camp could a camp train camp have a camp could train camp camp camps." 
How much? How much camp? Much <laughs> Was that was that okay? Uh you came in a good time, get some video. It's good to see you. Hey, You're doing excellent. Awesome. So Oh, kids, you came in a great time. There's the guy we met who's writing a, a book on some famous gunslinger. And he gave us photographs of four different gunslingers that he wants Arthur to talk to to get, like, a quote regarding this other gunslinger that was famous. And we've already, uh, we came across the first three and they ended up Thinking we were trying to kill them, they, we did a little showdown, shootout with them. And this is the last one, Black Bell. She's she's a really cool character. And uh, I'm just going to get rid of that marker. Uh, this is my favorite out of the four gunslingers. But yeah, Kitsurito, pleasure to see you. Pleasure to see you, everybody. And yeah, this is this is one of my favorite parts of the game, actually. You there? Oh, hello. You a bounty hunter? Well, not right now, I ain't. You Black Bell? I'd like to talk to you about your Wild West days. I don't care much for reminiscing. You got any friends as bounty hunters? None that spring to mind. Well, then you done led them boys here, and you none the wiser. Ah, those bounty hunters. Oops. Knew my luck had run out sooner or sooner. Get yes. inside. I'll tell him you're gone. Oh, no, no. Those guys aren't I ain't our friends. Them scalp hunters. Not running from them neither. That's you're right. Fighting? She's a badass. Yeah, just me against Sam. <laughs> That'd be a waste of time and nitroglycerin. Well, let me know what I can do. You want that Wild West story, don't you? Yes, I do. All right. Get up here quick. Now, when I give you the word, hit that. Whole place is wired. Black Bell, I got a Whole contract here wired. for your life or your liberty. We'd sooner it be liberty. That's mighty reasonable, mister. Come here, let me take a look at it. Come on. Mm -hmm. oh, come on. All right, we're going to detonate like now. Oh, ah. There goes your contract. Watch some new me play this makes you want to play it again. Need a break from satisfactory. Oh wait, I don't want to shoot the horrors. Take some tobacco here. Lady, I can't see you much in need of my help. She got him. She's a good shot. Oh, there's a bunch more over here. Oh, jeez, we got machine guns. Got him. Nice. Oh, yeah. Saying these are my friends. Oh, that gun's shooting the fucking railing. Yeah, stop playing Sass Factory. It's too much of a night. Dopamine IV drip. When all this is done. Woo! <laughs> is that the last of them? Yeah. You got them scalp hunters off your back. Uh, for now. For now. For now. So, you gonna tell me about your Wild West days? Running with Jim Boy Calloway? Little Boy Calloway? <laughs> the only running he did was away from a fight. And that's about the end of it. 
Well, the man's apparently a famous gunslinger. Yeah, so they say. But, uh, don't get what's famous confused with what's true. Mm -hmm. The ones of us that lived that life, we was too busy being scared for our scalp to talk to no newspaper writers or dime no. novel men. Well, what were they like then? Those days they all talk about. <sighs> Same as now, I guess. Only longer ago. <laughs> all right. I'm gonna need your picture, too, if it ain't a trouble. No, sir, no trouble at all. Can't be worse than those awful drawings on the wanted posters. <laughs> oh, great. Well, you stand over there and... Oh, let me get this thing ready. Uh, ready? How do you want me? Like this? Oh, <clears throat> let's see. Let's get a shot right there. Uh take a photo. Okay. I got it. Man, I guess they'll be on Show the way. Some ankle. <laughs> <laughs> well thank you, Mrs. Bell. You that is a be beautiful right? shot, oh, madam. Been running for twenty years. Suppose I'll be running till I drop. I don't know, Game Pro Just showing ankle. The way it is. Might be against TOS on Twitch. <laughs> <laughs> Might be a little too spicy for Twitch. Sarenko, my goodness. Takes me so man so boy. Seems a little too risque, yes, I agree. Keep random. As long as she has shoes on, it's okay. Just some ankle. <laughs> Oh, uh, y'all are funny. That is hilarious. <laughs> you show them legs, you just be better wearing some shoes. And don't show the ankles. <laughs> you folks. You make me laugh. <laughs> See, that's the one thing I love about that mission with uh, Black Bell, because she's a badass and, like, gets ambushed. Other bounty hunters and you like team up with her. Oh, she just seems like a really cool character. <laughs> like, uh, that's one of the things about this game, too. A lot of the characters you meet them and you, f you have a feeling like they have their own history already. Um, uh, just done really well, I gotta say. We get some biscuits here. We're gonna, we'll see what else we get and find this cabin. Ooh, there's a card on the table. There's, uh, is that moonshine over there? There's a chest. What do we got here? Cigarette card. Who's this? Emmett Granger. We just killed that fucker. That was the guy in the, uh, the pig farmer where he, where he put dynamite in the pig poop bin. Because he was being a super asshole. That's that's that guy. <laughs> that's the guy we just saw like a couple of hours ago. Yeah. Oh, that was one thing we did. Uh, we came across Emmett Granger, and we just wanted a quote from him talking about the gunslinger, the the one guy is writing a book about, and. Well, Emma Granger was talking about how much of a badass he was and saying we, they should write a book about him and he was being a super asshole. And so Arthur just threw a stick of, put a stick of dynamite in the pig shit bin and, uh, old Emma Granger had a, a dirty shower. Let's see, could I have shot the knife? Shot the knife instead of killing him. Probably. Maybe. I don't know, because it goes to the... It goes to the old... Uh, the quick draw thing, where you have to hold down... 
the mouse button for like the showdown. So maybe not. Maybe if I had a good, oh, you know, if I aim towards the knife, my guess is no, but it is quite possible. Loot this guy up in the, the wagon here. Yeah. Look at that machine gun. God damn. Snapping turtle here. All right. Um, what do we have that can refill? Did I candy? Put the Gatling gun on my po in my pocket. It might fit in the satchel. <laughs> I mean, I already have about twenty birds and uh, all kinds of other things in my satchel. Oh, never know. <laughs> One more dead guy I didn't loot. Where is he? This guy? No. It's alright. We can get out of here. Wouldn't that be cool if you could... <laughs> Well, it'd be pretty unrealistic. Not that this game is hyper-realistic, but you could carry it around a Gatling gun on your horse. Come on, girl. Come on, girl. All right. Uh, so that side quest is done. Oh. Shit, look at all the dead bodies over here. There's a lot more loot up in here. You can disarm the knife. Oh, shit. That's cool. I didn't know that. Realism in the video game is breaking your immersion. Uh, <laughs> yeah, your uh, fr for forward flip. Uh, <laughs> well, really that was pretty good. Why, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm serious. Stop whining. Hell, man. It drives me nuts. Oh, shit. Who gives a <laughs> fucking shit? How long Stop it! it. <laughs> That's funny. So you can shoot his knife out, but then he draws another knife. Interesting. Gives a fucking shit how long a scene is. And then he charges at you. Okay. Yeah, that was a good flip there. Thank you. Excellent. Glad you enjoyed that. I know. We're going to at least loot these bodies over here, and then we'll get going. <laughs> they force you to kill him in that? Yeah. I kind of figured, but I did not know you could shoot his knife out. And it's cool that they thought of that, you know. Does a New York reload with a knife? <laughs> That's wild. That's really cool. And I've seen uh, there's certain, like, just very small cutscenes that'll pop up in this game depending on. Like, f one example was a mission where you escape from an area. Uh, it's got two different cutscenes, whether you're escaping on a horse or escaping by foot. So, you know, just little things like that. So many little details. Yes, yeah, sex. Indeed. It's pretty amazing. All right, well, we definitely have opened up this part of the map here. Let's go head back to camp. I'm going to head back to camp, and then we'll start hitting uh, some of these other story missions. But I kind of want to get head back to camp, get, get everything straight. And we can do the old autopilot here. Oh, son of a bitch. <laughs> Sorry, horse. 
Burst health is uh, okay. <laughs> I don't do that too often. Uh, such grace. <laughs> Oh my god, that was funny. <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh jeez. <laughs> hey, you're okay, girl. There, girl. Okay, girl. Hey, over here! Over here! Someone needs help. Uh wrong button. So you wish they would here. put more more in the Red Dead Online? Please. Yeah, GTA is the money maker. This is crazy. Just shoot the shackles. One bullet. That's all. Everyone deserves a second chance. Come on. Please. Well, okay. Stand still. Stand still. Come on now. There you go. Oh. oh, thank God. Oh, well, I waited to hear that noise for so long. Yeah, I bet. I, I wish I could give you some money or, well, you know, I might have something of interest. Oh yeah. You know Ansberg? Well, some la di da rich folks bought up a little cabin up north of there, very remote. You get me? Mm. You sure I'm the right person for this sort of information? I ain't saying nothing. Do with it what you will. Something tells you you didn't see Arthur on his horse now. Five minutes ago. <laughs> yep. 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 Yeah. So, besides missions, I still have, Back like... <laughs> There's still of uh, treasure maps. Thank you, Kitsu. Yep. Still have treasure maps. We got uh, places we can go rob. I will do some of that. I still have to go. I still have to cra craft some, cook some stuff at camp as well. See where are we at? Uh, we got a decent ways to go. Yep, we'll still uh, maintain autopilot here. Although with autopilot, like if some other people are riding horses coming towards you, if you have two of them side by side, sometimes you'll collide into them. <laughs> Do a front flip off the horse. Just try saying that in messages. Game Pro, what do you think about these figures? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> you like them or you don't like them? Yep. <laughs> you think they're worth a lot or not very... Or are they just more of a collectible as a hobby? Yep. Every, every answer. <laughs> yep. Uh, you're fired. Yep. <laughs> well, pardon me, sir. I don't like your energy. Yep. <laughs> really think you should work on it. Yep. Perhaps if you, uh, we're kind of, we could collaborate to something. Yep. <laughs> oh, jeez. I guess I should say, yep. <laughs> and head back to camp. Yep. Yeah, you're all weirdos. <laughs> yeah. 
That's one thing I was going to say earlier about the uh, benefits of doing autopilot with the horse. When its course, its core energy core runs down to zero, it won't. It'll still keep going full speed. As long as you're in the cinematic mode in autopilot. Once you switch out of it, it'll start draining more. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yep. Say we're almost camp? Yes or no? Yeah. I'm coming in. Yeah. Look who's back. Yeah. Feel the way horses sound when they move. Oh, I know. Especially the trotting right there. Trotting sound. It is very relaxing, Kitsu. Wait, 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 wait. It's like the old Western version of... What's that? <laughs> it's the horse. Good morning. Morning. Morning, Kieran. Oh, Driscoll. Oh, Driscoll. You did save my life. We're still going to call him O'Driscoll, though. Brush the horse. No pat. That's it. Don't worry. I ain't gonna kill you. Oh, well, good. <laughs> yeah, the camps. I know. <sighs> Camp's some of my favorite spots. Because of all the character development. <clears throat> Doing chores can be kind of boring, but... With all the stories, characters are telling each other and stuff. There you go, girl. <laughs> Arthur! Yeah? Huh. How are you... What? Listen. We're gonna be okay. If you say so, what about the money? Back at Blackwater. Sorry to not work. Right. Look forward to coming Let's back to then. camp because of chores. I hear you. Not you again. Hey. Where's my money? Where is it? Uh, what? What, what? What do you mean? Uh, I'm just joking. Uh, I'm just yeah, fucking with you, here. <laughs> I love how he does that. The chores, though, you think it's cool how horses seem like they were meant to be ridden. Yes. Well, the thing with the uh, the chores, they are tedious. And although they do, you know, improve your stats. The thing I... I, I would just say the thing I enjoy about the chores is they do... Such a good job of the characters, like, interacting with each other and interacting with us, uh, even a lot more character background. It's kind of an organic way to do it. And, I mean, of course, you don't have to do the chores. They are, it's a bit long, though. Especially, well, later in the game, there's one place you can do a bunch more chores. And it takes, seriously, if you do all the chores, it'll take like 20 minutes. 
Uh, so, yeah, I, I can relate to that, for sure. You know how they fit the crafting their narrative. But I'm the main ca Yeah, I hear that, too. It's like, we're doing a bunch of the chores, we're contributing the most money to the camp funds. And we're the ones going out doing the story stuff. All the missions. Uh, the only time any of you folks around this camp is when I'm part of the mission as well. You know, I, I see what you're saying. I, I'm picking up what you're putting down there. Yeah. I got some Next to some work around here. Or ghosty. Ah, oh, good. You're moving those. I took inventory on them just yesterday. Next to. Sorry. Careful. I saw mice on them earlier. Oh, hello. <laughs> oh, shit. I had to put the corn over here. Pearson's too lazy to take it five feet. <laughs> I'm gonna go chop some wood. Mm -hmm. uh, Javier go get washed. Go get wasted in Lemoyne. <laughs> well, and Lenny's Lenny's down to party too. Yep. <laughs> Lenny and I got hammered in Valentine. I got so hammered I thought every character in the game was Lenny for a minute there. <laughs> That's such a funny mission. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of cool. Yeah, that mission. Uh, we got so hammered, bro, dude. Story for the ages. <laughs> Think everyone remembers it? Definitely, that's one of the best in the game. Or the most memorable, at least. And it's nice they put it close, close at the beginning, too. Relatable, somewhat. <laughs> no, I don't want to donate. Sorry, what kind of... Uh, for you right now. I got nothing for you, Pearson. Give me some shit. Give me some cheese. What else we got? Biscuits. I'm full on those. I'll take a pear. I'll take... Uh, what else you got? What else you got open? Yeah. Apple. I'll take an apple. Take another apple. Another one. And another one. Uh, I think we're okay. Yeah. That's the thing, X2, is the... The nights where you could relate to the heavy... The, the big party night between Arthur and Lenny. Uh... I'm sure you remember remember they existed, but the details are very fuzzy. As far as what really happened. One of those nights your friends tell you. When you did that last night, that was so funny, and you're like I don't remember that. Murky details, yep. I told Dutch, I feel I should tell you. I saw some of Combs boys riding around. Some of Combs? Oh, here. What they want? What they I have no idea. Frisco. I don't think so. Okay. Well, thanks for letting me know, Kieran. Mm hmm. Good old Kieran. All right. I think, uh, are we done with chores here? I think, uh, I think we are. I think we are. Um,. Ooh, there's a white dot at my camp. What do we got here? A potent miracle tonic. I'll take that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Got the photograph. We got. We got sleep here. We already read that. We looked at that. Ah. Uh, so, so. What can you do? All right. Um. What? Oh shit. 
I still have chores to do. Come on, Arthur. Get your shit together. <laughs> no, we're fine. We gotta feed the horses. And then... <laughs> the exciting gameplay, ain't it? Uh... Got some missions we can do. We got some treasure chests. Some treasure maps we can try and find some treasure. And that's the thing, just by traveling around, searching for treasure via the maps we got, uh, we're going to run into more random counter type stuff. Goodness gracious. Uh, there's a lot that can go on here. We can go into town and play poker. He's the worst kind of fraud, Mr. Dutch. He's a rich dreamer playing at being one of us. How do you mean? He's on the talking about? with the lower classes. Who are you talking Without about? Laws, those unprotected by wealth. Said you something. too hard on him. Mr. He, Miller. He writes with incredible beauty. Yes, he's very ornamental, as my uncle would say. And your uncle, what was he? He was a slave. Most educated man in his country. They're talking about a writer, I think. A Lenny! Miller writes about men like him. Ah, Miller's a slave to, a slave to pretty words and empty phrases, but he don't understand. You are too harsh a critic. I love that. They're just talking Look, about a book. There. You're a great man, Mr. Dutch. An author. But you ain't great because of Evelyn Miller. <laughs> Keep quiet, Morgan. He'll eat you alive. <laughs> it ain't difficult. <laughs> it ain't difficult. I love that. There's so much character development in this game just from... What the people say at camp, talking to each other. And... I love it. I like it a lot. Uh, let's see. When we pour water in this barrel, most of it misses it. What, what about this trough here? I think this might be better. Oh, we... <laughs> Looks like we spilled a bit. <laughs> That's okay. We gonna go? Oh, we're gonna eat some stew. Hunger. Yes. Yes, oh, Miss Grimshaw. Thanks for all your efforts. You're very welcome. Hey, I know we don't say it much, but we appreciate it. Hey. We'll see you later. Yeah. <laughs> the. At least it wasn't milk. You don't have to cry over it that way. <laughs> oh, we just stew though. Look at that stew. Mm-hmm. That's tasty. We got a little bit of beef, potatoes, mushrooms, some kind of sauce. Mm-hmm. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes, yes. Uh, we can play poker. I don't really want to, though. What do you got mission-wise? <sighs> so we have missions. Uh, we can do also do some treasure hunting. Mr. Morgan. Reverend. I feel I made a bit of a fool of myself again. Well, perhaps. Uh, we've all done it. We've all done it. And you saved my life again. Uh, when they maybe one day you'll are they treacherous? Oh, my soul! <laughs> yeah, I'd like that. Don't make fun of me. Oh, I'm sorry. Anyway, it wasn't a complete waste of time. I stole this from one of those awful men. You should have it. Well, you give me. Well, thank you, but. You were blind drunk. I was drunk, Platinum but I never life. forget my manners. Be well, Mr. Morgan. When they toss the ball on the ground, you know it's good. That's right, Indy Cuba. How are you doing? Uh, did I finish the <laughs> debt collection? Yes, I did finish the debt collection 
missions. Reverend. <laughs> Tommy Lee Jones gives him a side eye. <laughs> Good old Tommy Lee Jones. See, your hair's a little bit of a fuss. Let's uh let's slick it back here. Yeah, it looks a little better. Um what if we We're gonna do that. A little funny, funny fake mustache for a little bit. Just a little hint of a mustache, and then as it grows in, uh, probably shave. I don't know. You can, it's funny, because you can let Arthur's hair grow really long and his beard grow really long, where he's running around like... Some kind of hippie or something. It's fun. Play some dominoes up in here. Yep. Uh, what else can we do? We're gonna go. We can go. Hold up. Hold up. Let's look at the journal here. The uh, documents. Documents. Treasure maps. See, we've got three treasure maps. I don't know where that is. Obviously, there's a rock with looks kind of like a face. Run by that tree, go past the tree, go there. Okay. You had a long beard using beard oil. Oh, nice. Yeah. <laughs> Well, and then I think there's something in the single player where you can make it so it grows faster, even. Yeah, that's paper, all right. Oh, you had a raccoon hat as well. Nice. You get all the buttons right here. Raccoon hat. Davy Arthur Crockett. Arthur Davy Crockett. Where are them other treasure maps open there? Chick's treasure map. Okay, so that one we got. Uh, this treasure map. Oh, I remember this one. You gotta, you have to climb up on those like spires a little bit on that side of the mountain. Yeah, that one we have not. Acquired. Not too bad. Nice. You didn't know there were treasure maps, Ghosty? Yeah, that's cool, man. Hi, Arthur. You probably <laughs> sure cool enough to rest your hands on your belt like that. <laughs> you, know. so, what do you, think it's gonna be like? you never did those? Is it just money? I think it is basically just money and the capo on those treasure finds. We'll go get, we'll go get one. We could just go ahead and looked up and smiled said bear down on your auger for I knew money and the friends we make along the way things went on and on or something for a week or ten days my auger machinery got to fire in some ways oh well now <laughs> yep I hear you hear you uncle something's kind of scary <laughs> So, I think what I know what's wrong with you, Arthur. What's wrong what with you? Mean? You're hanging around camp like a bad smell. You used to be a man of action. Well, fuck. Get mad at me if I'm hanging around camp. You get mad at me if I'm not donating. Them. 
What do you want from me? Song's kind of south, say. Dutch pushing them buttons. Yep. Thought we were friends. So, let's see. If we go east. I think that's towards. How you getting up? I think that's uh, towards the one treasure map. Whoa, with the spires. I think. Because... Oh, shit. It's funny because there's spots I recognize in this that I haven't been to in this playthrough yet. I'm like, oh yeah, there's that over there. We're supposed to go to... Haiti, Dutch. <laughs> yeah. It's always got a plan, doesn't it? Easy, girl. All right, girl. Good, girl. Are those the spires? I can't remember. It's a whole bitch. Look at the, uh... Easy look up, now. Bitch! Look at the... <laughs> maps here. Treasure maps here. Jack Hall game. Man. See, there's that spire. Uh, that's too steep to be... Well, you can see down here, there's a town. goes up to a big mountain and there's those two spires on those spires that's the spot where is that where is that Dutch put it away put it away I don't is that up there I think so maybe Well, shit. I don't think it is, though. Can we jump up here? Yeah! 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 Oh, no. Oh, oh, oh. Giddy up. Let's go this way a little bit. Get up. Oh, no! No, this isn't it. There's another spot where there's like two really tall, simple spires. Or, uh, yeah, this is not it. I'm like, yeah, this isn't it. Oh shit, I almost ran off there. <laughs> where the horse? The horse is down here. Come on, let's get. Wait, here. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Okay, so that's not where the treasure is. Uh, in short. That tree, though? Oh, yeah. You'll like this. Oh, wait. I hear gunshots. What's going on? What's going on over here? Oh, this is our... Okay, who likes to bet on who's the better gun shooter? Yep. I'll accept it. Okay, my friend. Let's do it. Just like the last time, okay? Who can shoot the most bottles? Just draw your gun and aim when you're ready. All right. Oh. Thank 
Perfecto. Mar At all, even though there's a bottle there. Give it. You just got lucky. If that makes you feel better, sure. Alright, we're gonna fill up on some uh, dead eye core. Oh, that was damn pathetic. Oh, how about another? Oh, another round. All right. Yep. Yep. Let me just uh, uh, have some chewing tobacco. Race stakes. Sure. Sure. Come on. Could win real big, huh? I'll accept your right, twenty let's dollars. Do it. Let's do it. Aha! Uh -huh. That's a good call, amigo. Just like before, mi amigo. You shoot four birds out of the sky before me, you win. Four Stand birds, near eh? me, and as soon as they come out, it's anyone's sh Be patient. Ah, there they go. Shoot! Good shooting, I guess. Ah, uh, here it is. Okay, man of my word. Yeah, I'll take your money. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Sure. <laughs> yeah, yep. Better watch out next time. You'll see. Next time, I doubt it. If we get a license for them birds, yeah. It's definitely was days before licenses. I know. This kind of seems like kind of a waste. Yeah. But so we're going to make sure we get the carcasses or at least skin them and get the meat and feathers, you know. Don't want it to go to waste. Yeah. <laughs> uh, come on, Arthur, jump! Arthur, jump! Come on, Arthur, jump! Oh, you bitch. Yeah. Cannot harvest all this animal. No space to tow them. We might be full on bird meat. Oh boy. I gotta tell you. Watch it, Arthur. Uh, <laughs> yup. Ran off the cliff, yo. Here you go again. Okay, he didn't turn himself there. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, this game's funny like that. Put this bird. Just, yeah, we don't want it to go to waste, you know? Even though it's just a video game. Shit, where should we go now? I guess we could go do a mission. We got Hosea. Hosea needs help with new business opportunity. Emerald Branch. Oh, I think that'll open up the fence where we can steal stagecoaches and man. Mary Linton. We loved ones and true. Requested me to help her. Strauss. Is it Thomas Downs to reclaim his debt? Micah. Dutch asked what that I get Micah out of the jail in Strawberry. And then we have Javier Escuela. That mission. Why is it not? A mission for Javier. Tons of stuff to craft. That's right. I can do that too. God damn. There's a lot to do. Newspaper up in here. General store up in here. We got fence over there, y'all. We're so close to camp. Uh... 
and I every I forgot the last few times I went to camp to craft and cook at camp. They might have the better better campfire with the old grill on it. Of course, pooping. Okay, so that's like a, that's a good sign. What is it? I'm gonna go grab another beverage and take a tiny little short break. Yeah, up in here. Uh, about five minute break. Do we want to watch outer? Sp we did outer space. And, uh, be right back, folks. I'll be right back in about five minutes. Five minutes. Uh, watch some secure oh shit. <laughs> Big fan. Can you hear me? Thank you. 
this point in the game, we can just go roam wherever. We can just go wherever we want. We can cruise the whole map right now. Who's that? But I think we'll do a mission. He gave a gift in three months of tier one ghost. Do you think the Any cable, what are you doing? Gonna kill us? Thank you, Betty. Perhaps. <laughs> That's very kind of you, man. Thank you for gifting. Hey, companion, aren't you? Mr. Morgan. I like to think so. Yeah. I'm getting better. Good. Well, that was very kind of you, Andy Capo. I'm just glad you're here. Glad you all here. Thank you so much, though. Appreciate it. Enjoy them emotes. Ghosty. Alright, we're gonna go do a mission here. Should we do one for Strauss? Mary? We could go meet Mary. Aseo. Or Hosea. Just came from that direction. Let's go see uh, Mary Linton here. Thanks, Indy Capo. That was very nice. Very kind of you. Let me go see Mary. Our old, uh, our old love. Let's see what, uh, see what she has to say. <laughs> oh, Macho Man sacrificed another hamster for the cause. Actually, Macho Man loses the match, really. Believe it or not. Talking about over here. Hey, real what you see what God just did to us, man. God did to that. You're a fucking narcotic team. I knew it. You would got this to do us, man. Can I get a few cents? Oh, this guy. Hey, buddy. Hello, mister. Hey, brother. Can I get a buck, mister? Yeah, I'll give you a dollar. Sure. Thank you. Oh, thank you, mister. Yep. Seems like he could use it one dollar a lot more than we could. See what the old Driscolls did to his man. <laughs> Evening. The old Driscolls didn't do that. You did it. You're a double agent. Fuck <laughs> sake, man. That's right, we can't even go do a bounty. Callaway. Alright, we're gonna go talk to Mary, then maybe do a bounty. Let's talk to Mary Linton. Whoa, 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 watch it. Any plants to pick? You're a fucking Pinkerton, I knew it. <laughs> 
<laughs> God's sake, man. <laughs> I'll blast you right through the wall. Don't make me explain things, shit. Yes? Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't Whoa. mean to disturb you, ma'am. Is Mrs. Linton in? I'll go see. Wow. Mrs. Linton? A caller for you. He's a little nervous. I can understand why. The old flame. Old lover. He's still in love. He's still Hello, got feelings Arthur. for her. I heard you and your friends was around. I. Okay. Where's um. Where's what's his name? Died. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, me too. Me too. Happened a while ago. Pneumonia. Bad business. Sure. So, uh. Well, you've been. <clears throat> you've been made a widow and. Come here looking for me, is that it? No, ain't like that, Arthur. Oh, okay. Well, Arthur was hoping. Listen, Arthur, I... I'm... My family. I need your help. You mean the family that always looked down on me? And you want me to help? It's my little brother, Jamie. <laughs> Jamie. I always liked Jamie. At least compared to the rest of them. Come on, Jamie. <laughs> He's broken Daddy's heart. Daddy has a heart. Don't make me beg you, Arthur. Money Whoa. Me. I wasn't good enough. I'm sorry. We need your help real bad. <laughs> Little Jamie's joined the Chelonians. In that cable, strange thank you religious so much, order. Good for him. They're quite mad, Arthur. They'll kill him. You're the only person he'd listen to. So... I'm too rough to marry into your family, but it's okay to ask me to help in saving your family. I'm sorry. I understand if you don't want to help me, but but I think of you often. A long time ago now. Thanks, Amy Gable. I'm begging you, Arthur. I say let Jamie live Jamie's life and not Jamie. the nightmare that his daddy dreamed up for him. Jamie's so innocent, Arthur. Please, Arthur. Will you help me? Yeah, we'll help her. Arthur, I've got something to show you. Really? Why? Why? Yeah, I'm not right. I'm right. I'm Where is it? Stop whining. Fuck name, Somewhere out it's near right Carmody nuts. Dell, I Who think. The rancher there shit. said he could see him around the Cumberland <laughs> Forest. I just want him back, Arthur. If you find him, bring him to me at the station. I'll see what I can do. I'll owe you. <laughs> you already owe me. Man. Kinda heavy. Don't show that ankle though, lady, cause uh someone's gonna report me for being too lewd on Twitch. <laughs> Fucking cares how long a, a game is. <laughs> I X D, that's funny. And the Copos seriously, bud. That's very kind of you for the if subs, thank you. Definitely not necessary. Where am I going? Where? Well, I guess that's the start of a new mission now. Because I see a different set of initials. Yeah, there's Jamie. No, that's Javier Escuela. Mayor Layton mission. To find the brother Jamie. Man needs your help bringing a brother Jamie from a cult called Colonia. 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 She can assist in the bath. Oh, come on, man. <laughs> oh, yeah. A little, little, little crazy over here. Open there. 
You ported this stream two hours ago and nothing has been done. I saw ankles. I saw a lady showing her ankle in this game. You borrow from the O'Driscoll boys. You, you pay the O'Driscoll Mobile boys. Oh, I've fucking O'Driscoll. Right you, I swear. Well, then. Fuck you. I guess you what you boys are. <laughs> this is own best, huh? Sorry, I killed your horrors, but you're in the way. Yeah. Fucking O'Driscoll's. Trying to the boys day. Yep. See them old Driscolls, I mean Where is the menace? Show sure no. <laughs> them old Driscolls, man, they got some They're they're not good people. Not good people. Speaking of not good people. There, girl. We got a bounty up in here. We can take. Let's talk to the sheriff. They have numbers. No oh, brains. That's right. All right, horsey. Give me a little, a little brushing, a little feeding. Foods here, smoke cakes, I think. Yep, it's classic oat cakes. Not just any oat cakes. Sheriff's office. If I ain't mistaken, you're looking for a bounty. Look no further than that wall, son. Look no further than that wall, son. Okay, what do we got over, over here? Oh, we can greet this guy. Howdy, partner. Good evening to you. That all? Yep. Yeah, yep. <laughs> what do we got here? The Terror of Valentine. $25 reward. Ellie and Swan. A reward of $25 will be paid for the arrests of Ellie Ann Swan wanted for the crime of ma matricide. The above amount will be paid immediately for the delivery of the prisoner, one alive for questioning. Known as the Black Widow, she has been seen in the Cumberland Falls area with an unknown male who may be manipulating her. All information or reward claims to be addressed to Sheriff C. Malloy. Valentine shares. Yep. That one? They say she's sleeping rough near Cumberland Falls. And what's more, they say she ain't sleeping alone. What's no. more? I got it. I got it. Okay, okay. We got enough crap around here from the livestock. <laughs> got enough crap around here from the livestock. I like that. That's a good line. <laughs> you don't have to remember that. Oh wait, uh, bounties this way. Take a look at the map right quick here, up in here. Um. Oh okay. Billy Swan's hanging out. Whoa! I meant. To, come on now. I, I want to put a marker, please. Yeah, yep. All right, let's go get, let's go get Ellie. Yep. Whoa, yep. whoa, whoa. Yep. Yeah. There we go. What am I running in circles? It looks like. Yep. I got some uh, peanut M and M's here. Neck on a little bit while we're running around. Yep. Yep. <laughs> Gotta hit the hay game pro. No worries, buddy. Thanks for the stream. Thanks for hanging out, buddy. Good to see you. Have a good one, y'all. Yep. 
Yeah, game bro. Good one, my friend. It's good to see you. Have a good week. Beginning of a new one. Trying to help. Appreciate ya. Yep. Oh, you're welcome. Yep. <laughs> No, it's been good time. Good times. Yeah. Uh, just getting some peanut M&Ms and play this cowboy game a little bit. Yep. Toodles. Welcome back. Hope that Overwatch 2 went well for you. Yeah, and my nails. Yeah, yep. I know they're my favorite. Still riding around. Riding around with all them holes up in the air. <laughs> they're your favorite too, Ghosty? I really like peanut butter MMs as well. Something special about that. Judos. <laughs> Make you giggle. <laughs> I made myself giggle too. I think, uh, I don't know. I think it's awesome that it makes other people giggle. Just me being a goofball. Judos, <laughs> I, uh, and for those of those of you who did not hear the story earlier, I'll read it in my Discord. You are all weirdos. <laughs> you are all weirdos. It's plenty fine, plenty fine. Um, I get to decorate my own little desk, computer counter, computer area, personalize it. So I brought a strand of. Christmas lights to work yesterday. I haven't put them up yet. And uh, my, I was talking to my mom on Thursday, <laughs> and she reminded me of one of my old jobs, where I, I bought a picture frame from the store, and the sample picture uh, in the frame had the like this cute lady. And I bought that and I put it on my desk. And then when people would ask, like, oh, hey, Merv, is that your girlfriend or is that your wife? I'd be like, no, it just came with the frame. <laughs> and I I need to do that again. And I totally forgot about it until my mom reminded me I did that. <laughs> How'd I fail the mission? What'd I do? Oh, Elian Swan. Shit. Retry checkpoint. Because I'm not sure where that picture frame is. Uh, or I might have taken the picture out and gave it to my sister for a present. Oh, shit. Okay, I'm not supposed to kill her. God damn it. Uh, but yeah. Would it be weirder to have a random stock photo of this couple? Might do that too. That there's a bounty hunter. Get that dumb little boy. Whoa, whoa, she's cutting me up. Come here. You crazy. Stay right there. You are a piece of work. Would be weirder. Now, come here. Rot in hell. Rot with the rest of them. Rot with the rest of them, huh? Well, we got the bounty. Spicy. <laughs> I don't know about that. 
Uh, <laughs> yeah, I need to... I know I have some picture frames, so I'm like, well, I guess I could just... Download a stock photo. <laughs> Somewhere. Well, but I want to do that. I do want to have, like, a... <laughs> a framed picture of a lady on near my computer, and, and people are like, oh, is that your girlfriend? <laughs> no. <laughs> Not just part of the frame. Alright, uh... Let's get at it. Let's turn this bounty in. She's lying. Don't you manhandle me? <laughs> Do it? Yeah, I will. <laughs> All right. Uh, <laughs> It's pretty funny. I kind of want to find the original, but like I said, I don't know if I still have it. Look him over me. Did I just do those things? It's a, it's a horrible blur. But I see blood. There's blood everywhere. It won't come out. I'm not like that. Oh shit! You saw ankles? I promise I am. You believe me, don't you? Don't you, Mister? That's why we covered up the ankles with some rope. No, I don't know. Uh, oh, she's not showing any ankles. I don't want to get reported for I need TOS. Help, okay? I, I have an illness. A fever of the brain. I, I, I've done bad things, but a jail... A jail ain't where I belong. Imagine. A maybe. Get me help, mister. Please? Well, Save I... Me. I did have something Save similar to shower. that happen, Chudos, on... And moreover, from myself. There's the, uh, smelly fisherman emote I made. It was like a fish head with legs. You're such a strong man. Uh, so when I uploaded that early. to Twitch before I had Maybe automatic I had uploads on team. emotes, uh, oh, Twitch me, denied it saying it was too lewd. My so when I put go. shoes on the legs, legs, <laughs> it got approved. How I got yeah, that's the emote thanks, Kitsu. But a big, strong man like that you, got you banned for straight. being too sexual you, without the shoes on it. Put me on the <laughs> And then it was funny, because right around the same time, uh, I have that Be Right Back screen that's just fish swimming around. In the game Abzu. You. You in Abzu, uh, that you game, cut. YouTube had bounty sent me a notice that you. that video was only you. approved for you. mature I audiences. I wish you <laughs> so it's like something about fish. Videos and emos that get flagged as inappropriate. No, I don't think it's. It was just a funny coincidence. But uh, yeah, <laughs> I appealed the YouTube thing. I, I sent a message to support, just saying uh, this is basically just the same type of stuff they would show on a nature show. There's no nothing lewd about it. Uh, I don't see why it's fly for jail, mature guys. audiences only. Anything else you want to try on me? Fish wearing cackles. You're no fun at all. Khakis is okay. I'm afraid I ain't. <laughs> yeah. That was pretty funny. Real good, that girl. A good horse. Good horsey. Let's turn you in. Yeah, I got them ankles on the brain. <laughs> Lord have mercy. Yeah. <laughs> you order a lady killer here, Sheriff? <laughs> yeah, we did. Put her in the cell, won't you? I protest my innocence. I protest my innocence. She might be a little shaken up. She lost another feather out by the falls. Poor dear. They just got a habit of dying around you, don't they, Mrs. Swan? Now, I hope you'll be comfortable, miss. She'll be fine. Now come get your money off the desk here. Yep. <laughs> That's right. Yep. Oh, what do I got here? Jail ledger. Let me 
examine these. Take a look at these. Hang on. Can't I? That's fine. Uh, name. Laster Scranton, age 19. Crime Lashney. This is all just. I don't even read it. Uh, return. Check the list twice. Right. Oh, that, that's all. That's an all naughty list, though. Those folks have been thrown in jail. Uh, I guess we are checking out why twice, though. However, because I highlighted the wrong thing. We got age 19, 18, 42, 21, 50, 7, 16, 35. Derp. <laughs> Take this money clip here. Mm hmm. The Black Widow herself. This town's so starved of women, I'm sure she could find herself a husband yet. Yeah, that's cowboys for you. That's cowboys for you. So it seems this town's got more pressing problems than outlaws. Oh, yeah? We're gonna take some time off posting bounties, impose law and order on the streets. That man has a heart of stone. It's silly to keep me locked up in here. What's going on? I mean, what am I gonna do? Just little old me. Let me out to exercise a little. I'm immune to your charms, Mrs. Swan. It's so boring in here. Can we have some fun, Sheriff? Just the two of us. And to think you were snipping around this office at one point. I'm lucky you was charmed by another. You see, Sheriff, mm. I know your secrets. Didn't throw and your ball. I could spread them all over. Like, <laughs> no <worries. Ms>. Moria, <clears throat> don't worry. Don't go throw your balls. Mention Mora again. <laughs> now hush. <laughs> um, <laughs> show me some sympathy, Sheriff. I'm a widow. A poor little widow. You forget? They can say what they uh, like about you, but at least you respected the sanctity of marriage. Till death do us part. <laughs> Yeah, Overwatch 2, play Moira. Full of cat, scratch my belly, I won't bite, I promise. <laughs> Zenus ain't a crime. Yeah, she was go do some healing and attacking with Moira. Overwatch 2, you got this. But yeah, uh... Uh, Moira's attacks in Overwatch 2 is throwing balls. Moose is in the house! Okay then, girl. Moose is out. Watch out! Morning. Watch out! Moose is in the house. Watch out. Watch out. <laughs> Alright, what is up, Mr. Samus? Good to see ya. We're well. How am I doing? I'm doing good, man. Hope you're doing well. Hey, mister. Okay, that's enough. It's good to see ya. Uh, All right, simmer down. Did you have a good beer? You've had a nice weekend, my friend. Step good to see ya. Judos, go have fun. No watch. I appreciate you. Yeah, Moose. Good to see you, my friend. I know you've been real busy. You're enjoying your time off? Hell yeah. You deserve it. You've been working your ass off. <laughs> That's my little fucking team. Sinsless. The best of the sins. Back at the hotel, the internet sucks ass for wanting to pop in and say hi, Sinsless. Thank you. Sinister 77. Sinister. All the sins and all the sevens. Come on. All, all the sins, all the sevens. Man. Thanks for saying hi. It's really nice seeing uh, seeing you, Sinistar and Sinistress. Uh, <laughs> like liter literally show up in the background of Turnmuck's stream earlier today. And I know it was a big surprise for him because he thought you were coming over tomorrow. And uh, that was a lot of fun. And I'm 
I'm sure you both had a blast. So yeah. And smooth. Man. It's good to see everybody. You did have a blast, so much fun. I imagine, yeah. <laughs> That was a lot of fun. You got a whole month off, Samoose. You deserve it, man. You've been working your ass off. Glad to hear it. The look on his face, I bet. Like, because I was watching his stream and I heard all this, like, giggling and stuff in the background. And, and Charge was like, hey, hang on. There's people here. <laughs> That's awesome. I'm glad you glad you all get got to hang out with each other and uh, with the surprise with Chard. <laughs> uh. <laughs> That's awesome. Priceless. <laughs> Love it. I love it. Uh, yeah, and, you know, something with, like, that just. Because <laughs> it's funny on both ends, because, like, you, is my horse still the one that I first bought? Yes. Well, the same horse. That's still Gibbs. We named the horse Gibbs. Ah, uh, <laughs> still Gibbs. But yeah, the uh it's really funny how Charge totally stuck on you guys are showing up tomorrow and then you Sinistar and Sinstress are in in uh, collusion with Charge Wife. With Rogue. Like now we're we're coming over Sunday. You better be ready for us. <laughs> there he is. My favorite son. The best man of See, you work for a month and a half straight, no weekends or anything, so you said, fuck better. this, time for a major vacation, moose. Maybe. Yeah, dude. You deserve some time off. I'm glad. When's that starting? Is that starting now? And what are we doing mission-wise? We're going to go do something. We're going to do something for Strauss. Uh, Jose, uh... So we're close to Strauss. Let's do that one. Let's do that one right here. Right here. Started last Friday. Nice. Whoa. But yeah, um... Oh, that's awesome. Glad you sent a star sinstress. I'm glad you both had a blast over at Chard's. <laughs> With uh, Chard and Rogue and Seamus, the Delgo. He's a good boy. I'm just glad you're taking some time off work. You deserve it. It's awesome. <laughs> Sheamus is your new best friend. <laughs> he seems like a really cool dog. Sheamus was your buddy hard for like 30 minutes after he showed up. He's like, oh, someone new to pet me. I will be your best friend. And then, it, then he latched on the sisters. Oh, what do we got going on right here? That's awesome, though. That's great. Hello, kid. Uh, this guy. Hey, mister. I just want to be left alone, all right? Okay, I'll leave you alone. You care about this girl? Stand up for but. yourself. She'll come around. Yeah? I've been waiting. Been waiting. All right. 
You do you. But yeah. <laughs> Gotta stand up for yourself there, partner. But yeah, that's awesome. I, uh, I'm glad there a lot of people here having a great weekend. You deserve it. Always something going on, so it's nice to get a little reprieve once in a while. Oh, I missed the uh, the old checkpoint here. What do we got going over here? Search for Thomas Downs. Okay, this is the guy that. Owes me money. How's work? It's just, it's going really well. Thank you for asking. It's been six weeks. Um, and I was thinking uh, on Saturday, yesterday, when I was getting ready for work in the morning, how uh, I actually thought to myself, it's really nice getting ready for work and looking forward to the day as opposed to dreading it. And uh, one of my co-workers, and I think you already know this, but one of my co-workers I work with, I worked with his younger brother at Blockbuster like 20 years ago, which was right across the street from where we are. Uh, he also knows Chard Monk. He played in a band with Chard and went to school with him back you know, since Chard was in high school, and his personality and uh, mine go together really well. Uh, as soon as I started working there, like the second, second and third day, I felt like, man, this is like my new buddy. <laughs> uh, and yeah, all my previous knowledge from. My previous job carrying over to this going really well so it's just yeah it's uh it's i was i was nervous at first i i had different ideas on what it would be like but uh yeah it is awesome thanks for that is hard to find because my last job by the end of it i Pretty much fucking hated it. And, uh... Since it's the same type of business... I was very hesitant. Like, I don't want to do the same thing again. But it's not the same thing. The place is run totally different. And, yeah, it's, it's going really well. I'm very happy. Yeah, I, it's... I feel very fortunate. You're run totally different. <laughs> but no. I mean, yeah. I, they, well, I will say they wanted to hire me since my other job closed down business. They were calling me and wanted me to hire me. Then. Like I said, I thought it was going to be the same old, same old. And it's not. So it was never a question of, like, if I could get a job there. It was more like, Mark, am I going to hate going to work every day? But quit. The answer is no. I enjoy going to work every day. <laughs> and I don't, I've only had a couple jobs where I really enjoyed going to work. One of them was Blockbuster, and one of them was the movie theater, because I was so happy to, like, hang out with my friends at those jobs. And this job, yeah, it's... It's not as fun as working at Blockbuster in the movie theater, but it's, you know, paying the bills and uh, just the whole environment. It's, it's run much better. It's much more teamwork oriented and it's going great. I, I feel very lucky. 
you That's how things are going with this job. Whatever do you want? <coughs> oh, come here, you maggot. Please, sir. I'm I'll... Really? That new blockbuster show. Would you? Oh. Please. I have a family, sir. Please. I don't no, care I haven't watched about it. Your family. Sounds good. That was funny. Why did it have to come to this, huh? Believe yeah. me, sir. I didn't want this either. You ain't such a do-gooder, are you? If you're running out on debts, I'm I'm not running anywhere. I'm I'm I'm, do, I'm doing my best for you. The blockbuster shows on Netflix. I'm gonna watch you it. You are a slippery I'm, little bastard. To check I it out now. Please, please show some compassion, please. Compassion. Strauss told me you needed a beating. You saying he was right? What will that solve? It's just called Blockbuster? People working in Blockbuster? This that sounds awesome. This is not forgiveness of my debt. This is just a stay. Now, wouldn't paying up have been a little easier? Be reasonable. <laughs> <sighs> you borrowed money from my business partner, Herr Strauss. You owe him. You took the money. He wants it back. What's not I'm to beating understand? Him he owes his money. <laughs> Where's our money? I don't have it. Sell your place. We already owe more than it's worth. <coughs> then sell your wife or your family or something. We ain't your idea of charity. Is that clear? <coughs> Thomas! What are you looking at? Thomas! I said what you looking at, woman. My husband isn't well. If we could just have more. Like I said, we ain't nobody's idea of charity. Get us the money. It's funny you say that, Sinceress. I said that earlier. I want my two dollars. Tell your wife. That was a little, uh, a little overboard. I would. I wouldn't say that personally, but uh, I didn't write this. It was pretty savage. Why don't Jill sell another hamster there? <laughs> With all that I am and all that I've done, you're questioning whether I am ready for what I'm about to do. Man, you're really not even close to where you need to be. Really not close to where you need to be. <laughs> I know, man. This game's a little cutthroat sometimes. Follow me, Autobots. Into the crevice. We've got to investigate the source of those energy emissions. Yes, Optimus. Macho Man Arthur Morgan. <laughs> All right, let's got to brush the horse. Horse is a little dirty. There you go. Uh, scratch your neck a little bit, buddy. Then we're going to pat the horse for another... Good girl. Another 30 minutes. This is the this is the stream for the next 30 minutes. You all right, girl? <laughs> Good horse. Go. Oh, oh, you pooped. Oh, how cute. You pooped. A big old foul. Hey, we're the, uh, we're the <laughs> oh, jeez. Horse petting stream. Yep. Horse pooping stream. <laughs> Remember that time I said I'd help the woman get to her house and I agreed and I brushed my horse and she walked away and said, Never mind. <laughs> That was funny. Uh, <laughs> that did happen in this game, like last week, I think it was, where <laughs> she needed a ride because her horse like got sick or something. I was like, "Yeah, I'll give you a ride," and then I started brushing my horse. <laughs> it's time to and as stop. I was brushing the horse, she's like, "Well, you're not gonna help me then." Fine, <laughs> just started walking off. 
Yeah, time to stop. <laughs> uh, uh, how did you get on? Not so good. He's almost dead. And they seem more or less destitute. You were a fool for lending them the money. Well, people who aren't desperate don't seem so interested in my propositions. Of course. Of course. That it? That, that's it? Money lending and other sins. Mission accomplished. Alright, well, we can go. Ch we can do some chopping broccoli. Or more accurately speaking, chopping pine wood grounds. What Arthur Big saying, yup, yeah! Ding! What Arthur Morgan did do is, man! You goddamn Pinkerton, I know it. <laughs> With the Las Vegas of 30 ounces of snake bitters. I pull too much. And then I get tired. You're gonna Fuck wind you. down for a bit? I'm fucking, fucking sick and tired of shit. Fucking shit. Everywhere I go, this fucking shit is driving me fucking mad. <laughs> I, mean, I, I, I live in a $9 million turd. Oh, 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 $9 million turd? Uh, yeah, Sinstress. Thanks for saying hi. Always good to see ya. Uh, yeah, you've had a Pardon very me. exciting day. Would you have any gray poupon? <laughs> Fuck that shit! Paps Blue Ribbon! Sinistar, you too, man. Thanks so much for hanging out, Sinistar. Sinistress saying hi. Uh, always a pleasure to see you both. And, uh, well, I'm talking about all the way to the top, yeah. Unjustifiably in a position that I'd rather not be in. But the cream rise to the top, oh yeah. My dream man is... Stealing me? Bowser. No. It's interesting, that's very kind of you say. One of the yeah. best places on Twitch. You, Mr. Pearson. Well, go on, uh, yeah. You two go on. have a great night. I enjoy your time with... Charred and robe tomorrow. <laughs> Thanks so much for being good friends. You're not Bowser. Nice man. Mr. Rise to the top. <laughs> yeah, you two have a good night, Sins. Oh, yeah. Be seeing you soon. And, uh. Bowser. As to the top, oh yeah. I'm talking about all the way to the top. <laughs> and justifiably in a position that I'd rather not be in. But in Bowser, the rise to the top, oh yeah. The wrestling nowadays doesn't touch a candle for the older stuff, yeah. You didn't shit on me. Who didn't shit on me? Howdy, Dutch? Arthur. Tilly. Tilly. Feeling more settled here now? Yes. This is a nice spot. Well, it'll do us for now. Yes. See you later. Yeah, Dutch is... With all that I am and all that I've done, <laughs> you're questioning whether I am ready for what I'm about to do. Man, you're really not even close to where you need to be. Dutch. Hi, right, partner. Welcome back. Welcome back, Drew. Drew. Nice to have you back, sir. Oh, we got kind of shaved off everything here. We look kind of silly with a, a shadow mustache on. Thanks, partner. What's happening? Uh, what has happened? We finished the gunslinger. Side quest missions. Uh, did some shit, and that's about it. <laughs> we did some stuff with Strauss, and then, uh, like, basically every random encounter I came across. In the meantime, uh, I would encounter or interact with, rather. So, story progression-wise, we have not done a whole bunch. 
Um, oh, we do have this Mary Linton. We talked to her. Uh, that's to go rescue her son. I'm sure you know that's from Mr. Drew. Where, uh, he's joined a, a quote-unquote group of sorts. Uh, Michael Bell from Strawberry. Release him from jail. Javier Escuela. I don't know what that mission is. Yeah, the Hosea. This one is, I think this mission for Hosea allows us to, uh, it unlocks that fence trader. And we can turn in stagecoaches for some money. Come on. Drop the stagecoach, get the money, turn it in for the money. The types of all the types of things and those types of money and things. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, so yeah, maybe we'll do that. What time is it? Uh, been on for about six hours. I think, uh, I think maybe uh, I might take one little more break here. Then about play for another hour. Jamie, come on, Jamie. Jamie, get the stagecoach money. Come on, Jamie, and trouble me on. <laughs> Double me on, get the money for the stage goals. Come on, Java. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> uh, and then uh, we'll do the thing, and uh, we run around, we ride the horses, we shoot the guns, and all those types of things. Come on, Jimmy. Jimmy, do not destroy the dream schools. What do you do? Have them over. What do you do? Types of environments. I don't know. <laughs> I need to watch Turbo Man again. I haven't seen that in a long time. He's like, yeah, send by the comedian. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's going on? Why would you do that? Oh, Kitsu! Kitsurito, come on. I Thank you so much. I'm just glad you're here. But Kitsurito... Coming out of nowhere with... Kitsurito coming out of nowhere with five teams of give my own. We've got... Dead Sassy, Choosiest Jeff, Sick Jake. It's one banana, a.k.a. anus tart, a.k.a. bananas tart. Miss Candle 19. Kitsarino, that's very kind of you. Thank you for that. Uh, come on. I'm just glad you're here. Thank you so much for the extra support. Very kind of you. Uh... I don't, know what I don't know what else to say. Just, seriously. Just, uh, thank you. Thank you and thank you if you did get a gift sub. Kids Rita. Be sure to tell her. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. For the Arnold and Kitty Cat emotes. <laughs> I deserve this for it. Oh, thank you. Good too. That's right, Mike. Fuck you, it's January has been extended indefinitely and retitled Fuck You, It's Forever. Fuck you, it's forever. <laughs> Fuck you, it's forever. Uh, thank you for that. Yeah, I know it Jules isn't very kind. Hey, Razor. Cute Cerrito. That's ghosty with the emotes. Thank you very much. A lot of a lot of good names on that list there. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I uh no, I seriously I just I you all like hanging out. And uh, I don't know. Coming hey across there, here. friend! Come! 
Stop on by for a moment. Stop on by here. Meow, yeah. My name's William. My name's William. <laughs> What's up, William? Arthur, you familiar with the study of plants, my friend? Yeah, are you got any wacky tobacco right there, partner? Well, let me tell you. This great earth beneath our feet can provide everything man ever needs. But we've only reached a tiny bit of its potential. You see, there are thousands, maybe millions of plants. All across this vast country we share. The mountains, the plains, the swamps. I mean to explore them all. Mm -hmm. To know all of nature's bounty and all of her wonder, if I can. Sure. I'm searching for all of nature's man. booty. Would you yeah. consider yeah. helping me with gathering herbs for I'm my joking. Studies? Why? Knowledge, kindness, beauty. Knowledge, uh, kindness, I'm beauty. Ignorant, yes. ugly. And nasty. <laughs> well, let's see if maybe we can do something about that. I'll see. Jazz cabbage. <laughs> a little bit of booty I'm looking up for a plant called yarrow. You can distinguish it by its red flowers. It shouldn't be too hard to find. They thrive out in the open under direct sunlight. Okay, looking for yarrow. I think uh, we found some. Yeah, let's give you some plants. You heard, you've heard of yarrow. Is we found some too. There you go, there, partner. <laughs> Let's see how this tastes. Oh. Oh, yeah. Mm -mm, yes. <laughs> I feel better already. They were right. This stuff does have medicinal properties. All right, cool. What you got for me there, partner? Save it for bad injuries. Heaven forbid your horse is in trouble. You'll be glad you had it. Now, if you don't mind, I'll be getting back to my studies. I look forward to our next meeting, traveler. Sweet. Guaranteed to get you high. <laughs> That's right. I can see why you do this. Yeah, I can see All why you do this. All the best to you. Thanks, Arthur. A and to you. As, as cat. <laughs> Whoa, bro. You don't even know, bro, dude. So fucking high right now, dude. <laughs> so high, bro, dude. You don't even know. Uh, take a bit of natural herb and dance with the giants. He is. He is. <laughs> you can, when you drink a lot of like alcohol in this game, it'll do stuff. This game, uh, I don't. Oh shit, dude, that was so high, bro. I got on your horse, and I thought it was my horse, bro. Dude, don't run away, dude. Come on back there, partner. <laughs> that was just really high right there. <laughs> so I fucking thought that was my horse. <laughs> Uh, so that's how it's that's how things are going right now. Arthur is fucking stoned to shit. Now, come on. Uh, that guy that just smoked us out got freaked out because we I was so high I, I sat on his horse. I thought we were cool, dude. I thought you'd be like, oh no, hey, bro, dude, that's my horse, brah. Uh, it's your own. Instead, he was like, holy shit, you're trying to steal my horse. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, oh my god. Why would you steal my horse? I'm like, oh, I'm sorry, dude. I'm so stoned. It was mine. Chill around, bro. He's running to tell the man what I did. Oh, shit. That's why I'm riding away, riding off in the yeah. opposite direction of the sunset. Because he didn't ask that yep. alert. Oh, shit. Alright, I can work on that kid too. I can get that done. Yep. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, he ran over this poor bird. Yep. Oh, it's a duck. They won't believe him because he's always lit. Possible. It shouldn't matter, though, if he's just high on weed, you know? Yep, sadly for the duck. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yeah, I'll have to make that like a channel point redemption. You know, like 99, or it'd be 100 points. Because right now, what is it? I think it, I have it set up. If it's the 100 point channel redemptions, it's just a sound effect, and anything that ends in a number that's not zero is a, is a little video. Be like, yep. Yep. Easy now. Easy now, yep. Oh, I'm sorry, girl. Alright, now we're gonna pet the horse for 20 minutes again. You okay? He's gonna sit here. Real good, real good. Sure. Yep. <laughs> oh, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's funny. It's an interesting way of putting it, James. Uh, no doubt. I do interesting. Oh, I hear Jose it's talking. Trusting. So well, yeah. please. I know how to work with good people, Seamus, and I work in the right way. They all say that. I never met an idiot that called himself one. Very true. In that case, I'm an idiot. But I know how to get things done efficiently. Look at me. Why would I lie about this? Partner. This is Seamus. He's our new partner. I ain't no such thing. Prospective new partner, if he likes this. Liking ain't the problem. Trusting is, as I said. Keep your voice down. Right right. Way. I don't want my boss hearing. Yep. This is a sideline. Of course. Look at us. Honest as the day is long. Exactly. I tell you what. Let us prove ourselves. <laughs> prove ourselves? To this clown? What you talking about? Good day, Hosea. Good luck with your business dealings. Listen. Uh, he's rough and ready and quick with his tongue, but I swear you can trust him and trust me. I'm an old man. You're not old, Seamus. I'm old enough. And you know why I ain't dead? You don't trust idiots. Exactly. We're not idiots. Let us prove it to you. Yeah. Okay. I'll tell you what. Arthur. Old Bob yep. Crawford and his boys just bought a beautiful stolen stagecoach from upstate. It's in their barn. Now you go get that. And then we can work together. Who's old Bob Crawford? An acquaintance of mine. So you want us to take out your competition? Well, he, he's not just an acquaintance, but a cousin. By marriage, I also want to see if you boys got what it takes. Now, you survived that. Where is he? Well, he's in a farmhouse just northwest of here called Carmen de Dell. Oh, It's just shit. up the train tracks as you're heading up towards Fort Wallace. There's also some money in that house, but that's your business, not mine. But don't kill nobody. Folks know we ain't intimate no more, and they'll know it was me. But you're fine with us robbing your cousin. By marriage. <laughs> and yes, I'd love it. You heard the man. Let's go rob That's his cousin. Funny. By marriage. <laughs> Looks like a Pinkerton. Shoot him. The horse is shooting during the cutscene. I know. That's <laughs> I saw that. <laughs> <It's> like... <laughs> They're just in the background. Just really? pooping everywhere. <laughs> Lead the way. He said the place is just northwest of here. Me? The other one who's been out <laughs> gallivanting around here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is funny. Look out! Look out! Man, see? Better, couldn't you? It's all you wanted me uh, to show some strong arm. <laughs> That's usually how it goes. Yeah, but you know how this works. Come on, Jose. That feather's a joke. And that's why he's perfect. That's the thing in this game. He won't cause us any problems. A safe spot to fence wagons and coaches? That's easy money for us. I guess you're right. Come on, it's not like he's asking us to rob a bank. <laughs> if the two of us can't steal a stagecoach from Seamus's old crooked cousin Seamus, by that's Charles Charmon's dog. Our hats now. 
Uh, it is funny, though. Anytime in this game, it seems like once your horses stop, they start pooping. <laughs> and, like, like you got the cutscenes there. Uh, it's not... It's not a predetermined cutscene, but obviously the horses had to poop really bad. That's some sound command. You're torn between Rich Evans laughing and Rich Evans fucking howling. Well, X2. It's in your name. I think because of your name, uh, if you redeemed one, you'd probably get the other as well. You would get Rich Evans X2 or Times 2. I mean, they model files. <laughs> yeah, uh. I'm pretty lenient on that stuff there, partner. Pretty lenient on that there, Pilgrim. Uh. <laughs> Yes. That's another thing. Um. That must be the place oh, up yeah. ahead. We should go on foot from here. Okay. Okay, Hosea. Yeah. Go on Whoa. foot from here. That'll be an embarrassment. You heard me, didn't you? Rich Evans. We should go on foot. So the question: Can I crash it to? Yes, Kitsu. Uh, I can crash into another horse that's hidden head on, and uh, there was one time I came around a corner and a tree branch was high enough to hit me, but not hit the horse, and I got totally clotheslined by the tree branch. There's the house. I see the barn in the back. Stagecoach has to be in there. If you jump off a high enough ledge, uh, yeah. And yes, your horse can die okay, in this game. Let's take a quick look at the place. Savage punched up there in the elbow. He got it. He nailed him. He got it. He got him. Are we looking for it now again? Uh, Anyone around? Yes. Okay. I reckon we can do it now. I'll head over, distract him by putting on a little show where you sneak into the house, find what you can, then get the stagecoach. Or wait until nightfall. Sneak in, then I'll get the coach. You can try the house. What do you think? See, should we go during the day or during the night? I'm going to say go during the night. Let's wait. Let's wait and smoke some weed. Yeah, at night. That's what I was thinking too, Indy Capo. Okay, let's go. Sure. You go into the house. I'll go find this wagon. Okay, okay. See what goes on up in here. Yeah, yeah. Maybe take a peek through the windows before you go in. <laughs> I love your uh, the Swedish chef emote, X, because it does look like a smoking weed emote. Even though it's a chef's kiss, it, it also it looks like a chef's kiss, and it looks like. Someone holding, like, doing a finger cipher, like, smoking a joint. So. It's good in both aspects. Cook food every day. Dun, 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 dun. All right, we're going to round this heels. Give me that Kentucky bourbon. Chef's kissing weed, that's right. <laughs> Pretty much, here. <laughs> That's a good point. Let's see what we got up in here. What do we got in this chimney up here? We got. Ooh, got some money. 
150 bucks, hell yeah. Here's some shenanigans outside. Uh, I don't need to take this apple. Let's see what's upstairs. Oh fuck, somebody up here. Be quiet. Oh, in the cave, what was that, man? Guys, conked out. Bob Crawford. Crab Bofford. Snoring like a motherfucker. I'm gonna take your shit. Uh, what else we got up in here? Let me think of good places to stash flammable currency. The fireplace is number one. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see, what's Cro Bob Crawford have to say up in here? Now where's the money? Ain't got no money, mister. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Well, somehow I don't believe you. Where is it? In my son's dresser. Get out of here. One of the blurred out options was read. Matching Arthur crossing by him immediately. Howdy. Got a burner. <laughs> Tell me where your family's riches are. Howdy, howdy, partner. Nice to meet you. Yeah. <laughs> the way. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Where am I going here? Did I? Did I not search this? I don't think I did. Alright, total rob $348.89. cents. Yep. Get on, dear boy. Yep. Alright. We'll see ya. I'm on. right here with Get you, buddy. Let's head back. Let's head back. Give a branch. Yep. Got me. Yep. <laughs> Are you shitting me? Yep. Are you telling the truth? Yep. You're gonna crash if you don't slow down. You're gonna crash if I don't slow down. We got everything we needed. Yeah, one of them spotted me, but he ain't going nowhere for a while. Yeah. Arthur. Okay, well let's just get back to Emerald Ranch and finish things up. Slow it down a bit. Slow it down. What are you talking about? We're hauling. We're making good time. We were able to lift from the house. Found some money stashed away. Must be a few hundred, not too bad. Not bad at all. Yeah, yep. <laughs> this was easier than hunting a thousand pound grizzly anyway. <laughs> no doubt. I won't forget that in a hurry. I'm looking forward to your retelling of that one around the campfire. Thousand pound grizzly. Was it the first grizzly. time Mr. Matthews had stared death in the eye, and as usual, he did not flinch. Yeah, exactly. How long you think we're gonna stick around here for? Where are you going? This isn't the way. What are you doing? Get back on the road. Oh shit! I'm not sure. Swerve a silky smooth one. Hello, oh, Vanna, please. Vanna, sure nice to see you. Just need to keep at it. Dutch has a new money chest stashed in a safe spot away Thank from you for the compliment. Away from being full. I hope it's not uh, I appreciate you. Like did in Blackwater. Yeah, Even yep. if we had to dump the money from the ferry, we could have at least got the rest out if it was hidden somewhere. Uh, uh, okay. Here we are. 
Just pull that coat Shit. into the barn there. What the fuck? You're okay. What the fuck happened? We're what stuck. did I what Can the hell what did I run into? This is a thing. Come on. Yeah. Get out head back. The voice that smoked too many cigarettes. And too much in his life. Oh my god. Just waiting on you, Arthur. What did I run into? This is This is part of the fucking stagecoach. What happened? What are you playing? Just get on the damn coach. What am I? I'm playing Red Dead Redemption, Hosea. Just chill out, buddy. <laughs> what the gay programmers did to us, man. <laughs> that was weird. It was like I was just riding along all of a sudden, fucking. Like I hit we a must ball. Be able to go faster than this. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go slow, baby snail. Did I Hello, lose a Seamus. tire? We met your cousins. How was it? No, we're good. Fine. Okay. Nice people. Mm. Park that thing in here. Quickly. We were playing online, let you know. All right. Yeah, I, I've got. I've played online a little bit, but. Not for like six months or something. But yeah, I'll have to hit you up. Uh oh, that's right. I just have to I just have to drive this fucking thing into the barn here. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> what a confusing <laughs> Why am I so confused? Uh, nice work, Hosea. It was mostly Arthur. Like I said, coarse, but competent. Here. Thank you. If you find any other coaches that need selling, I'll see what I can offer you for them. But discreet, you know. Of course. Goodbye, gentlemen. I'm heading back to camp, I think. You coming? Am I on Rockstar or Steam? Uh, for Red Dead, I'm on Rockstar. I bought it through Rockstar. Uh, anyway, nice job, Coasty. And now uh, your character is like Jodie Foster and Maverick? Oh, hell yeah. You can even ride these donkeys if you want. Mules. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> sure. Or what? What did I greet you? Oh, shit. Can you add me? Yeah. Yep. Indy Kippo? Yep. I think it should be the same uh, Mr. Underscore Merv. Indy Kippo. I'll, I'll, if it's not, I'll double check. But yeah. Hit me up, man. Sure. Sure. <laughs> yep, sure. Sure, yep. <laughs> That mission. It's the horse petter. Started a bar fight. Yep. I also I did do some uh, online poker in Red Dead Online because playing against people is better than playing against AI. What the hell's going on over here? Tongs? Oh, he's <laughs> still teasing him about cutting his balls off. <laughs> Bill's a little bit of a, a, little bit of a jerk. Reckon, I reckon you two are made for each other. <laughs> made for each other. <laughs> <laughs> still, uh, still. Uh, still <laughs> He's still egging them on. Run eat some stew up in here. Mm. That stew is gonna 
mushroom, potatoes, carrots, meat. Whoa! Oh, Arthur. You hungry? Always good to see. Mr. Morgan? Mr. Morgan? Let's see what we got up in here. It's chewing tobacco. We got lots of provisions here. Let's see what else we got. Mm -hmm. Canned vegetable. Peas. What else we got up in here? We got bread roll, mm -hmm. canned strawberries, that's fruit. That's not vegetable, canned salmon, that's canned fish. That's not a vegetable. Uh, I don't think salmon's a vegetable. Last I checked. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Um. Time we got. Uh, in game, 12.05 a.m. So it is getting close to bedtime. It's out of Karen. How many of those have you had? Not enough. Not enough. Anyway, who am I to yeah, talk? Yeah, who am I to okay, talk? Okay, then. Well, see ya. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, Arthur. Check yourself before you wreck yourself. <laughs> you okay? Oh. Hello, Arthur. You ain't out of it again, are you? I resent the accusation, Mr. Morgan. Reverend's the highest out of them all. Oh my god. We remember your we wild are? night with Lenny. Yes. Uncle. Mr. Morgan. How are you holding up? That was no joke. I got whiskey in my belly, so I'm good. Yep. Uncle's, okay. Uncle's a little hammered. He's doing good. How about you, hey, Lenny? Hi there. You got a good head on your shoulders. I do. And that's half the battle in this line of work. That's right. So My God. Goodness gracious. Goodness gracious. <laughs> Speaking of Lenny. Goodness gracious. <laughs> sure, Arthur, yeah. <laughs> Uh, shit, we're, oh, that's right, that's right. Here a minute, of course not. How you boys keep Miss Grimshaw. Well, I reckon we're on the turn now. Our luck's turning, we're going to be fine. Right, Miss Grimshaw. Have us, right? I knew it. You've been Never on the run again. For a minute. A sad business when Davy passed. Sad business when anyone passes, but we're going to make it. Sure, Arthur. Yeah. Right. yeah. Of course he will. Exactly, Mr. Williamson. Mm -hmm. Of course he will. He's the ideal. The American this country was set up to create. He'll see us right. I love this. The campfire talks. Alright, uh, we... Go, yep, gonna go. Yes. Oh, Uncle's hammered. That's all right. Uh, over by Pearson's, I think it's over by here. We can get. I might have to upgrade it, but I think we got free beers over here, folks. Got beers right here. Hell yeah. Beer bottle take. Mm hmm. Cheers to you, cheers to me, cheers to Red Dead Redemption and being free. Yeah! Hydrate. Hydrate. I mean, me, me, me. <laughs> Thank you, Kitsu. Only one nerve showed up. Alright, yeah, Andy Cable. Check it, buddy. We're getting live. Yep, we're getting free beers tonight, yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> okay, one more. Four, four ought to do it for now. Mm -mm -mm. Yep. All right. 
I have four beers. That's not too many. Oh, there, I actually think in uh, Red Dead Online mode, if you drink enough beers, you're, you pass out and you wake up in some random spot. Slamming them. Yep. So, okay, now we've got effects going after five beers. But yeah, in Red Dead Online, you'll drink enough to where the screen blacks out and you wake up in a random spot later in, like, the next day or some shit. Oh, Arthur's singing. Yep. What time is it? 2 a.m. It's just so bright out because I think the moon's super full. It's more than half full. You all know that. You all laugh at me, pity, and despise me. I'm sure. He's he's a little. He's a little tipsy. Um. Where's the fucking? Oh, okay, I I do not have the campfire upgraded campfire yet. I'm gonna have to upgrade it in the ledger, I think. Uh, and then uh, what time is it? Wow. I've been streaming a little while. I, I'm not ready to stop yet, but I do have to take a little break. So we're going to take five, and uh, we're going to play about another hour. Another hour long. Yep. And uh, go from there. We're going to play the... Uh, uh, Be right back, folks. For five minutes. Gotta crash out, ghosty. No worries. Have a good, have a good night, man. Have a good night, ghosty. Yep. Good to see you as always. Appreciate you, my friend. The rest of you, I'll be back in just a few minutes.
Thank you so much for the, the biddies. It was very kind of you. Thank you so much. That uh, that's very kind of you. Thank you. My, my uh, can't hit that thing. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna have to make that uh kind of redemption up in there. Up in here. Alright, what are we doing? We are we're gonna get some food. Dude, I think I already got all the food, all the apples and shit I could grab. I did. Alright. All my world traveling uh, and roaming around. Buckle. I spied a fair maiden so lovely. <laughs> and gently to her I did say, Hey, you won't let me ride your ring dang do? <laughs> Shut up, Uncle. <laughs> He's hammered. All right, we're going to sleep through the night here. Right here, what? I know. Is what is what is he talking about, yo? Uncle Uncle's always drunk. Uh, a lot of the characters in this game are drunk a lot, but well, I guess maybe you'd have to be. If you had if you could afford it back in the Uh, one thing we have not checked in a while is our journal entries. We got, what do we got going up on here? Yeah. I love Dutch like a father, but in many ways I love Jose even more. He's kind and fair and like a human. And Dutch is something else. This bear was also something else. Side of a goddamn hotel was mean with it. So that's the whole, the, that's the legendary mirror we came across. Then we got, drew a picture of it, and then we've got, where she were like, mad lady scientist. Deborah something or other. You can be more mad than sane, but I don't have much frame of reference for scientists. Wanted me to see if I could help her find dinosaur bones and send her the details. Maybe. Yes, of course you can ask what I use for mic setup. I've got a microphone. We've been drawing a picture up in an old chicken. Drawing a chicken up. Yep, up here. I've got a, it's, I don't even know what brand mic it is. It's, uh, I was fortunate to have somebody gift it to me. And, uh. It's like a 35, it was a $35 microphone at the time. But looking at reviews, it said it's a very good one for, like, you don't, if you're not, like, professional, looking for professional quality, but you want a good quality mic for just starting out for doing, like, podcasts and stuff, this one uh, had good reviews. And then I bought a, a mic arm, and that's what my mic setup is. Good morning, Arthur. Nothing too fancy. It's not going through any XLR soundboard or anything. Is this good quality mic? Yeah. <laughs> Hi, Mulder. Hello. Uh, Watch the wind yeah. doesn't change. 
I mean, I did spend a time, a, a decent amount of time uh, setting it up. Good day, Mr. Morgan. You know, setting up the settings in uh, Streamlabs to make sure, like, as far as uh, being not be too loud or not pick up every other sound in the room. Uh, it sounds great. Thanks, Kitsu. So, yeah, it's, uh, you can make a, a semi-decent mic sound. You can... As long as you do some research with the settings, you can find a, you can find you can kind of optimize what you have. Yes, what I'm saying. Yep. <laughs> no, I'm I'm glad you say it sounds great. That that's good to hear. Because especially uh, not doing a webcam, I think audio is even more important. Audio is always important. You know, I was sending, I was trying to find a song to send my coworker of a live performance of a band playing a song, and some of the. Is date back like 10 years when they played it live, so more than half the stuff I found sounded sounded like shit. So that was ended up being my priority. It was like, how's it sound? Not necessarily how how's it look. And uh, yeah, it's very important, especially if you don't have a webcam, in my opinion. But you know. Just here to have fun. Uh, should we go? Let's go do Mary Linton's. Mary Linton's mission. All the way up your Cumberland Forest. Or we can do Javier. We can try and free Micah from prison. Or. Yeah, let's go do uh, Miss Mary Linton's. There we go. Now we've got a, a route marked. I mean, Merv hasn't been on cam. We've got a for seven hours. I do have a webcam. I actually tested it out before my first stream and. I was like, uh, maybe in the future. Uh, but it's not optimal. I'd rather have like a little green screen behind me. Yep. Good old David Lynch. <laughs> I do remember a couple mornings. One morning in particular getting ready to stream and I got up and I was like oh my goodness thank goodness I'm not he's in a oh you son of a oh shit game froze oh no I think the game's gonna crash the game's frozen son of a bitch Okay, it's, it's back now. Uh, okay, you can see it. That was weird. For a sec, I was like, did the stream go out too? <laughs> wow. That was different. We Gucci. Yep, we Ghosty. Free Ghosty, have a good night. Did I miss your call of the night, Ghosty? Yeah! I, uh... Yeah, that was weird. That was, it was like a bit of a hiccup there, but we're good, we're good. I'll loot this body. Got 
dollars twenty six cents some Peter cartridges. Mm -hmm. What's that other body? What was that it? I think we're Gucci. We good. I wanna pet brush the horse. A little dirty there, my friend. Let me get some of the dust off of you. You're really responding. No worries. Well, and I, that was probably before I took a break, so I was like, shit. Did that just happen? Okay, there is a dead body over here. We're just gonna loot all the stuffs. Mm hmm. 376 and some revolver cartridges. Actually, I should probably. Uh, when it gets. What time is it in game? 8 6. It's morning. But, um, when we get close to the night. If I'm not near my camp, I think I'm gonna. Throw down a wildland camp and. Make a bunch of split point bullets. And cook up some foods. 44 degrees. It's pretty nippy out. Yeah. 47 now. It's warming up. That is a little nippy though. When it's pretty neat how you can wear different, depending on what you wear, affects whether in cold temperatures it gives you better heat protection or in hot desert areas gives you more suited for that cook up some holler point Let's cook up some holler points yep. watch out there bunny rabbit I don't want to run over that bunny rabbit yeah 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 Bumper, no! I know, I was really trying to avoid running over that rabbit. Yep. Dang, nabbit, rabbit, get out of the way! <laughs> Dang, nabbit, rabbit, get out of the way! Get out of the road! No, no, a lot of rabbits up in here. Yep. <laughs> Oh, I want to have a one of those, man. Who, who, are, who are you? Okay. Who are you? We got Come on. Here. Maybe you can help. Maybe. We're making moonshine, okay? Oh, okay. But our okay. last batch was terrible. Set your teeth on edge. <laughs> With the right ingredients, maybe. Listen. Oh, cat would have driven me some. fucking barker's trying to get you to open the door. What do you think of that? <laughs> That's funny. All right. I'll keep an eye out. Wild tobacco might be nice. Good and earthy. You're in luck. I already have some for already you. I already got some wild tobacco. Go ahead. Throw them into the mixer and we'll see how it turns out. All right. Add some wacky tobacco to the still. Mm -hmm. Uh, how? How? Round on the side of the still. Open the hatch. Round on the side of the still. Mr. Biggums was a force of nature, yes. Mr. Biggums is such a hit. Yeah, I agree. Kitsu, that's such a great name for a cat. Where am I supposed to add the Are shit? Gonna add the plants or not? I'm gonna add the plants. Just how? Son of a bitch, Mr. Bigum, cat extraordinaire. Uh, see that's loot. You don't have all day, senor. Come on. Being a son of a bitch. Mr. Big add tobacco plants. Here we go. It's hot. Watch your f watch your fingers. Okay, so that's it. Now I just gotta wait. I think for well, that. Moment oh, of truth. I guess uh, we don't have to wait too long. 
What up, Mr. Gunny? Good to see you. All right, darling. Let's give this a taste. <laughs> We're cooking up some moonshine. We added a little tobacco. Little, might have been wacky tobacco. I don't know. <laughs> well, it isn't the tastiest, but I do get a kick after drinking this. <laughs> mm -hmm. Very nice, huh? Very nice, yep. Why don't you rest up? We'll brew a big batch of this later. We'll brew hey, a big... Listen, if there's any drink finer than ours, it's what's in that chest over there. Take it. Enjoy it, okay? Well, that's oh. kind, boys. Thanks. Thank you, fellas. What do we get up in here? Each pirate room, we got some uh, moonshine. We've got... And that's it, alright? Take it. Thanks, fellas. Girl. Yeah. Right, girl. Nothing like a life without regulation. That's right. And we're heading to, uh, we're going to go do Mary's mission. Time we're going to get toe up from the flow up. That's yeah. right. <laughs> I've had moonshine once. Uh, that was homemade and it was, I've had it, you know, like lots of, but, uh, it was the homemade stuff I had at a party years ago. It was like gasoline. It was, uh, it felt like I could breathe fire if I stuck a match to my lips, and it was probably that strong. <laughs> it's crazy. All right, what's going up on? Up here, yep. Oh, these fuckers. Gentlemen. Gentlemen. Shell of safety. <clears throat> Shell of safety. Shell of safety. Can I speak to the boy? Arthur? Hello, son. <laughs> Your sister is very worried. The boy has chosen a path, sir. The path to truth. Well, I mean, his sister just wants to speak with him. Arthur, I've chosen a path. The boy has chosen a path. He's chosen safety. Mm. What path have you chosen, sir? Uh... One decided. <sighs> I'm still searching, I guess. We are all searching. Chelonianism is about searching. What do we search for, do you think? Y'all cold? Yep. Search for... Purpose or stupidity? So, do you have an answer? I don't know. Safety? Safety and meaning? Hmm. Jamie. Knows Jamie, the truth. Jamie but knows the truth. Cause me you speak speak with him. With him. Exactly. If your teachings are so great, what harm can I do? I'm. I'm not. Come on, I'm Jamie. I'm not coming with you, Arthur. Just come on, come and Jamie. Speak with me. Get back here. Make, make come on. Mind. Leave me alone, Arthur. I didn't ask for your help. All right. Come on, Jamie. I have to bring it back to the mother. 36 years from Jamie, now, you're reprogramming to be a bodyguard again. <laughs> Get to the horse, come on. I almost ran into those fuckers. Come on. Get to the horse. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Dude, oh, fuck, I didn't mean to kill that guy. I just. God damn it. <laughs> oh no, can I keep up with Jimmy? Come on. 
Oh, he's on a horse. I was like, fuck that guy's. Oh, yeah, you were like, dude, that guy can run so fast, dude. You don't even know. I was like, I think the game's glitched out. That guy runs way too fast. I see him. He's oh, barely see him. He was at the end of the river. I see him there. Yeah, he's center of the screen. You see him. You see him now. What's he doing? Oh, he's he's trying to create a distraction. Oh, my, oh shit! Train's coming right there. Please, Arthur. I'm a man now. I, I found something. A calling. You're just a kid. You're making a big mistake. I'm not taking advice from you. You're an outlaw. You leave me alone. They're good people. Come on, Jimmy. I'm warning you, Arthur Morgan. <laughs> leave me alone. What are you gonna Please. shoot me now? Put that gun down. I warn you, Arthur. I'm. I'm gonna. I don't, don't want do to it. live anymore. Don't Kid, do it. Calm down. Leave me alone. Oh no, we have to draw. Oh shit, I tried to shoot him in the leg. I think he killed himself. Son of a bitch. I'm mad now. I was trying to hog time. I warn you, Arthur. I'm... I'm gonna... I don't want to live anymore. Kid, just calm down. Leave me alone. Yeah, I know. What am I supposed to do here? Retry checkpoint. Am I supposed to let him just shoot I himself? You, I'm, I'm gonna. I don't want to live anymore. Disarm. Oh, I gotta shoot his gun. Leave me alone. I get it now. Come on, Merv. Shoot his gun before he can kill himself. Down. Thank you, Andy Cable X2. Let's go see your sister. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, yeah. kid. Have I been a terrible fool, Arthur? I don't know. I don't know enough about it. But one thing I do know. There ain't no shame in looking for a better world. I miss you, Arthur. Are you and Mary sweet that. on one another again? Oh, no. That's all a long time ago, son. I love Arthur's answer there, where he's... Well, he asked... This wasn't how I thought today would turn out. Am I bad, or... It's been a long time, he's like, Jamie I don't know. You were a kid last but I do time know I there's you. nothing wrong with looking for a better kill world. Yourself. You know... You taught me how to ride a horse. Too well, apparently. Chelonia, though? Really? You'd fall for that? They were very nice to me. They're decent. I'm sure. Please tell me you didn't give them any money. Of course I did. They rely on charitable donations. Jesus, Jamie, come on. Please. I just wanted Jamie, to believe that there might be on. something good coming my way one day. Guess that's dead in the water. With the turtle. Shut up. I'm All sure. I kept telling him was, you won't amount to anything. You're not enough of a man. I had to get away. I couldn't take it anymore. Forgive me, but your father's a bully and a coward. Don't listen to him. Hey, don't talk about him like that. 
What do you want me to say, Jamie? He's a good father? Nice man? He won't be happy I saw you. Please send him my worst regards. Please send him my worst regards. He's right. I'm not good at anything. That's Come not on, right. That ain't true. Tell me something you like. Um, uh, well, um. Uh, Don't think too hard. Apples, I guess. Apples? Apples? Yeah, I love apples. Okay. I was thinking more along the lines of carpentry or horses or something, but all right, go work in an orchard then. By that token, you must really like shooting and robbing people. <laughs> I only like shooting young idiots who run away from me when I'm trying to help them. Father told me what you do. I'm sure he did. Hey, are you still with Dutch and what was his name? H Hester? Jose. Yep, still the same, sort of. And Annabelle and Bessie? I'm afraid they're dead. Shit. Yeah. Maybe Mary did make the right choice. No doubt. But none of it is anything like the nonsense you read in the newspapers. So, are you two getting back together? I told you, no. Just ask me for a favor. You know Barry Linton's dead? Barry Linton. You. He told me. So the door's open, so to speak. That's all in the past. They're different people now. She's not. And you seem just the same. Well, maybe that right there's the problem. She was always too good for me. Now, let's just get you back to your sister. She's waiting at the station for us. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, one thing I really like this about this game, just all the story that's like told just through environmental storytelling and the people people's di characters dialogue. Here we are. She must be waiting inside. Alright. Drop me off to your sister, my former love. Mary. Make it quick or I might run off again. Well, don't be such a Don't be such a worry wart. Make it a mountain out of molehill there. Old stinker. We going in. Red Dead Redemption 2 is very much show don't tell, which is part of what makes it good. Yes. I know. Uh, X2, uh, as you being a huge fan of movies, as much of a fan as myself, You're uh, about seeing her, aren't you? this game does the visual storytelling very well. Jamie! Jamie! Oh, come home! And, Please! Uh, You've. Father's been very sad. Father wouldn't know sadness if it died in his bed. But I'll come home for you. My boy. My sweet boy. Come on. Oh, Arthur. Thank you. Thank you. It's good to see you, Mary. And you, Arthur. And you. Takes great advantage of the medium. Definitely X2. I've... You're... Oh, you'll never change. I know that. Yep. Yeah, yep. Arthur knows it. He'd like to change. Maybe wishes for a slightly different past, but he knows she's right. I feel like the luckiest man alive, and I feel like a fool. That woman confuses me and plays me for a fiddle like no one else alive. I trust I will not make a god awful fool of myself once more, but somehow I imagine I shall. 
Try to keep it civilized this time. Bro. More ads to the old stream list. So many songs to go through. Oh. Right here, Valentine Church. Reverend Isaac Hampton, all welcome. Prayer books provided. What's this uh, plaque say? Storm Survivor, 1998. Shit. That actually makes me think is there uh, a real storm that happened in 1898? In. Whatever area this is based on. Yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. Pardon me. Got anything to sell, kid? More and more folks Step right up, east. Valentine. Step right up. Sorry, mister. Train robbed. 21 dead in tax. Hand over to that. Okay. Am I having fun? Yeah, air. Air razor. Yes. And, uh, yes, I'm glad. I'm glad you're here. Glad you're here, my friend. I always like having you around. Um, I'm just kind of just cruising through the game. What else we got up in here? We got Javier Escuela mission. We got Micah mission. Ooh, the one that was up near Strawberry. Got a couple there gone. Step right up. Arthur Boops into the news. Arthur Boops. You done enough harm here. Hey, look, there must be some confusion. Come on now. Get moving, will you? You don't have to worry about me. You don't have to worry about me. I gotta be more careful. Just relax now. Just relax, All buddy. Relax, dude. Jokester. Just fucking chill out. Hello, I guess. Evening. I'm just gonna follow you around and tell you to relax. <laughs> tell you to chill mister. out. <laughs> tell you good evening. <laughs> hey, mister. There's nothing to worry hello. about. There's just a good dude walking hello. by and just <laughs> telling you to say hello. Evening to you. Evening. you got nothing to worry about. <laughs> good evening. Oh, there is a dog confirmed. Hey there. Hey there. Hello, mister. Howdy. Good evening. You said you were worried about something? <laughs> I don't know why that's so funny. <laughs> Just following an NPC and be like, hello, 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 hey, good evening, sir. Good evening, hello, sir. <laughs> Now muddy as shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. I don't know why that's so funny. Um. Oh shit, there was some... Where's the other mission that was... On? Oh boy, I don't know. Uh... <laughs> Yep, uh, Mr. Murr fell in the mud for karma reasons, and, uh, what's going on right now? What's going on? Uh, <laughs> um, uh, we already watched, the... let's see if it's a new show. I'm actually curious. Going to full wings and pizza, one love. That sounds like a good way to be there. One more. I won that game fair and square. Hope you're doing well. Your move. Oh, shit. There's just a showdown that happened up there. Who else wants some? Got it, partner. Bye. Sure. I'll shoot you. I wouldn't mind some practice. Well, let's get to it then. Oh, shit. I guess we're fucking dueling this dude. Nowhere. 
I mean, you all saw that. He he asked for it. Welcome back, partner. Yeah, gentlemen, Drew, it's good to see you. Yep, yep, yep. I mean, I'm losing karma for this, but you all saw that. Uh, he did a standoff with one guy, and I walked up, and he wanted to go throw down, so we did. Was I in a dueling position, too? Uh... Yeah, once I told him yes, I'll shoot you in the face, pretty much. Basically, he challenged me, and I accepted. And so, yes, uh, the answer is yes, I was in dueling mode. Uh, I will not uh, try and make any excuses for my actions, because I didn't shoot that guy in the face. I did it on purpose. <laughs> however, however, second thought before I read in there. I'm a killer, not a murderer. <laughs> yeah. Yep. <laughs> A killer, not a murderer. Yeah, yep. I would say that is pretty. I would not disagree with that. Pretty accurate description. How'd you do? Uh, I just know Arthur's covered in muddy, dirty shit. So we're gonna take a bath and spend night in the hotel. Where's the horse? Horse is freaking out. Okay, we're fine. Because <laughs> uh, I think, we can, yeah, we can still order baths. Even the clerk's not here. Man, look how dirty. Whoa, the lights just turned on. Uh, this is not the bathroom, Arthur. There you go. So I think I can just, uh, I'm just testing it. Can we just go in the bath and exit and be clean without having to actually scrub our arms or calling in for help? Yes, yes. Yes, yeah. Very clean now. Look at it. Yes. Got a couple holes in his jacket. Okay. And uh, what time we got? We got 11.43 p.m. in game. Uh, IRL, it's 9.32. No lady to clean us. We are made in list. <laughs> I can't get to. <laughs> welcome, welcome. Come on in. Bit Arthur smells like horse shit. <laughs> Maidenless. Kitsu, that is really funny. <laughs> I didn't I didn't use it. Use the power. I I gotta reset the game and do a new build. Miss I I didn't save it the right spot. And I didn't rent a room. That's why there was no room up above that was ready to go. Uh, what's up here, partner? We ran a room pretty please. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Made in less Arthur. <laughs> it's the most difficult run <laughs> in the game. Pistolless Arthur. Maidenless Pistolless. <clears throat> Alright, let's sleep till morning. Five hours. Hill and ring. I'll 
crossover nobody ever knew they'd get. Right. Elden Ring Redemption 2. Red Elden Red Red Elden Red Delden Ring Redemption 2. Red Red Elden Ring Red Ding Red Ding Redemption Red Ding Re Redemption I don't know Red Elden Ding Redemption Thanks for your assistance Thank you for your assistance mm -hmm. Uh Real them ring Come on. redemption. Out of the way. Jesus. What the hell is this? <laughs> out of the way? Come on, why are you so mean? What? Hey, partner. Okay, we, we, let's get rid of that marker on the map. Bug me. All right. Ah, um, uh, Now, let's take a real good look here at what we got going on over in the hill. Well, back to camp. Let's go back to camp. We got Micah. We might got a prison over there. We got Javier Escuela mission. I'm not sure what is involved with that. It's just spiraling into nonsense words. I know that's part of the. That is true. It's like, uh, Relden Ding Redemption. Or, uh, Ringden Elden the Elden Simpson. No no. No no. <laughs> Relden Dark Souls Redemption Ring Three. Okay, girl. <laughs> What's your issue? What? Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, fella. I almost ran into you over. I'll be honest. That was my bad. That was my issue. My issue. You asked for my expired coupon redemption. <laughs> expired coupon <laughs> ring. <laughs> your your rings coupon of rings have expired. Since the expiration and redemption. Coupon redemption expiration two. I don't know. <laughs> um yeah. Yep. My coupons fired in this story a long time ago. Redemption. Half off on Black Friday. Part two. Sale. Sale price. Part two. I don't know. I don't know. That's weird. I'm weird. I get to brush the brush my horse. Brush the horse. I. Too clean. It's too clean. Uh, I'm gonna go. What time is it? In the game. Seven twenty. Uh, it all came to nothing, Miss Grimshaw. Mm, that's for the best. Sure. Of course. I never did like her very much. Shit! I I missed that. Were they turning him out, Mary? We got 726 a.m. I yeah. I'm gonna sleep till noon and think I'm gonna I think I might call it. I wanna keep playing, but I'm here for almost eight hours. Seven twenty. Seven hours twenty minutes roughly. Dinner. Twenty-five 
24 hour stream one love well i uh no no i i have to work i don't have to work tomorrow but tomorrow my sister's birthday we're meeting up so now not happening it tonight but it's nice to see you maybe maybe some other time um but for everybody who's hanging out, y'all deserve a little bit of a victory video. One love. Thank you for the follow. This is for you and everyone who's been hanging out. Thanks, Kitsu. Happy birthday to Merv's sister. Yes, I will tell my sister. Send a happy birthday. Marma. Thanks, everybody, for hanging out. And uh, it's always a pleasure. Thank you for the bits, Kitsu. Thank you for the subs, gift subs. You guys are nuts. Blitz, thanks for the read. Rito, thank you so much for the gift subs. Andy Cable. Arthur. Everybody for everything. I really appreciate it. Uh, we're gonna go raid somebody. 